Panic. Panic. Hello. We're uh we're glad to see that those of you are back. We are still down one person. Um he is currently eating, so we will see him in a minute. What is he like a human needing to eat? I know, right? What's this food that you speak of? What's uh what's what's having basic human needs, right? <laughs> Nothing, what, just at work, trying to check are... out the stream. Hey, man, we're glad for you to stop by, um, especially at work. I don't know how that works at your place, but I know that it can get risky sometimes, so we're glad that you can be here. Let's be honest, priorities. D&D, &D, <laughs> then work. I mean, yeah, that's fair. Work, D&D. &D. Mm. We want to Tough do call. a quick introduction of everyone again, or not? Nah? Um, we should have hashed can. this out before we turned our. We, we, we can. We're, we're still. <laughs> we're still down, JJ. Then we start. We're like, uh, d uh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> wait, to wait, say. how to go? No, <laughs> you don't get to hear it. <laughs> well, thank you for okay. being here, people. All right, who wants to go first? Oh. I went first last time. Those goes. All right. Uh, my name's Ashley. I am. Oh, I dropped my cheese. I am the what? I dropped my cheese. Dropped his cheese. Oh, he dropped his cheese. I am the I am the cheese dropper's sister, uh, and I am going to be Arthur O'Shea in the game. Arthur? <laughs> Don't start. <laughs> Careful, she might say you're pronouncing it wrong. I just I'm just saying what what you say. Super quick. Um, I am Meredith. I play Ayana. I'm a half orc sorceress. Sorcerer. Or is who knows anymore? Oh, should I also just sort of do a third person intro for my in game brother? I should, shouldn't I? You can do it real quick, or I can. Okay. Uh, I'll do it real quick. So, my character, Arthur O'Shea, she has a brother. Uh, Luca O'Shea, and that will be a uh, Adrian when he when he pops up in voice. <clears throat> he will hopefully have differentiation. Anyway, all right. Well, I'm Sawyer, I'm, your turn. I'm I'm Sawyer. I'm playing Colf Durkin. I'm a hexblade warlock, and he's the cheese dropper. And I'm the cheese dropper, dropping all the cheese. Oh man, three second rule. Austin. Uh, uh, there's also JJ. He's not here. He's oh, right. Jasho Nevdrev, a uh, human monk. And, and hi, I'm Austin, the DM. Oh, and then there's Brando, who is yep. Valkyria. Well, he can introduce himself. I'm here. I'm Brando. I play Valkyria. Um, no accent at the moment. And. Um, yet and uh yeah she's a paladin um tiefling paladin so you'll get the accent later all right well do some last minute setup things sorry i've done this in the seven set minutes i had to up. set up set it up set it up too busy with my cheese <clears throat> okay let's go on ahead drop into it all right where we last left off the the six relative strangers uh, had entered greenest as it was under attack from a series of Mass amounts of raiders and kobolds, and seemingly a dragon. Uh, with that, you guys decided to help where you could. Uh, each group, respectively, ah, uh, guided a group of civilians to the keep where there was some relative safety. 
uh, once you arrived, you guys kind of took a quick breather before the governor, uh, Governor Nighthill, asked you all to assist if you would. He'd be willing to pay you. Uh, there were a couple in, uh, pressing matters, one of them being to go to the mill to save uh, their food stock from potentially burning or go to uh, the church of Chantia where there were seemingly more civilians uh, trapped and unable to reach the keep. You guys decided that human lives were more important than food. Food was replaceable. People worked. So, major way there. Uh, arrived, saw quite the force around it, and took it on pretty well head on. Uh, after saving the people inside, you managed to capture one of these raiders who revealed to be a part of the cult of the dragon. Uh, after very brief interrogation, Colth and Arthur led him off where Colth let him go. Uh, after that, you returned to the keep to discuss the next stage of your plans when... Uh, what was his name? Uh, Lang de Rosa challenged uh, somebody to a fight in exchange for some prisoners. These prisoners included uh, the man named Demokas, which Jasho had some connection to. He was the first to run out there, and after giving a pretty good fight, uh, ended up falling. But because of a deal, Colth yelled out to him, a second fight was necessary, in which he challenged Ayana, and then you guys all decided to pelt him with everything. <laughs> Did it totally wrong. <laughs> and he managed, uh, you guys managed to fell him, in which the kobolds tried to pull him away, but Colth, like a mad lad, jumped into the swarm of them to finish him off, and then was promptly swarmed and taken down. It didn't end well. But luckily, Luca was there to keep you from dying. Just stabilized you. And you guys, after the long fight, you guys went to your quarters to rest as the sun began to rise. And as the afternoon now comes, all who rested are now awakened. And what would you guys wish to do? I mean, um, I'm assuming I'm... I'm still unconscious for a while, so. Yes, he's still unconscious, so I would wake up and check on him. I would say you could wake up if you so chose, or if somebody woke you up. I'll get a few more minutes of shut eye. I'm just going to, like, stare anxiously at him. Oh, gosh, that's going to gonna be up. terrifying to wake up to. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just sure really worried about you. There's a six-foot-tall half-orc standing next to my bed staring at me while I sleep. You are saying yeah, that no, this is the next morning? She's sitting. This is technically the afternoon, I believe, because we yeah, turned in as the sun started the to night. rise. Yeah. <clears throat> Fair enough. All right, yeah, well, so I'm just waiting for him to wake up. I, I'll be going through my... Uh... My morning routine, which is to try to get my hair, my curly hair, in some sort of order. Um, and then go find water to wash my face. Okay. What is this hygiene thing that you're, you're so <laughs> preoccupied with? Yeah, this is the Middle Ages. Nobody cares about hygiene. <laughs> Keep smells horrible. But you don't. There we go. Uh, I just worry about me. Uh, Vol Valkyria is just doing what she needs to do to um, get prepped. Um, making sure she knows the spells that she's planning to use for the day and all that jazz. Did we get a clear... We didn't and get a clear idea of what we were needing to do next, did we? We were just told, okay, you're gonna, I need you guys to do something else, and that was it, right? I said, I have another favor for you. 
Yeah. Whenever you're ready. I believe that's all he said. So. Yeah. yeah and, oh, and then as soon as Valkyria is done, she of course goes up and just stands watch over the gate. And um, well, I guess how how long does it take for me to find water to splash on my face? Yeah, uh, in the keep doesn't take long, but there are a crowd of people around it because this is still a safe house. Oh uh, yeah, public bath water. But now, if you so chose, you could walk down to the riverbed. That's, that's still a bit, well, I guess it wasn't that far. No, you, you can I, bring up the I map care. of Greenest. It wasn't that far. No, nah, it, it's not that far. It's probably. No, oh, I didn't pull you guys over there. It's a, it's a, it's a moiled inconvenience. So, I care enough. So I'll go. Yeah. At, at the quickest oh. point, probably take you maybe ten minutes to get down there. Okay. Oh, she, uh, you step outside the walls and you can feel the warm sun as it's been daytime for a bit. And looking up, <sighs> it's definitely at a guess around two ish, three ish o'clock. Uh, and you can see there are many, many people working on rebuilding at the t- as of right now. Uh, Joshua probably would have gotten up a little bit earlier than everybody else and gone to find the uh, the old man. Uh, make sure he's doing okay. You, you get up a little bit earlier and you can see he's he's bandaged up and he's kind of standing outside, not really in the best shape to help out with people and rebuilding and mm-hmm. finding things. So he's just kind of supervising. Uh, and he sees you approach, he goes, ah, good to see you didn't die. Yeah, barely. <laughs> so I just like try to stretch a little bit and just wince. My shoulder's still probably just a little effed up from oh, yeah. Yeah. the fight before. I heard you had quite the duel of sorts. Well, you know me, it can't turn down a good fight. Ow. <laughs> And how are you holding up? I mean, he kind of looks down at his bloody bandages. He's like, I'll manage. There takes a little bit more to knock me down. Yeah, you're a tough old bastard, aren't you? I get knocked down. God, as long as I can move. Well, I'm hard to hit. Still pretty spry, and he kind of hops a little bit and then winces and stops. <laughs> no, stop. It's I know. You don't have to prove anything. All right, just sit down. Nah, I gotta stand. Look like I'm doing something. <laughs> all right, all right. You seen the kid anywhere? Ah, uh, actually, I haven't. He... I have no idea where he might have been. He's probably out cold like you were. All Had right. a bit of a long night himself. All right. Good to know. Where do I? Who do I see about food? I'm starving. Um, and he kind of looks around and goes, uh, "Let me find." What was his name? Escobert. That's his name. Let me find Escobert, and I'm sure he'll have something for you. All right. Trods off. Yeah, I'll I'll try to go find Escobert. Uh, he you find him pretty quickly, and he's standing talking to Night Hill, and a another man who you you don't recognize him. Yeah. Uh, and they kind of stop as you approach and. Naito looks at you and goes, Ah, uh, can I help you with something? Or are you here to get your payment? Food. Food. (laughs) He goes, There should be 
some downstairs. And if not, he looks down at Escobar and goes, Can you get the cooks to make something for them? All of them? He goes, All right, I can do that. And then he goes, Follow me. All right. I follow him. And he takes you down to the main hall to where there's little leftover bits of food, not like a large amount. And Kang goes, Bow. Ah, get a hold, tell the cook. And he walks back behind through a door. Then you can hear the faint sound of him yelling things. And then comes back out and goes, be ready in about half an hour. Where's the lamb sauce? <laughs> Where's the Where's lamb sauce? sauce? <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna... Is there like an eating area or is it just kind of like it's like a weird buffet tray that goes okay. down for a bit, which is fey bits of food, and then there's a few like little chairs and tables, um, but there's like not very many. I'm gonna go sit right over here, and I just like sit down and I like put my head on the table with my arms crossed, just like lay there for a little bit All right. until the food's ready. Ah. All right, I guess I'll I guess I'll I'll come to at this point in time. At this point, you kind of. Up and you can see Ayana staring at you. Oh my Hi. You're awake. Y yeah. You really took a, a, a big beating yesterday. We were really worried about you, but don't worry. You, I t made sure that you got inside safe, and I tucked you in, and even read you a little bit of bedtime story. But now you're okay. Oh, I was worried all night. This, this, this. While this is going on, Colt is just exasperated. Like, I just met this person. Like. Four hours ago. <laughs> <sighs> or I guess it's like 12 at this point, including the eight hours of sleep. Yeah, I mean, it, it's probably pushing at the most 16. Gotcha. Just a, less than a day ago. Definitely less than 24 hours. So I'll, I'll sort of... You say it like it's a bad thing. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, I only knew this person for 24 hours. Gosh. Uh, I'll sort of uh, like sit up in bed. And is like is my sword near me? Uh, put yes. it at the foot of the bed. Yeah. Okay, so I'll uh, I'll sort of hobble over to the end of the bed, and and like tie my sword on just so I have it. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you for pulling me in. Uh, Do you need some water? No, I'm I'm fine, thank you. Um, where are the others? Um, I don't know. I've I've been here with you. Is Josh, uh, well, I was going to ask if Josh is okay, but if you've been here with me, then... Oh, he's okay. I healed him. Oh, perfect. But I'm sorry I didn't have enough energy to heal you, too. It's fine. He took the beating first. I could... Just not going to mention the healing potion in my pocket right now. <laughs> <laughs> just, just don't worry about it. It's okay. <sighs> well, maybe we should go try and find the others. Let's. Let's go find the others. Right. You cool. step out into kind of this main hall area to where the, you can see there's still a few people. There's not like as many as the night before. Uh, off to the side, you can see Jasho sitting with his head on the table of a long table. Uh, He's not dead, is he? Do you go over there and poke him? Sure, I'll go over there and poke him in the shoulder. Not well. Actually, I don't know if he has a bad one, so I'll, whatever. Ow! Ow! Ah, ow. you're alive. Okay, don't just making touch, sure. Don't touch that. Uh, How are you feeling? Everything hurts, just a little bit. You know, nothing new though. I can give you a massage if you want. No, don't. She touch. gives excellent massages. No, don't touch. Don't touch me. I'm just. I just need some food. Probably need some drink. But I'll be fine. I have water. It's a little no. early for drinking, don't you think? Listen, it's two o'clock in the afternoon. Y yeah, my my point still stands. What are you talking? This is like three hours past when I would start. Anyway, and never mind. Anyway, <laughs> fair enough. To each, to each his own, I guess. You would have came back if you chose to go back to the keep. Me? Yeah. If you chose to go back. Oh yeah, I, I would have come back, and I, 
I would have start started looking for Luca. Where's Do the... I see her as she's walking like back to find Luca? Yeah, you kind of see her walk in and okay. Arthur! Look so Arthur! And I'm like waving oh. <laughs> across the keep. Oh, I do a sort of awkward like, hello. We're going to have uh, some breakfast I... if you guys want to join us. Uh, well, sure. I wouldn't mind that, but I'm just, I'm just looking for Luca. Have you guys seen him yet? No, I haven't seen him or Valkyria. Where is oh, Valkyria? Well, I, she's up on the parapets. Ah, her normal station. Got it. Oh, yep. I should have thought of that. <laughs> okay, well, I'm... Did anyone see which room he went into? No. can't remember which room. Uh, I certainly didn't. Left? The what? The third door on the left. Just try it. I'm sure... <laughs> you... How lucky left. are you feeling? No, don't All right. go into random rooms. <laughs> nah, <laughs> I'm doing it. Knock it's first. happening. Knock first. I, I was joking, I was joking. Just ask someone. I jiggle the handle on the third door oh, no. to the left door. <laughs> Jiggling the handle is not knocking. <laughs> that was more of a Meredith comment than anyone comment. <laughs> Jiggle the handle. And nobody Hello? answers. Hello? <laughs> then eventually, my head pops through and he goes, Yes. It's not Luca. <laughs> oh, sorry. Uh, hi. Wait. Hello. Is he... <laughs> How good Naked? looking is he? Oh god, no. Oh my gosh, Ashley. <laughs> <laughs> the thirst never this. dies with her. What is this? Is that, uh, that's he her? is very, very unattractive. At 10, he's a 1. He's, he's like a homebody. Is that him? Uh, he... He definitely doesn't fit with who would be staying in a keep. Yes. Uh, while she's looking for Luca, I'm going to go run up to grab Valkyria. I will follow Ayana. <clears throat> okay. So wait, sorry, I got cut out. He's not he? attractive. He's a one. He's not? Oh. Okay. Oh, eh, sorry. And then I walk away. I just... Beauty's in the eye of the beholder. I'm sure he was a very nice person, and I mean, we didn't even give him a chance. Hey, the last time you guys encountered a beholder, she died, so... That's very true. <laughs> <laughs> she just kind of walks at you and just stares at you as you leave, and then shuts the door. Listen. The thing you need to know about Arthur... She is... Kind of shallow. The thing you need to know about Arthur is that... Like... All of the Amazon River couldn't satiate that thirst. All right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, did you can eventually I find? I because... just went to go oh, do okay. what I do. I was helping the sick and you know, oh, well, dying the wounded. Did you yeah. did you eat breakfast yet? Not hungry. <sighs> nope. I. Grab him by I grab him by his sort of cloak and I start like tugging him towards the where everyone else is. Like you need to eat breakfast. You're but doing I all can... that magic. You're doing all that energy th drain and stuff. I could do more breakfast. here than with two. I I don't need to eat. I I'd rather just be helping people right now. Right, but if you don't eat, then you can't help people. I'll be fine You'll on the bare minimum. Up. I'll eat scraps. Don't worry. And there are like three other people helping you out, acting as kind of healers of sorts. Uh, fine. I will. Uh, I'll bring food to you. Don't worry about it. I'll. I'll be fine. Uh, it just. I always worry about it. Uh -huh. She walks off the food and as you finish this uh, the food starts coming out and it's a very very modest breakfast uh, eggs and various breads and what meats they have uh, 
And Joshua he, is inhaling, <laughs> just like Kirby style. The, the yeah, the Kirby style, just like. <laughs> 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 And all. everything's going in. The very unattractive man is the one who's setting the plates down. Oh, and that's kind of awkward. Did you make this? Yes. This is the best food I've eaten, like, ever. Oh. You can see he was about to say something, and when she said that, he goes, Yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. And it's just like completely mediocre eggs, like no seasoning. They just been like that, like mass, you know, that like that it's like church style, right like you have that giant griddle and they're just like, all right, scramble the eggs. And it's just, it's just like a flat top at a diner. Yeah. And it's just, just a whole bunch of scrambled eggs, no salt, no pepper, no nothing on it. It's just literally just egg. egg. And it tastes it's, delicious. It's like a buffet to where like, it, it's not good food. It's serviceable uh, and it's a decent. So amount. it's like the continental breakfast at Holiday Inn. <laughs> yes. Gotcha. Yes. <laughs> oh dear. Oh wait, yeah. did anyone get Valkyria? I am up there with her right now. Oh okay. See so all that I miss when my Discord decides to drop out on. Me. Just get good. And on the parapet, Valkyria is sitting there, standing out in the warm light of the sun baking you as you can look out and see various people rebuilding and moving and you could see some people transferring the dead around uh, putting out leftover fires it's definitely a process that's going on and uh, Colt and Ayana walk up to you Good morning! Or afternoon! Sounds pretty high. It's probably afternoon. Uh, do you see this out here? Do you what? see these dead that will be taken? My goodness. Uh, we need to destroy all these evil that have done this. Well, we can only do so much in 24 hours. Yeah, we can. we can do our best to make this town better and and but we can't do that on an empty stomach so you ready for some breakfast food i guess i guess i do uh, at least we destroy that half dragon uh, there are probably more like him more where that came from i'm ready to kill more well last sure night he's the only one last night didn't exactly go very well but i admire your tenacity <laughs> Let's get this food. Let's get this bread. Get this bread. <laughs> uh, while I'm we're like skipping, while yeah. we're walking back to the keep, I'm gonna lag behind Ayana a bit and just let Ayana sort of like skip ahead, and I'll try to chat with uh, Valkyria. Do -do -do -do. Um, I know that we didn't get off on the best of feet. Um, there was quite a bit of bickering between us, but I just want to say. Thank you for having my back last night. When I... Yes. Uh, this is difficult for me. Yeah, you don't exactly seem like the friend type. No offense. No. You were brave. I trust that. I will not call you idiot anymore. Progress. I'll take it. Let's go get some food. And uh, yes. I'll keep walking towards the key. Yeah. You guys eat. Uh, some of you faster than others. And as you guys start to wind down, uh, Governor Nighthill enters. And in front of you, he sets down a back. In front of each of you, except for Luca, who is not at the table, but he sets a second one down uh, next to Arthur. I just start. Um, it's Arthur. Stop it! Uh, What's this? Uh, your payment for assisting. I asked you guys to do a lot, and the least I could do is give you an increased hazard pay. 
We were getting paid for that? Hooray for independent contracting. Yes. I wasn't going to make you guys do those dangerous things without compensation. Look at me, I'm so, I'm adulting. I've got a job now. <laughs> and there's more where that came from, <laughs> if you're willing to help me again. Got quite another tall order for you. Well, well, first of all, how much is in these bags? Do you open it to count, or are you asking him? I'm asking him. Rude. You can't ask that. <laughs> he turns to you and goes, there's 200 for each of you. <gasps> Copper pieces? Gold. Oh, Gold pieces? <laughs> I like fall out of this, <laughs> off the bed. <laughs> Arthur feels like her eardrums have just been blown out. Uh, that that was... I'll, I'll sort of try to like... Fair. I will Fair. helplessly try to help Ayana back up onto the bench with my ten strength. Yes. <laughs> 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 What's this? I will hold on to some of yours for Ayana. Okay. What's How this? much do you want? I will hold on to a hundred of yours. You do what okay. you will with the other. Here you go. Give I'm very thrifty. I come up for my food, just oh, like mouth semi full, just like yeah. She, she just spreads like all the more. <laughs> Fair enough. That reminds What's... me. Did we pay for this food? No, it's. It's completely on us. Do not worry. It is hard. Yeah, I, okay, I look at Ayana and I go, complimentary breakfast for staying at the keep. The nicest people. The greenest in the greenest holiday Very inn. Very generous. Okay, but what is the tipping culture like here? Oh, it's uh, <laughs> it's, it's it's actually really high. It's like twenty percent. Like, uh, like a high group, big group we have here. Yeah, you got that. Yeah. Yeah, like, they but you have, to, you have to realize, though, 20% of zero is still zero. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's like it's like 20% of the implied cost, so... Oh, well. We'll figure that out later. In the meantime, right. what's this uh, What's this task you have for us, Governor? I want to know why I, my town was attacked. They retreated to the northeast... If you can track them down, find where they're staying, I'll pay handsomely for that info. And if you can... Is there a cave in the northeast? I think there's a mountain with a, a small mount with a series of tunnels and caves through them, so I presume that might be where they are. Would this I is know where we go. If there's a uh, cave up there, would I know uh, any information about that? Make an intelligence check. <laughs> Big brain. <laughs> right, right. Does he get advantage because okay, he lived here? Time. I'll give you advantage because you did live here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just an just a regular intelligence check. Yep, just straight intelligence. Uh, that's enough. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, minus two. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <what? laughs> He's pretty I told smooth. You brain. Tell just my dumb stat. I'm an idiot. I got <laughs> uh, you uh, are you idiot. Can, you can faintly remember it's been a while since you ever even went up there. Uh, there's a small mountain with a series of caves up there that also that kind of almost makes a small cove in the mountains and plateaus there. Uh, has several series of tunnels, some of them lead to the other side of the small mountain and some of them are just small little uh, holes in the wall the rock and some of them are expansive tunnels uh, you haven't explored them too much but you have been up there uh, yeah i think i know where they are let's I've, do this i've been up in those zero let's go well let's go. What, wait, wait, let's, wait. Let's, wait. let's let's think about we this for a second check on the horses and we need oh. to prepare some of us have limited uh resources that are was, kind of vital. Was anybody paying attention to which way the dragon went last night? I was kind of unconscious, so I didn't see it. I was also not paying attention. Um, Ayana would have... Did, I, or, uh, did Val I see it? Valkyria? I, I can't remember if I saw it or not. Or I feel... Valkyria, you didn't even see the dragon. 
What? Yeah, we all failed our perception check, so we have no idea. The o the only people who saw it were Jess. Oh, you said where it came from. I I, I thought Wait, no, you Lucas where they were taking it. Oh, Lucas, I guess he killed everything. Luca would have seen the dragon, uh, and with let me see his pass it real fast. So Lu Luca, Joshua, and I were the only ones that saw it. Yeah, and like, the three of us were, were pretty preoccupied. Yeah. Um. Wait. What do you mean? Okay. Whoa. whoa, whoa. I th I feel like we're. What do you mean you were preoccupied? Well, I was unconscious. No, 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 no. So the only time we saw it was when he came in, right? We killed everything. Well, we no, there was a. Was going. But but there was a yeah there was a flying dragon the whole time we were here, and that's the one that Colt yeah, is you guys, asking about. You guys mm. saw it. You entered the keep, uh, and, and it kind of you guys would be able to see it periodically as you travel through the town. Uh, only Luca would have noticed it because he was the only one with a fast perception high enough. Actually, wait. Arthur, you might have. Yeah, Arthur, you would have okay. seen it too. Uh, it did not head to the northeast. Oh, well, that's a relief. Uh, it pretty well hedged, headed straight north. Straight north? Straight yeah. north. Uh, straight north. All right. Are there? So I'll ask the governor. Are there any caves straight north, or is it just uh, grassland all the way up to Elturel? Well, straight north would be the green fields into small, well, relatively small forest, and from there would pass Elturel and then to the rest of the Sword Coast. <sighs> Yeah, we got no idea where that thing went. <clears throat> uh, you have pretty well a fair amount of the continent northward. That's... But if you can also bring back the lost valuables, I will see what I can come up with as extra compensation. But I'm willing to pay you an extra uh, 200 gold to find out why they're attacking, where they plan to strike next, how many, where this camp is at. That's a lot of money. <clears throat> I don't know if anyone has already has told you yet, but um, it's definitely something to do with Tiamat. Hmm. Why does Tiamat have something to do with this? I mean, I get the dragons, but... Well, how? the cultist we interrogated said that they were a part of the cult of the dragon. And that you Tiamat, uh, uh, politely, <sighs> wish you would have brought him back. Well, we got what we could. He wasn't going to give us anything else. Fair enough. Trust I me, guess. Valkyrie I here gave get... him the knee. I I give Kulth sort of a stink eye, but I, that's it. I totally ignore it. Um, but if you guys accept this, I'll try to scrounge up what's supplies I can to help you, whatever you might need. Well, we'll get back to you. I need to sharpen my sword. Feel free to give me your answers. Will do. Within the hour, we'll give you an answer. I, uh, I sort of pack up have... some of the leftover food <clears throat> and I... I go back to Luca to give him some food. I turn to the Turned to the guy before he took off. Do you have a blacksmith in this town? Uh, yes, I would presume he's still alive. I hope. Fingers crossed. I, I can need him. him. I should be just south of the, well, not south, uh, west of the keep. Not far away. Okay. I must prepare. I'll go with you. And Valkyria is on her way. So Ayana hopefully followed quickly. Yep. Uh, so I'm I'm still at the table with Joshua. That's it. It's just me yeah. and Joshua. It's Joshua Kirby next to me and I'm thinking. <laughs> cool. What plate are you on? I'm just imagining on? like that SpongeBob meme where like he's sitting at the table by himself. Yeah, like his, right his, his hands are clasped and he's just... I don't... <laughs> I don't 
count. Like, you don't count at all, or You're like, focused. you can't count above a, a certain number? <laughs> Do I look like an idiot to you? I mean... Colt just, just sort of like... Oh. That red is two, though. Shut up. Fine, we all have jump stat. It's fine. We all have jump stats. Sometimes some of us is just really low, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, no no worries. And I'll sort of like gently pat him on the back. Like I'm I was gonna just give him a good pat, and then I was like, wait. So just sort of like lightly tap him on the back. So you're also very sore as well. Yeah, so that's why I'm like Ugh. pat pat. You've oh. got plenty of little stab wounds across you. <laughs> little stab wounds. Just little pokey cobalt stab it's wounds. Freaking yeah. cobalt prison shivs, yo. It's the sharpened toothbrushes, I'm telling you. That's just... Yeah, those yeah, those yeah. things really suck. Minus the toothbrushes. They're just sharpened. Yeah, they're just knives. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so, after Arthur goes over to just sort of set the food as close to Luca as possible, um, she's going to start looking for uh anyone who's part of the did i write it on my character sheet yes the one root associated yes. with uh i'm going for i'm gonna try to find an agent of the harpers uh, okay make me an investigation check for me yep Uh, you sit there and kind of using code phrases and just kind of trying to gauge people's reaction to whatever phrase you say, trying to signal. Uh, eventually, you uh, say it to a young man who's injured, and he kind of looks up at you and goes, So you're one of them. All right. Good to hear. Then, How many of ours were here? Well, that's the thing. The only other one that I know of. He's been captured. Captured? Yeah. He's... He was, specializes in research. And he... Thought he had a break and that's why he came here and and the attack happened and now he's been taken away and we know for certain he's still alive i certainly hope he is man yes what was he researching do you know he he was researching various dragons and iconology and the sudden influx of raids here in the green fields. And that led him here. Oh. If then he would know the significance of, of this place at least for them building up Tiamat's horde. I presume he was he was so confident that this new cult was to blame and that they were trying to cause something big. And now he's gone. Who am I looking for when I go search him, like, appearance-wise? Uh, he's a... Let me find him. Gotta look for the hood. Uh... He he's a health heaven fellow, like you are. Uh no he's a not to be rude, a little more scholarly. I'm making a bit of assumptions, but he his name is Leosin Irithan Irithar. And I don't know if you would know him or not. If you want, yeah, well, feel free to make an intelligence check. Oh, okay. 
Uh, yes, you recognize him. Let me refine this stuff. Uh, where'd he go? Not there. Oh. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Find him. Where did he go? I lost him. Uh, Basically, you would know he's a harper uh, from Burdusk. Uh, he and basically, oh, there he is. Uh, and you would know that he's been one to research uh, various activities that would pertain to dragons. Uh, and what was his name again? Uh, Leosin. Uh, Erlenthar. Erlenthar. E, uh, e R L A T H A R. Yep. Um, so you, you would know that he's just a very scholarly person who specializes in uh, dragons right. and their activities. Well, you've been a great help. Oh, I'm sorry, what was your name? Uh, name is Nissim uh, Walladra. If, if you go seeking out these raiders and you find them, please bring them back. He's very, very necessary. He has most of the research oh, after all. <laughs> Certainly. Well... Just be on the lookout for an Arthur Shea. It's uh, that's an Arthur. Not I've had too many people already. Anyway. Arthur. Arthur. Yes. Yes. Okay. I'll go by what I think you mean, and not by what you're saying. Thanks. I think. Kind of nods and he. Um. Well, uh, get better. And <laughs> she just walks away. <laughs> Gives him a get well card. <laughs> Meanwhile, back in the keep. Yeah, it's cult. It's cult. You know, like like Arthur. Shut it's cult. Shut up. My goodness, you guys. Uh, we will go to Ayana, Valkyria, and the blacksmith real fast. Oh, wait, before we get there, Ayana definitely couldn't have walked all that way in silence. Um, <laughs> Fair I, enough. I'm like, so, so what are you thinking about this whole going on another mission kind of thing? I can do this. We must destroy this evil. I mean, I don't like evil in the world any more than you do, trust me. Uh, especially when it comes to Tiamat. But... Yes, that kinda... too. This is against your god. I mean, I'm here my to help dad's you. god. But that brings me back to main point. Um, I don't know where my dad is. And we're going to have a much better time trying to, trying to fight these bad guys if we can get the followers of Bahamut behind us. Yeah. I think we should just... Go to El Terrell, get some people to help, and then come back and beat the bad guys. Because mm. you're strong and stuff, but, I mean, there are probably people that are, like, so much stronger than us in El Terrell. I mean, isn't... I wonder, maybe we can even find some of those, those heroes? They get heroes for a reason. They, they name heroes for a reason, right? They gotta be super brave and tough and strong, and they'll definitely kick butt. Yes, well, this Goth, he seems to be good. Uh, yeah, he's good. We know where they are now. We must attack. Then we can go get more resources. This is a small town. This is a small group. We need more information to bring to your father, to his people. Okay, but after this, we go to El Toro? Yes. 
Okay, I'm with you then. And then we get to the blacksmith. Yeah. You enter it, and you can hear the sound of banging. Bah. But you don't see anybody immediately. I look for I, uh, Valkyria. She like <laughs> looks for some sort of thing on his desk that might uh, like a bell or anything. Is there anything? Uh, yeah, there is a bell with a small hammer. <laughs> he takes that hammer and just like whacks the bell, nearly cracking it. Uh, you sit there and just kind of smack it, and it dents real good. Uh, uh -oh. <laughs> hey, here. This is why we can't have uh. nice things. <laughs> Somebody there? I'm sorry we broke your bell. Oh. I <laughs> that over my mouth. I didn't mean to say that. You're not the Raiders. Good. Because they wouldn't have apologized. And you see the door open. Well, not really much of a door. It was more of just kind of like a half door. It kind of pushes open and falls back. <laughs> and <laughs> you can see over the desk a halfling man uh oh, very tanned and with some very obvious burn scars he looks up goes uh what can i help you with we are hunting down these horrible raiders i need i have this armor it is too big for me i need you to help me size it and you kind of set it down and he goes Oh, that's a lot. Uh, <laughs> I can do it, but you're really big, and I'm going to need some help. Uh, one of you guys care to help, or should I go get somebody else? Uh -huh. I can help as well. Fantastic. Uh, and he begins to kind of bend the metal and shave off chunks of it uh, to make it fit you. Uh, Ayana, I want you to roll me... Uh, what would be a good one for this? Just roll me a... intelligence first. Lots of intelligence. Time to show off our big brain. Uh, that's safe, but still plus you no matter what. Oh, oops, sorry. My bad. Like I said, it doesn't matter. Same modifier. Uh, so you can assist in the best way, and you can like notice he's missing some things, and you kind of point it out to him. Uh, unless you choose not to point it out and just try to fix it yourself. Oh no, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. <laughs> uh, you kind of point these things out. Goes, oh my bad. He bends it back. Sorry, I don't mean to be a backseat driver, but yeah. No, no, no. That's why I asked for help, because I'm going to miss things, because this is big. What's a I mean, driver? I'm a lot taller than you. I have a better vantage point, you know? It's... Yeah, you see things a little bit better, because I'm stuck just looking at upwards. I can lift you up if you want. For the back half. That'd be great. <gasps> okay. Because uh, part of this process is putting the armor on Valkyria as he goes along and he eventually gets to the back goes and just kind of lifts his arms up <laughs> i pick him up do you have to roll for it or am i good no with he's it? very light <laughs> uh, just kind of carry him over there and he kind of starts moving and bending things and shaving things and he just kind of goes a little bit lower Okay. Hey, is that better? Yeah, yeah, like that? Oh, there we go. Okay. It's like a cherry picker. <laughs> <laughs> and then after about an hour's time, the splint mail is fitted to you. So. Wow, that's really good on you. Thank you. I was, oh, ah, I didn't discuss payment. I forget that every time. Uh, it's not a lot. Uh, only two gold pieces. I pay for it. Can I? Wait, can, uh. <laughs> <laughs> I like, Thank you. She You're swats the coins down. Nope, swatted. Swat. <laughs> coins have been swatted. Do you take? Uh, do you take trade as well? I have this chainmail. I have no need. I mean, it's a little more than necessary, but yeah, I can take that. 
if you want anything else made, this chainmail will probably cover it. Uh, hey, DM. Hey, what? <laughs> <laughs> what would I ask for to be made? I'm a little blank here. Uh, I mean, you could ask for a weapon of, in particular, more javelins. Uh... Ooh, javelins. Yes. Can I have another earring? Uh, uh, do you make earrings? Of which, oh, wait, what? I don't specialize it, but I could I could try. That's going to get infected. <laughs> <laughs> don't um, worry, I'll heal myself. It'll quick, be fine. <laughs> Quick question going to the past and then I'll and then I'll ask this. So the javelins that I threw before, like I mean, I could have re I could have collected those back, right? Yeah. You could have picked them back up. Okay. Easily enough. But then I still would probably want more. Okay, so okay. All right, back to it. Uh I'm in need of more javelin. Can you help me with that as well? And sharpen and I need to sharpen my sword. Uh I can certainly sharpen the blade. I can make some javelins, and I can make an earring. Just one or two? Do you want matching? I mean, and I, like, count the different piercings on my ear, on my, both my ears. I'm like, um, I have five total, but just, I don't know. I only need, like, two. Hold my hoops. <laughs> <laughs> one second. Uh... How many javelins are you wanting by chance as well, real fast? I was just going to see how many you would make. Uh, you know, minus the for the earrings that are needed and some if it is resources for you for payment. Uh, he goes, um, uh, he kind of goes on back for a second. Uh, you can hear him kind of moving some things around. Uh, hear something fall and kind of steps back and goes, Are you okay? Uh, yeah, ah, uh, just kind of dropped an ingot on my foot. <laughs> and comes back and goes, all right, uh, I can make you like 10 javelins pretty easy. Uh, the 10 kind of could get a little pricey because because you, if you get a whole bunch, I'll give you a little bit of a bulk deal of only four gold pieces for the 10. For the okay. earrings, uh, do you want them just out of some iron, or do you want a fancy material? Oh, I want something um, kind of pretty, so, you know, so I can, I just kind of got some money, and so I, you know, treat yourself, right? So, <laughs> you know how it is. <laughs> this is why I hold on to your, some of your money. But yes, by what Idea. You. And you see him kind of pull out uh, a small bag, and he kind of dumps it out, and you can see a bunch of silver and copper pieces. Uh, and he oh, starts picking great. out some silver pieces. That's perfect, Has thank you. Small stack and goes, I can do something with these. It'll be a minute, though, for okay. all of it. Uh, come back and like, kind of thinks and counts, because three hours? Three hours. We will okay, see you then. Day. And how many am I getting? Ten? If you get ten, yeah, it'll be four gold pieces for you, and I gotta get my silver back. And he counts the silver and goes, one gold piece for the earrings. Done. Thank you. This is this is the so when we walk out though, Valkyria to uh, Ayana is just. I'm glad you understand that I take some of your money because you spend, you spend, spend, spend. But when you need, just remember I have that hundred of yours. And he also, as you guys are stepping outside, he also steps and goes, uh, the two gold for the armor. Oh, Do I already gave it. What's on the ground? I already gave or... it to him. Well, no, he, that's on the ground. And, yeah, and, then I, and then, yeah, Valkyria handed him to Oh, her. yeah, sorry. I would have picked it up and given it to him. So he got four Sorry, gold. I thought that he got it. <laughs> he got four gold. So somehow he got four gold out of hey man, that. He's now like a bandit. Of events. All right. Uh, see you in a bit. So odd. He shuts the door. Bye. All right. All right. Uh, 
This is the I... quality D and D content that I play D and D for. Yeah, we've been on for like about an hour or so, and we <laughs> <laughs> we have accomplished eating breakfast and forging javelins and earrings. <laughs> yes, and and getting splint armor fitted. Right. Okay, well, that's important. D and D. Um. Well, okay. So Arthur will be going over to stables. All right. Uh, uh, just to be a... seeing if there are they have any for sale uh they have uh three horses in there that are kind of in their own stall and then there's about six or seven other ones kind of in kind of mixed a bunch and you can see a guy um, scooping and he looks up and goes uh is one of these yours no but uh there, I was hoping we could get some from you. Is that a uh, thing we can do? Or he kind of looks him over, goes and just kind of whispers to you, goes, "How much? What? How much do you want to spend?" Uh... Oh, and Zach has commenced rolling dice. <laughs> uh. How much are you wanting? Mm, do you want just one? Three. Three. Since Sam does a like counting in his head, he goes seventy-five gold. And they're yours. Just you gotta take them out fast. Oh, fa uh, <laughs> I'll think about it gonna be here for a while can't really shove off the moment i give you these things of course i mean they aren't exactly for sale i know so and i mean so whose horses are these that you're trying to sell well those three came in with you and he points to the three that are kind of isolated. Right. But based off your reaction, those aren't yours. These other seven, three of them are the governors, and the other four are just others who have came in with horses. It's the val. <sighs> it's the valet selling everyone's cars. Exactly. <laughs> I'm suffering shit for Christ's sake. <laughs> I, I can see that. Hey, man. But also, I'm going to be doing a job for the for the governor. So then he'll pay you, you want... handsomely. Hopefully. Yeah. Unless you're before taking he, that job. Before he potentially puts me in jail for taking horses and like I said that's why I said leave gotta get out quick <sighs> you walk away with the horse I walk away with a bit of extra gold we both win nah you're just a fine upstanding citizen and just goes back to scooping no <laughs> oh, oh. oh. Horses, is she making those sounds out loud? Like she's just standing there, like, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> kind of, kind of, just a, a little bit quieter than what I'm doing, but just a, <gasps> oh. <gasps> so I don't. I wasn't really an upstanding citizen up Baldur's Gate anyway. I was, but I don't know how long I'm gonna be here. Are you talking to yourself? It's very productive, because I actually get stuff done. So shush. Um, Whatever. I like to imagine she's still carrying the food for Luca around. No, I put, I set it down beside Just Luca. an empty plate. <laughs> Just an empty plate. <laughs> nah. Um, Alright. 
if I'm not back in a half hour, then consider it the, the deal's off. All right. All right. And then I make my way over to the governor. Wow. Takes a bit of searching, but you can eventually find him. Uh, and he's sitting there talking and trying to direct. And he turns and goes, Ah, are you the messenger this time? It, well, I don't really speak for everyone. But I do speak for me and my brother. All right, are and, you... And... Uh, we will be doing it. Do it. You and your brother will be, but not, not the rest? Well, I don't speak for the rest, so I don't know. Well, if you could find out, that great. Either <laughs> come back or send them to me. I don't care. I just need to know how many to expect to leave. Sure, sure. Um, how much are you, you willing to part... How much do you need to be willing to part with your horses? Part from your horses. He kind of stops and looks at and goes, If it's to look for the raiders, you guys can take them. Really? Yeah. If that's what it takes for you guys to find them and come back with information, so be it. Oh, well, perfect. Wonderful. All right. I'll go be looking for the rest of the group. Once I find out how many, I'll, I'll go tell my stable master. Gotcha. And then she starts looking. Yeah, just, she just starts looking for the others. Uh, Colth and Jasho, what are you doing? <laughs> You guys have been sitting this whole entire time. Awkward oh. silence. That's a, that's Awkward like silence. Says. So anyways, that's when she shook the flower and she went on this massive drug trip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why, are you, why are you throwing shade uh, on someone you only knew for like a few days? Because I told you not to mess with the flower and you did it anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, any funny traveling stories for you? Are you are you still inhaling food? Just <laughs> uh, I am probably at this point done with just sucking food into my gullet, uh, and have been trying to find uh, Demacus. Oh, so I've been talking to myself this whole time. Yeah, You've been uh, talking to who you think is Jasho, but at this point in time, he's been gone for an so, hour. So anyways, any funny trap? Jasho? Yeah, I'd already gotten <laughs> up. Just walked away. Ah, every time. <laughs> I could roll a stealth check if we want. <laughs> yeah, roll a stealth check for me. Oh gosh, do I need to make a perception check? Uh, no. I or, use your no, it's just passive. Yeah. Oh my oh, gosh. That be, oh. That shouldn't be it should be the 12. Sorry, it should be 12. Uh, well, I notice him. I, yeah, you, my past perception is a 14. I like start standing up like, and like getting up like, oh, what? Sorry, were you talking to me? Apologize. You weren't paying attention, were you? Uh-uh. <laughs> Apologies. It's okay. Um, what do you want to do about this whole cave situation? Oh, well, I mean, there's... There's crap to be done. Got to, got to do the stuff. I'm, that's I'm that's real descriptive. Okay. I mean, <laughs> this is my town. All right. Like, I got to make sure everything's okay here. Do you and think it would there's... be better to go to El Terrell and get help, or just try to tackle no. it ourselves? I mean, it it would tack on <sighs> maybe a week to it, but we'd have help. It would take. I worry that. I worry that they would be coming back. Yeah, fair enough. If we if we take too long going to El Torel, which is a, what a week away. I think it was like yeah, it's about six to eight. Oh, I thought it was yeah. three. 
Yeah. Six days. Six days on horseback or on foot? Mm, horseback. Jeez. Yeah, it's a while. Uh, let's we just get in our car. Let's just get in our, our Prius. Right, right. Yeah, let's just get in our car. And then just drive away. Uh, whatever that means. <laughs> let's get in our Tesla. What's a, what's a car? I don't know. Something I, something I dreamed about one time. Weird. Uh, no, I, I, it'll take too long to, to get reinforcements here. All right. I need to make sure that this place is safe. Fair enough. Well, let's tell the others and see what they think. We can draw a final tally on who's going. Uh, where did the others head out to? I saw them leave for town somewhere, but do you well, know where they're still in the keep. Oh, I thought, okay. oh, okay. Well, Luca's over yeah. there. I point at Luca. Um, I Valkyria said she was going to the blacksmith for something, and Iona followed. Um, Arthur just kind of di disappeared. Yeah, she tends to do that. Yeah. So, well, I'll go talk to Luca if you want to go try and find the others or something. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. I'll head out to the. Uh... I'll head out to the town and start heading towards the blacksmith. Uh, and I'll... As you're... Sorry, you yeah. can do that first. I'll do I'll do the uh, look of thing after. Man, just as you're leaving, you can see Arthur talking to uh, Governor Nighthill. Oh, uh... I walk over. There's... Ah, the other one. Yeah. Uh, are you going to take the job? I mean, I'm in. I think. Uh, calls that guy, and I point to him. I think he's in. We're trying right. to call the rest of the group to see what's going on. It'll take too long to go to Eltra and get reinforcements and. I don't want to leave this place vulnerable. Exactly why I'm hiring you guys. Yeah. Uh, uh, I think I think uh, Ash is still in the bathroom, so can't really ask what Arthur wants to do. So we we'll do. Hi, Col I'm Arthur. We we'll do Colt and Luca real fast. <laughs> okay, there we go. Arthur. So I'll sort Sorry, of. I'm Arthur. I'll I'll go up to Luca. Is he currently working with someone? Uh, I would say yeah. He's kind of sitting there doing some mild prayers over somebody who is passing mm. from their wounds. All right. I will sort of stand back and reverently wait for him to finish. <laughs> Seeing as this is the man who saved my life last night, I don't want to interrupt him doing his mojo. So. I see him just kind of pressing his hand on his on the man's forehead as you just see the life as he just fades out and falls and you can hear him uh, muttering a prayer under his breath and after uh, about a minute after the man dies he picks his hand up is he gone um, yes. He... I tried to ease his suffering as the best I could, but it's not always the same for everyone. Well, sometimes the best is what you can do. And I give you mad props for following this kind of a life. I don't know if I could do it. Uh, well, with life, death, you know, a big wheel. And someone has to help guide you each way in, and I just happen to guide people on their way out. That's got to be draining on you. No. I like to help. I feel at my best when I get to do that sort of thing, so... You know. I just keep pushing. Fair enough. At this point, Arthur comes over. Oh, brother, are oh. you done? Oh, you would have 
just been stopped oh. by. Uh, nope. Yeah, you're still talking. Yeah, you're, you're, you're still talking with the governor. Oh dang. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. This is what um, happens when you go to the bathroom for like a hot minute. And I, uh, I'll sort of put my hand on his shoulder. Yeah. Sorry. I, uh, I'm I am putting uh, my hand on your shoulder. I get kind of jumpy when people touch me. I'm not used to physical affection. Fair enough. You seem to get tugged around a lot. Uh, yeah. It's... I've only known you for three days, but... <laughs> Austin, please. <laughs> so, I just wanted to thank you for last night. Oh, um... What we do is kind of a dangerous line of work, and I don't know. I ex when people do reckless things, someone has to be ready to help pick them back up. I just kind of acted without thinking, and I, I kind of lost my temper yesterday. I, I try to keep control of myself or keep as calm as possible, but when that... I, what, dragon man? I, I don't really know what to call him. Some kind but of he, half dragon thing. Not sure. When the when he kicked Joshua while he was down, I just got me really mad. I I lost my temper, and I used my divine connection in a way that I've never done before. And I hit him while he was down, and I try not to do that sort of thing. I'm a healer first, and uh, it, it didn't feel right. Well, the way I see it is you did it in defense of those who couldn't defend themselves. And that's, you know, still a heroic thing in my book. I don't, I don't quite get how the whole religious thing works but you still did a good thing you saved me you saved Joshua. you've probably saved quite a few more people in the past 24 hours so i still think you're a good person if that's worth anything uh, thank you for that i think i i don't really know you well enough yet to Fair enough. I'm new to this whole fr new friend thing as well. Uh, so. It's going to take some time. But I'll let you get back to your thing. Um, oh, I meant to ask you. How do you feel about the job? Did you hear Governor Nighthill talking about it? Um, I kind of got lost in this. And then that empty plate of food there I shared with everyone that was hungry. Because, you know, I, Did you it just eat? felt like the right thing to do. I had a little. Well, little is better than none, I guess. Um, the governor has asked us to go to a cave northeast of here and investigate it, because that is apparently where the cult retreated to. Um, and he's asked us to investigate it, potentially recover any valuables that we find. Um, so, how do you feel about doing that? I know Josh is in. I'm in. I have yet to hear from your sister, Valkyria, or Iana, but... Part, Iana. Well, if you're all going, you guys are kind of reckless. <laughs> That's putting it lightly. Uh, I feel better about things if I went, because if someone falls down, I can help you get back up. I appreciate it. It makes it a little less of a burden to be re reckless when I know that I've got someone on my back. So, I appreciate it. Just, you know, try not to die quickly, because there's only so much I can do. I'll do my best. I'll try and keep them off you so you can do your work. Thank you. Anyways, I'll let you get back to your thing and I'll go find the others. I'll come, we'll come find you when we're ready to go. I'll be here. Perfect. I will exit the game. Jasho and Arthur go fast. 
Jesho uh, had just walked up to the governor and I don't remember exactly what he said. I presume you were just like, yeah, I'll do it. Who, Arthur or Joshua? No. Joshua. Joshua. Oh, yeah, I, I'm t- I, I was saying that I was going to do it. And I was just wondering if uh, you were on board, Arthur. Oh, yes. I think, uh, I think Cole's trying to convince her brother. Have you talked to the others at all? Uh, no, I just got done. Had some. Uh, house to do. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm heading out to the blacksmith, I guess. That's where they headed, so I was gonna go see. Oh, if could they... you ask him to make some arrows? Maybe ten. Shouldn't you be talking to the Fletcher about that? You're right. I'm just used to it being in the same place because convenience. Um, and the Fletcher. I mean, I can ask the blacksmith, but he could probably only make you the arrowheads. All right. Uh. I mean, you, well, could, you could just come with me. Uh, you didn't want me to find Iona and Valkyria. That's what. That's where I'm going. To go find them at the oh. blacksmith. They didn't. They did say the blacksmith. They. All right. I'll go with you. Okay. Uh. I just shout over so to. The... It, can I? Is Kulth within like earshot of me? I'm assuming by this point I'm like leaving the keep. Uh, it's a brief conversation between the two of you. Colt is leaving. Oh, uh, well, I'm gonna go catch up with Colt. You go see what, where he's going, and then I'll head over to the blacksmith. Uh, so you're coming Kulth, to me, or you're going straight to the blacksmith? No, I just just wait up. Where are you heading? Oh, um, I don't know. My best bet was the blacksmith. It's the last I heard where Valkyria and Ayana were going. That's where we're going to. Perfect. And we all head towards the blacksmith. You, you know, just walk up and see me holding oh, like a halfling. Ever, no. Well, on the way, <laughs> on, uh, on the way, I'm like, oh, so kept calling that guy your son, or boy, or something like that. Boy. Are you boy. your father? Come here, boy. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm not. I'm not his dad. No, he's he's. Like a son, but not really. I, I took care of him for a while, but he's so it's like an orphan. Old enough. Well, I mean, yeah. When El Torel, when El Torel went under for a bit, uh, oh, that's so sad. I came. I was. I, I came to help out when it came back, and I decided to take the care of. Him and his sibling. So it's Very it's generous a. Of you. I mean, I know what it's like losing parents. That I'm sure it's a lot more to. Him. Well, I couldn't just stand by and see these kids get pushed around all the time, ignored. Like You'd be surprised how many people would be willing to do that. Let oh, I I know, drown. but I just I just couldn't bear to see it. So I took him under my wing for a little bit. I don't think I did the best job. I definitely wasn't there for them I, as much as I should have been. But I heard you. I tried. I heard that old man was beating him up. Yeah. He's kind of a. His parenting style is a little strange, but abusive. It's it's not abusive. It's training. It's the reason why I'm so tough, and it's the reason why I'm... the boy's so tough. At this point, um, like Arthur opens her mouth to have another rebuttal, but then her eyes go wide, 
and she just shuts her mouth and just continues to walk with you guys. <laughs> like Anyways. she she came upon a startling realization and she's not sure what to do with it. Josh is my dad. I did not even know <laughs> He's secretly an elf. What? <laughs> oh yeah, my ears just like I chopped them off. That's that's how it is. <laughs> not even shaved. Not even not even caught. trimmed them. Just he cut them off. He's pulled them yeah. off of his ears. Just so just so I didn't look like anything like an elf. Just gone. It's more of a Van Gogh thing. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Van Gogh. I must pay. I must Poor pay. Ben-Hole. Listen, all right. Good art requires pain. <laughs> Uh, after a brief conversation, unless there's anything else want to be said. No, I'm good. Uh, do you, you guys are like just finishing that conversation when uh, you bump into Ayana and Valkyria leaving the blacksmith. Oh, hey guys! Ah, oh, well, hey. we were just looking for you. That's convenient. Yeah, it is. Well, you found us. What's going on? Well, we wanted to see what you guys thought of... Well, I know Valkyria's in. uh, Of the cave that the governor asked us to clear out. We are super in, and it's going to be fine, and everything's going to be great, and we're going to kick butt. The evil must die. We're all in this together, right? (laughs) Yeah, just like my dad says. We're all in this together. Gosh dang it. (laughs) <laughs> Meredith. <Gosh. laughs> yeah. You just gotta get your head in the game, you know? I oh, no! Stop! <laughs> All right. Josh will kill when this is done, When this is done, we need to head to El Terrell. We can get more information to destroy more of this evil. But yeah, let's definitely. empty this cave now. Yeah, we don't have time to wait around. Well, I don't know if we can do it right now. We've still gotta pull together a few things. We must do it now! Uh, we, we need no, to, we need do to it now! <laughs> if we go now, I'm not sure I'll have enough arrows. Like, I'm just, I'm comfortable with, hey. like, at least 20 arrows. We'll I'm going to turn around arrows. and go back to the blacksmith. We, just the we blacksmith, I'm going to do the for our like, I mean, I figured there would be, like, a Fletcher or something. Kind of. Yeah, no, I'm asking where the, I'm asking the blacksmith where the Fletcher is. Uh, you step in. And kind of, he's in his back, and you can hear banging. Uh, Excuse me, we're back. back I know it hasn't been three hours yet, but I'm back. (laughs) It's only been ten minutes. I know, but I just had a quick question for you. I was wondering if you could direct me to the Fletcher? Uh, She... Uh, Honestly, it's going to sound a bit embarrassing. I have no idea where she's at. (laughs) It's not uh, embarrassing. Uh oh. I understand. Or you I... want a side quest to find the Fletcher? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Fletcher. Oh, <laughs> this is. It's gonna be a side quest that involves like, oh man, we gotta go clear this like mini dungeon out. It's down to the bottom of it. Yeah, we're gonna go through Undermountain. We're actually playing yeah. Dungeons of the Mad Mage, guys. Surprise. What? I think she's like the road. Not certain. I don't think I've ever met her. Or if I have, I've never asked her profession. So if I had to guess, it'd be relatively nearby here. Okay, thank you so much for your help. Bye. See you in two hours and 50 minutes. See you then. (laughs) Back to his work. Uh, What did you get? Some uh, very important stuff. I got a shake weight. (laughs) <laughs> oh sorry you weren't asking me puts the shake away <laughs> <laughs> um it's what, what kind of important stuff I'll show you later don't worry uh we need to go this way and I just start pointing and walking Wait, like I know where I'm going you're looking for arrows yeah yes <laughs> don't mind me while I just pull off this quiver of arrows that I've had this whole time and just haven't used what yeah <laughs> I apparently have a short That's bow. T- it's 20 more arrows. <gasps> You're giving this to me? I mean, I'm not using it. <gasps> I 
All right, don't, Thank don't, you. don't get too excited. Just oh, arrows. Yeah, calm down. Uh, so, excuse you, arrows are my life. They're they're just sticks with feathers and pointy, and pointy bits. You Humans. shut you shut your mouth. You're you don't understand. I mean, yeah, you you just punch things, bro. I mean, hey, I punch things pretty well. Pretty sure you do Ayana punch them pretty understands. well. You almost want a hand to hand combat with that dude. Listen, all right, I let him win. You understand? Yeah, don't okay. You? <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, we didn't. <laughs> yeah, I heard. Uh, I heard my 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 friend over here got the finishing blow, huh? Nah, 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 nah. not me. I don't know what you're talking about. It was your son. Not no. He would have been bragging about it for the last seventeen hours, essentially. Do we see anyone else on the street? Yeah, are we just completely just standing in the middle of the street like it's deserted? No, no, no we're there's, walking. There's, there's people, people I, moving around. The way I see okay. it, we are walking as we yeah. go. We are yeah, walking we're and talking. We're walking, we're walking, and, walking and we're though, walking. I'm like saying hi to everyone we pass, and then um, occasionally, like I'm stopping and asking if they know where a Fletcher is. Uh, are we still going well, to get the Fletcher? Because <laughs> no one's yeah. told me otherwise. Well, that's you need lots of twenty, 20, just 20 for, more arrows. Just for future. Just for future reference, because we're coming Most back of the here. You say hi to. Do not react. Uh, there's a few of them that kind of smile and say hi back, but most of them are pretty serious and somber about the situation. Uh, and the few you ask where the, where the Fletcher is, uh, most of them keep pointing back at the blacksmith. Oh, thank you. That's helpful. Let's let's do, don't worry, guys. Don't worry. I got this. Ah! I'm yelping it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, wrap it up, boys. Get down here. Is he really yeah. doing that? <laughs> you do that, and a man stops and goes. It's a pretty good blacksmith, not a good Fletcher. Uh, just keeps walking. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah, I speak Yelp. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's pretty good blacksmith, not a good Fletcher. Uh, Four out of three five. stars. Yeah, three. No, it's three stars. <laughs> three stars. One dude says, man, best blacksmith ever. And that's five stars. <laughs> uh, another person walks by and goes, one star. He broke my bow. He broke my bow. <laughs> Uh, All right, guys, my jokes have peaked at the second session of the campaign. I, I will you. never <laughs> say a funnier right, joke the rest done. of the campaign. And that's no, the campaign. Thank my, you my, for my, my, arc has com- <laughs> my arc has completed. I am ready to retire, <laughs> Kulf. No, that has to be a recurring thing now. We just go to... You just go to we New City? We go to place. We, <laughs> we need to find this place. All right, hang on. Let me yelp it. <laughs> <laughs> um... That sounds well, right, like a. We're saying that. That sounds like a cantrip. That, yelp. <laughs> yeah, like Yelp, and it, it's a cantrip, and then immediately just like reviews for the nearest. All right, shops all right, Austin, here. get to home brewing a spell. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Post it on D and D Beyond. Right, becomes the most successful homebrew spell ever. Well, all right. If the blacksmith turns out to be the. The quote-unquote Fletcher, then... He said it's a girl, and she's this way. He thinks. Right, but everyone's pointing at him. Uh, DM, would I know where the Fletcher is, since I used to live here? I mean, uh, you wouldn't have to deal with it. But... That would be another intelligence check, because you have no need to go to a Fletcher. Hey, you know what? Do I get advantage, at least? You do get advantage, because you, you know do what? live here. Last time I you didn't... Did. I didn't do so bad. Hey, look at that. Hey, there uh, you go. You would know that... My Yelp helped. Uh, the Fletcher is the blacksmith's wife. Oh, no! Oh, that's <laughs> awkward. <laughs> he hasn't seen her in a while? Like, is this like a... Like, she took the kids and left kind of a thing? Or, like, she died on the raid kind of a thing? Oh, no. I have no idea. Oh, oh no. great. <laughs> So, so Joshua tells us this, and I'm a little I worried. I look over guys. at Ayana, and I go, "You know what? The twenty arrows will be fine. Let's just go." 
I mean, it's 20 plus whatever you had, right? Or did you use literally right. all of them? No, I had 13 left, so I... You got 33. Yeah, so I'll, I'll survive you. This will be good. More than good. Okay. All right, well... I just wanted to find them as a just-in-case, we... just but it looks guess... like the just-in-case. We'll have to wait. I really... <laughs> now I'm worried about that guy's wife. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we've now got to just wait another two and a half hours for javelins and whatever Ayana got. Do you guys want to be on horses? Our horses? Well, apparently the governor will give us his horses, um, depending on how many of us are going. Which reminds me, I need to go tell him that we're basically all going. So, oh yeah, be are right, we? Wait, be right back. And she just goes. Kulth, did you huh? did you uh, get uh, Luca on board? Yeah, Luca said that if we were all going, then he needs to back us up so we don't die. Because we're reckless. We're which, on this together. To, which totally That's, tracks. Listen, all right. From what I heard about last night, y'all are idiots. And you're the one who challenged a half dragon to a one v one. Listen, all right. I never said I was a genius. <laughs> you also <laughs> made him do two fights. <laughs> we all made bad decisions, guys. Hey, it's I, hey, hey, hey! Decision. But did you die? But almost. did you die? No, no just, almost doesn't what? count. But did it's you die? Fair. I'm gonna give it to you. I didn't die, and neither did you. So boom. Technically, I did. We're guys. We're immortal. We're basically <laughs> gods. I mean, you're right. I don't be saying that. Knocking on the wood. You weren't there for when I said it. You were already. You already left to go talk to the governor. That she just felt the... a disturbance in the forest. She was like, <laughs> "Don't say that." Last of me. She had a shiver down her spine and felt like a, a sudden urge me. to go knock on some wood. All right, guys. Uh, now, now it's for real. Now Colt really is going to die this session. <laughs> uh, I can't wait. Is so the rest of you are just waiting while Arthur goes off? I mean, well, maybe I'm going to go, go name the horses around the city with whatever I can. You can go help out. Uh, Diana, you doing? Out. That seems like a better <laughs> idea than naming horses. I'll just think about the horses' names. Is while there you like a general store guy somewhere? Not anymore. <laughs> uh, that was, that's the blacksmith's cousin who's also yeah, been missing since the raid. Missing, yeah. <laughs> it, it turns this out all the shopkeeps are like uh, the Fire Emblem shopkeeps. They're all literally related to each other. They all look exactly the same. And they're all <laughs> halfling men and women. <laughs> yeah. Uh, do you go for, try to find a general store? Yeah. I'll, I'll walk around and ask. I'll yelp it. <laughs> general F store. General store. I'll pull up my Google Maps. General oh, store. Yeah. Dollar general. Dollar Use general. No. Oh, the Dollar Tree. Nice. <laughs> Walmart. Sam's Club. Uh, spin disposal slot to cast GPS. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, I do it at second level. Does that mean it increases the range? Yeah, it makes means to where you find it more exact. Gotcha. Pizza Hut? Uh, not within the next hundred miles. <laughs> uh, you eventually find the general store. Uh, and it's pretty damaged, but it seems like there's people in it. Sort of knock and... Hello? Uh, hello? Uh, is, is everyone all right? Yeah, just... More or less? Question mark? This... I don't mean to be rude, but what do you want? <laughs> <laughs> um, I was just looking to pick up some supplies and maybe offer some help for a little bit. Uh, I... What kind of supplies? Supplies are a little short. I uh, just... Basic stuff, you know, rope, uh, chalk, some rations, maybe. I, I've got those. Uh, come in, come in. Uh, Walk in. And I'm assuming entry. it looks like a disaster. Yeah, it is. Okay. Trashed. Uh, and you can see that there's a woman trying to like organize what she can. Uh, and she looks up and goes, uh, 
Is there any particular, like, priority you have with these things? Just whatever you have on hand. Um, you mean, um, like, time frame, or...? I mean, just something you're looking for, like, you... If you're looking for rope more, like, I'll search for rope first, because you can see it's a bit of a search. Um... Well, I guess... Uh, I've, I've got some rope, so for now, you have chalk or rations by, by any chance? Uh, yeah, I mean, you kind of dig through some things, pulls out, like, a small box, and goes, she goes, ah, uh, and shakes it. Is it like I think the chalk. Crayola kids chalk, that, like, chalk, uh, sidewalk chalk? No, it is literally just a wood box, and oh. she opens it, and it's just... A bunch of white chalk. Perfect. Um, how much do you want for it? Uh, how do you just want the box? Well, how much? How much is in it? She kind of wiggles it around and goes, "There's about eleven pieces." I'll take five. She pulls out five and sits them down and goes, "All right, now." presume you want to just get as much as you can then pay for it or do you want to pay for each item um sure we can we can do it all in one tab that would be five copper currently right and she starts digging some more i'll, I'll also uh, like dig around for like some rope just some uh, like hempen rope roll an investigation check oh, i have a gr i have a great um track history with these best to keep oh wow that actually wasn't bad uh after a very brief digging you find uh a spool of rope and when you hold it up she goes ah there it is uh how many feet do you want or do you just want that entire spool um i'm assuming it's like a 50 foot bundle of some kind yeah it's 50 foot bundle of hemp and rope i'll, I'll take the whole thing you don't if, if unless you need part of this she kind of looks around and goes i need a lot of things fair enough the rope won't bother all right i'll uh, i'll take the whole thing then all right and you said rations yes uh, just a couple days worth of rations if you don't have any i understand that you know you've got you know needs of your own so and she kind of goes to his storage, and you can see that the door has been broken off of it. And she looks yeah. in because coldest or I, I have a couple days for a person, just one. Just one ration, or a couple days for just one person. A couple days for one person. Uh, is that all you have, or are you still gonna have some after that? Like, I don't want to take all of it. I mean. So far, the governor's feeding most people, unless they're traveling out of here. But raiders pretty well stole most of my food. So. Well, I'll take... Do you have uh, four days' worth of rations? She kind of counts it out and goes, I've got three. I'll take the three, then. Uh, anything else you're looking for? No, oh, that's really all I need right now. Alright, that'll be uh, five copper, two and, like, two and a half gold pieces. Okay, uh, I will hand so, her five. Five gold pieces? Yeah. She takes it and goes to count change and then realizes... No, 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 I'd, I don't need change. Keep the change. I... Very much appreciate it. Well, this town is in shambles, so wherever I can give help, I'll do my best, I guess. Hopefully, kindness will... With your kindness, the fates will align for you. Oh, well, I'll need it. <laughs> Awkward laugh. And then I'll, <laughs> I'll sort of thank her, and I'll put this stuff in my bag. Then I'll head back to the keep. Uh, Arthur and the governor real fast. Uh, 
he sees you approach once more and goes, Did you gather everybody this time? Or do you have another question? No, I, I gathered everyone. Right. Is it everyone is, is on board. Fantastic. Uh, I'll get... Let's go, Bert! And he... Oh, let's go, Bert. I love this guy. He kind of walks up to us. Go to the treasury. See what we can scrounge up. Uh, preferably, I want to pay them at least enough as... At least the same as what we did for them helping Greenus. So I... And just walks down to the keep. Into the keep. Just, Is there any chance that you have any Russians that... Uh, I'm sure we have some cured meats and fruits and various other ration-like things. Not necessarily designed for enough. long travel, but some. I can get that fact for you right away. And he yells out, It's covered! And he goes, I, I, I heard. <laughs> what I would do without him. Okay, uh... Any other supplies you need? Um, not that I know of. We'll be all right. right. Excellent. Meet with me before you leave, so uh, that way I can convene with all of you. That way, everybody knows the plan, or at least we, what I. Missed. Uh, we are most likely leaving with a couple hours. Apparently there's some stuff at the blacksmith that be finished up. Fair enough. Ah, well, uh, the sooner the better. Try and catch them. Maybe they're confident, cocky. You use them to your advantage. I'm sorry, you would cut out right as you started saying stuff. Oh. Uh, she said that the sooner the better. Maybe you can catch them out because they're confident. They're cocky. Think they're untouchable. Yeah, the, even even when we had captured that guy, that cultist, he didn't seem very concerned about his own life. Just that the work can... right. you're also asking about horses do you still need those or oh yes 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 they but just of... the three because the other three are... yes he pulls out a piece of paper and signs his name and hands it to him give this to the stable master all right. And not the scooper. It's a dirty liar. Really? Scooper. What kind yeah. of a name is hey. Scooper? He was born for it. Oh. Really? He is a scoundrel, but. It's a job not very many people want to do, obviously. Obviously. But. Actually, actually. I'll go ahead and get the horses ready. He uh, okay. Save you guys a bit of time. Instead of you guys having to do it. Uh, uh, very well. And kind of starts walking towards the stables. She's just panicking internally, just a teeny bit. That the it's been half an hour by this point. I feel like it's been about half an hour. Uh, at this point, it's been her walking there and talking with him. Would have been the first half hour. You finding the general store, help search, and buy your things. It's probably been about an hour. Uh, anything the rest of you wish to do in the last hour or so? 
Uh, I think Joshua and I were just helping people like lift rubble and. I was, yeah, I was just going around seeing what was, if I could help easily with anything. Uh, as you are helping, you do see Demo Cass helping as well. Uh, I'll go up to him. And... Oh. oh. I've got a question. Would Valkyria left her blades for the sharpening, or...? Uh, yes. Okay. You would have had to. Unless you okay. just want to stand outside of his door. No. no. So currently you only have javelins for weapons. And her dagger. And your dagger. And the dagger. Uh, yeah. Demo cast is kind of helping where he can. <sighs> so I was thinking, night. guys, the, the oh. other horses we should name Sunshine, Flower, and Bucky. Any objections? No? Okay. I just, like, I, what she said, I just, like, eh, whatever. Uh... <sighs> You need any help? I guess he turns and looks at and goes, "I think you helped enough last night. You can, you can go rest or do whatever it is you wish to do." Oh, too bad. I'm helping. Stubborn. <laughs> you think I've changed after all these years? No, but I hope you would at least respect my opinion a little bit more. Listen, all right. You know me, I can't just sit around and do nothing. <laughs> yeah. That's how I ended up with you. Couldn't just stand back and watch. <laughs> uh, but I greatly most... appreciate it. What? But I greatly appreciate it. And so does Nero. Good. I'm glad, I'm glad that you appreciate things. I just... Uh, it's been a long night, but there's still a lot of work to do, so let's get this, let's get this town sorted out, shall we? Doing my best. Uh, you know my dad always says helps? Just whistle yeah. while you work. Gosh. <laughs> my air. Oh my he sits there and like <laughs> tries to whistle for a second and goes, I, I can't. I... You just go like this. <laughs> oh, I can't whistle either. I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> oh my uh, word. So I swear. Dad's... Joshua yeah. is going to absolutely murder Ayana one of these days. <laughs> <laughs> I like the attempt at morale boost. Everybody certainly needs it here. And he turns to you, Josh, and goes, I'm real sorry. About what? Oh, you know. You kind of got the crap beat out of yourself, me. Listen, I've gotten the crap beat out of me for a lot worse reasons. All right. I was glad to do it. If it would make sure you're okay, I would take a thousand beatings. But a thousand and one, maybe not so much. Yeah, a thousand and one kind of pushes it. That's before I cut it. Yeah. Honestly, maybe 999 might be pushing it. You know, honestly, five might be pushing it, but <laughs> I'd still. Yeah, walking, it was, it was probably like four. It was kind of right there. <laughs> But you were bobbing and weaving. That's something. Listen, all right. Your your old man's not, you know, too out of practice after getting the crap beat out of him for the last few years. So you didn't win a single fight during those years? Didn't even try? I won. I won a few when they let me. You know. Hey. Oh, it's a long story. We'll get into it some other time. After this place isn't broken. You always say some other time. I forget Listen, to it. I know, I know. But 
there's things people we gotta do you know it's like we're me and my friends are gonna go head off to the, the caves up up north or ish north ish right yeah to the northeast yes. northeast yeah <sighs> you go make sure that those guys don't come back well certainly don't want them coming back there caused quite a mess i thought he was talking about us for a second I was like, wow, okay. <laughs> they, they were not good guests. Yeah, especially that that guy with that one sword. He's such a dick. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but I guess anyways. that's what happens when the party goes on too long. <laughs> yeah. Listen, I promise when I come back. I'll let you know what was going on. And I know that I kind of suddenly sent you away and I didn't really let you or anybody else know what was going on, but I got wrapped up in some stuff and got a little got he a little dangerous. Here and goes, promise you come back? Well, I came back finally, eventually, right? To be fair, you didn't promise that one. That's true. But I am promising now. Alright. I'll keep you honest. I'll come find you. <laughs> that worries me. Because <laughs> I know you'll find me. That girl's oh, already out there searching for you. Maybe he'll find you first. Is that where he ran off to, to go find me? No, he went north. Not sure why. Well, Probably wanted to stop back at Eltro. I'll have to head up that way once I'm done here. Make sure he's still okay. Yeah. I'm sure he'll be happy to see you. <laughs> I don't think that's changed. Well, I sure hope not. I know I wasn't the greatest of role models, but I always tried to do what I thought was best for you guys. I mean, come on. You had, of all the people we could have looked up to, probably the worst. We had Gerard, we had any of the heroes of El Terrell, but you got us. <laughs> hey. And then you gave us to Naboo. Hey. He did all right with me, and you turned out fine. Fair I'd, point. I'd even say you turned out better than me, for the most part. Why? Because I chose to stay here? <laughs> yeah, you didn't go running off chasing some stupid in, idiotic dream. I mean, but I did get captured by a half-dragon. Well, yeah, I almost got killed by that same half-dragon, so you know what? I don't think that's a... Uh, a measure of one's worth or uh, success. That guy was. Oh, that guy hurt. Man, he hit like a truck. Yeah. I did. don't think I've ever been punched so hard in my entire life. And that's saying something. I used to get punched. <laughs> that's true. That's true. He just smacked me with the butt of his sword. I'm just glad you're okay. Like you, not that easy to be knocked down. <laughs> All right, help me lift this thing. <laughs> Come on. I'll help lift. him too, since I've just been awkwardly standing there this whole time. <laughs> Ayana's just been watching you. I just kind of leans over and goes, new girlfriend? I like start like choking on my spit like <laughs> what no 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 I'm a friend with the girl I just whisper in his ear and I go like I just found out she's 14 <laughs> <laughs> and he kind of nods and goes ah adopting again <laughs> oh <laughs> no 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 not not again I messed up the first two I don't need to try that again 
third time's the charm. Ugh. Um, at this point, I assume I'd be back, right? Yeah, you would have eventually found them helping and talking and tell, assisting where they can, and Colt, you probably would have been making your way back. Make unless way you just went to the game. And now so, it's time to hit the road. Well, no, 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 no. The, the, uh, the governor Has, wants to speak with us before we leave. Have I gone to get my javelins yet? Not yet. Uh, no, we're doing that on the way out, I assumed. Yeah, we can probably go talk, go talk to the governor, hit the blacksmith, and then leave. Okay. At around this point, the three hour mark has been hit. Uh, so. Whenever you decide to go pick them up. Yeah, we we need to speak with the governor before we leave. He wanted to do that, so we should head over to the to the stables. So that he's apparently going to be over there, setting, getting the horses ready and all of that. Alright, well, let's head that way. Uh, you all hit to the stables, uh, where you can see he's kind of has three horses there, and he's like, I only have the three, so... Don't gonna... worry, we already have horses. They named gonna... Squishy, Sparkles, and Peaches. Very powerful names. They're very powerful beasts. It's very true. Very true. So, uh, just called you all here to reiterate what I'm asking of you guys. I need you all to find this camp, this headquarters. Figure out how many people are there. Uh, rough numbers. I don't need exact. I don't need names or really anything. I need to figure out what motivation you can figure out and potentially where they intend to attack next. And it's secondary, but if you happen upon the valuables lost here, it'd be very appreciated if you were Any questions? Okay. Sounds good to me. I got nothing. Figure out their numbers and what their plan is. Get valuables back if possible. All right, we're question, question we're question just mark. finding out their numbers. We're not trying to wipe them out. And if they're small enough, ridiculous. they'll free. But based off the attack here, you won't be able to. Cool. Just checking, making sure, because we're bound to do it the wrong way anyways. So. Uh, and as... This conversation happens, and the young man kind of starts walking and limping towards you. Ah, uh, he goes, So you are going to follow those raiders. Uh, I'd love to accompany you, but I ain't going to be able to like this. But, and he looks at Arthur and goes, You already know. Find, if you could find a, a half elven man. His name is Leosin Irathar. If you do, he has very valuable information on this, these attacks. He, he was taken away last night, so and we went back to find him, and we only found this, and he holds up uh, a necklace. What does the necklace uh, look like? Uh, one second. Do you take it from him? Uh, sure. Hey, he's kind of holding it out. Uh, you, you take it, and it's this braided leather uh, band with a little silver dragon designed onto it. And the, it is torn as if it was ripped from his neck. 
torn from not this guy's neck, but a the, the, other the, guy. the the Leon Leeson. or Leeson dude. Yeah. Oh, that's not what I want. Yes. You. If you can find him, that'd be great. He kind of. He still has his hand out. Oh, right. Does, does he want us to pay him or return the necklace? Hand it back. Oh, oh okay. hand it back. Uh, you hand it back, and he kind of takes it, and it slips from his grasp and lands on the ground. Uh, and as he goes to pick it up, a blackbird flies by, picks it up, and flies off towards the northeast. That's ominous. That wasn't planned, was it? That was completely. Chris right. kind of sits there and goes, "Well then, guess." Can I shoot the? Never mind. I wouldn't do that. Meredith would do that. Never mind. Or <laughs> goes, that keepsake. Please bring him back alive. Be be great. Yes. Yes. Well. Uh... We'll be doing that. Uh, you have my word. I Hopefully you find him before one of my brothers comes back from Burdusk. And if he makes it back, I would presume he, Leoson, has, has an ill fate. So, I wish you all luck. Well... Probably gonna need it. Okay, bye. And kind of limps away. Dad, the governor kind of goes, Well, guess we both have some, two people have some stake in this. All right? Off you go. I'll well, send somebody to search after you guys if you haven't returned in the next two days. Quick, quick question, governor. Yes. Uh, do you know if anybody else has been kidnapped from the town? I mean, how many missing? How many missing do we have? Currently, we have at least three actual residents here that are unaccounted for. They're not in the dead. They're not in the keep. So, at the very least, got it. Is when the Fletcher? Yeah, the blacksmith's wife's been... We've been trying to track her down today, but... I honestly am not sure. I haven't spoken with the blacksmith in quite some time. Okay. Normally, Escobert does that for me. We, we'll talk to him. We're on our way there. All right. But okay. if any civilians you can save is even better. You got it. And he kind of hands the reins over to Arthur. Alright. We should... We're going now. Alright. And... Uh, so you stop by the blacksmith first, I presume? Onward, squishy! Yeah. Yeah, uh, The jacket right and there. the... The other important thing. That... You ride over, uh, and the door is open. Hi. Uh, hello. He goes, yes. Well, while they're going to the blacksmith, I'm going to go back to the keep to try and get Luca. No, I, I'm. I would have gone to get Luca. Oh, I, didn't. I wouldn't have left him behind. He probably would have been dragged out by Arthur when she got about to leave. Hello? Yes! Oh, hi! Uh, we're here to pick up our stuff! Oh, great! Uh, he comes out very awkwardly carrying a bunch of uh, javelins. Just kind of okay, sets them down. Ah, oh, thank you. Oh, and earrings. And he kind of walks back, pulls out two very crudely made earrings. They're not like, they're not like fine 
craftsmanship, but they are earrings. Thank you so much. Ah, yes. Uh, I think that's all you guys had? You guys didn't and order her? nails, did you? And her blades? Ah, oh, yes, 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 yes. I kind of drags uh, the long sword and then fairly easily carries the short sword and kind of sets him down and goes, All right. Order the, order the what? Huh? What? He, he asked she just if, has a short sword. No, but he yeah. asked if we were the people who ordered the, the what? Nails. Oh, no, we didn't. Nails? Yeah. So order nails. Building materials. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm sorry, you did you forget the giant, the, the, the green and red women that just approached? Like, we're, we can't stand out here. Lots of people have come in and out. <laughs> Oh yeah, you guys were the ones who broke my bell. I'm sorry. At it. <sighs> oh well, I'll fix that later. Uh, well, you guys paid for it. You're good to go. Uh, Do you have any um, honing stones so I can keep the edge on this blade? He kind of reaches underneath the counter and pulls out a whetstone and sets it down. How much? Take it. Thank you. Welcome. I mean, he kind of looks blah, past you guys to Colt and Jasha and goes, "Do you guys need anything?" Uh, no, no, we're just no. we're just here with them. Okay. All right. I gotta go back to making nails. Actually. I just look at I just look at Ayana. I go, earrings really? Don't right, they look nice? Right now, the town's on. Yeah. He's busy. Oh. Why did you task him with earrings? Just wanted to support local businesses. You want earrings? Uh, yeah. See, those are so adorable. Put them oh. on right now. Let me see them on you right now. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Joshua and I walk out of the blacksmith. As, as <laughs> I just walked away from the blacksmith, she she said, "Tempest thanks you." Kind of up and goes, "Kazintai." <laughs> <laughs> All right. You guys oh my ready? gosh, those look so those look so precious on you. Uh, you. Note: putting in the earrings, they are not small needles for the pierce part uh, they're about the size of a trim nail so they're oh. a little thick I've got gauges now is what you're saying yeah <laughs> <laughs> a, a, trim, a trim nail isn't that thick but yes it is well yeah but I'm, I'm working game. on gauges like the beginning ones so if you force them to go in then yes <laughs> so so Arthur says it a little strained because because that looked painful. It's just like they look they look so darling on you. You need pain. Yeah, so smiling. Uh, as Ayana's <laughs> bleeding from the ears. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, well, you guys ready? <clears throat> All right. No time to distract it. We need to get going. Squishy, yep, yep. Let's go. <laughs> Oh my word! <laughs> Avatar State. Yep, yep. Uh, oh my voice uh, cracked right there. That was gross. All right. <clears throat> All right. So. All right, so we well, get going. Let's go. Uh, on the road. Two again. hours. We. <laughs> two hours, and we're finally on the road. All right. Woo! Uh, anybody who wants to, feel free to make a perception check. Oh yeah. Uh, what's the worst that could happen? Nope, I got Oh, them. nope. Oh, wait, there, there it is. Right. Uh, <laughs> during this, Arthur, you're the only one who kind of... Classic Valkyria. Uh, find the footprints of the various beasts, and some of them are real deep uh, on the retreat, then the forward march, because you can see the two different tracks. Uh, as you can presume that the bigger beasts 
were weighed down. Uh, and as you travel, the region becomes more rugged and rocky plateaus and start to replace the rolling hills as you go to. Uh, right, and th at this point, I would want to be to keep the tr the trail. I'd want to do survival instead, or nature. Uh, yeah. Go ahead and make a quick survival check. Survival. Uh, even as like the terrain changes from grassy plains to a rock, uh, you can kind of keep track of where some of the footprints are, especially on the retreat. As like I said, they were. Presumably more weighed down, so they left deeper impressions. Uh, as you travel, you can eventually see, as it is starting to get dark, but you can very faintly see what looks like uh, some smoke from a few miles away. Not again. Oh dear. Uh, and is it a. Uh... It's is it, not like is there a like call. a settlement? Uh, or no. You... More like a camp. Probably a camp, yeah. Uh, I'll halt uh, and try to... Guys, we should find a way to... Well, we need to... Something's over there. Probably not good. We should investigate quietly I can be quiet um go well see, uh, <laughs> are you sure do you you know what we could do we could play a game oh no what game I love it's games the quiet game the quiet game my dad plays that game with me yeah let's do it <laughs> All right, so you know you already know the rules. Oh yeah, I'm a master at this game. All right, Th there's gonna be some sort of tweak to the rules. Mm -hmm. Uh, if you're gonna be going with me quiet, like you gotta follow what I'm gonna, any direction I give you, with my hands. Yeah. Like like this, and I give like a thumbs up and. <laughs> I don't know what you mean, like any direct, whatever. I'll, I'll follow you, don't worry. We got this. We're gonna be. Right. Okay, starting now. Oh. So okay, wait, 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 wait. I just wanted to say <laughs> that I'm really <laughs> excited about this. Okay, now go. Uh, okay. <laughs> well, wait. Uh, uh, it, who's willing to, who wants to come with and who's willing to stay behind? I mean, is the smoke trail in our path? Uh, yes. Oh, okay. The trying to lead directly to the smoke. And we and can't, I, and we can't I, see anything? I, like, brush is too thick to see what the source of it is? I mean, there's a bit of a... Like, well, you can see that there's a small campfire. Yeah, he said it wasn't there. a huge column. It was sort of more wispy. And, and we can't see, like, Which, anybody around it? Uh, I, I imagine not from where we had... Not where we had stopped. Nope. There's blobs, bro. I'm nearsighted. Uh, yeah, you cannot tell what's going on exactly. I you just see the light. Um, okay. Valkyria, I love you and all, but you're kind of wearing heavy, loud armor now. Are you sure you could be sneaky? I mean, if anyone's really quiet, it's Luca. No. So at the same time at the same time that Lucas says it, Arthur says it like even louder. No. No. <clears throat> he he's not really someone that gets up in the thick of it. I I'm try like to stay out of the shrub. thick of it. <laughs> like a healing shrub. That's pretty rad. I can keep my armor quiet. All right, <laughs> girls trip. Let's go. Well, I mean, kind of bad feeling about this. Uh, we're coming too. Like it's not oh, just so you. We're all just going. Uh, I honestly, Colt, it. I would prefer at least Joshua and you to be with him. It was more, 
more a question of like who was gonna if I, there was gonna be one more person or all right I do not understand you I know that I go with Ayana Okay. Um. Oh, all right. I, I'm actually doing this. Okay. Let's let's go. Uh, Ayana, quiet game is starting okay, right starting, now. Starting now. Okay. 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 <laughs> now. All right. Everybody who's moving forward, make a stealth check for me. What curious is at disadvantage? You're at disadvantage. Oh no! Yeah, this is gonna go. Oh this is gonna no! Go great. Who's no! bad at the quiet game now? Oh. I mean, Valkyrie has to roll sneezed. again. Yeah, you're disadvantaged yes, because you're heavy armor. Heavier. Oh, so heavy armor. Oh. That's what I was trying to tell you. I didn't understand that. Fun time. Oh, um, no. wait. Oh, it's too late. Never mind. How close are we right now? Wait. Uh, um, that yeah, that's all single digits. Wait. Wait, am I still muted? No, I'm not muted. Uh, How wait, close are we? Uh, uh, I will show you. Oh, Just, great. So it's too I'll late sort, to cast Bless. I can, I'll sort wait, of, I'll sort can of I, lean over to can Joshua. I use my, can I use my fate point oh, um, gosh. to boost my score? Well, it's a nat one, so I guess it doesn't you certainly really change can. it, does it? It makes it to an automatically succeed. Oh, the fate point automatically makes it succeed? Uh, yeah, but it's going to come back to bite you. That's how we die. I mean, oh, listen. That's right. Even if you pass, though, right? It's, it's still a, it's an three average out fail. of two out of three failed. There's no point in using it. Yeah. Mm, okay. I'm gonna lean over to Joshua and be like, "How far do you think they'll get?" I'm sorry. I was. I had to talk with my brother-in-law, so I wasn't uh, here to put in input. But uh, yeah, this was a bad idea. Yeah, <laughs> I just staying back. <laughs> And, I just put. Uh, I I looked back and I was like, "Oh, they were serious." They were serious. <laughs> oh yeah, they're they'll be gone like that, five minutes before we start hearing them. If we weren't super close, okay. I would have cast bless on us. Just just saying that now. Uh, by the time that the stealth checks became yeah. a problem, yeah. Uh, I'll say this is where you guys are, and I'm just gonna put everybody else in this odd corner, just so. And you guys, we're, we're still on the grass oh, map. I'm going to throw the map on. I'm throwing everybody else on real fast. Oh, gotcha. Because I didn't know who was going to be where. So I didn't throw you guys on the map yet. Okay. Um, maybe if I can select him. How do we manage to make every single wrong decision? I don't I, how did I manage? I just, I, I'm still so upset that I got a negative one. Not a negative how, one. How was a oh, bad I, one? I was looking at okay. I was looking at uh, <laughs> I, Valkyria's I'm, stealth check, and I was like, "How is your stealth modder only plus two? Like that doesn't make any sense. You're a text-based rogue. Your stealth should be like infinity." Really? <laughs> and then I just I forgot that. Have you already rolled a disadvantage? I, yep. I, oh, my dexterity is fine. I'm good. Yeah, no. Heavy armor rolls at disadvantage, and uh, some I mediums think, arm. Some medium armors do yeah, as well. Yeah, some medium armor. I roll. Too. I roll you for disadvantage check. currently. Yeah, because you, well, you have. You have. Oh, you have scale mouth. That's right. Yeah. yeah. Like I that's think that's the only medium armor that doesn't roll at disadvantage is like. Well, there's the chain the shirt, chain? and there's the breastplate. But I think um, breastplate still rolls at disadvantage. Doesn't breastplate, it? no. Okay, Breast, it's just, breastplate it's is just the same. The it's the same AC as a scale mail, but you don't roll disadvantage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. So this is what you see uh, of various human uh, people roasting and bickering about how to cook a hen, whereas various little kobolds are trying to steal said hen. Uh, why don't we just sit on them the way, and squash the them into jelly? Is, I guess part of the flavor of the failing is that we were still on our horses, and that was the mistake. <laughs> I thought you guys got uh, off I your horses. I feel like we would have gotten off of we our horses. Off yeah. Horses. Eh. 
it was, was like we were walking up and I just went, oh, Let, let's be me. let's be super stealthy. Clop, 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 clop. <laughs> yeah. Hey guys, let's be quiet now. <laughs> Shh, be very quiet. We're hunting wabbits. Right. Anyway. Oh, <laughs> yeah. That is what you see and they are very preoccupied. <laughs> Somehow. Oh, preoccupied. Oh. Okay, okay. Guys, let's go back. I'm in a loud whisper, but I'm actually Shh. really whispering Shh. really quietly. Stage whispering. I can't. I'm you stage whispering. <laughs> you know, I, I come over here and I like cover her face. You can't. You're too short. I stand on my tippy toes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> get wrecked. <laughs> burr, burr. Shots fired. It's, it's like, I, it's like, it's quiet game, quiet game. I mean, no, but look at all those guys. Let's go back. Let's get, let's count them. Okay. One, two, three, one. <laughs> We're just li- What? <laughs> have 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 we noticed that they're like bickering at this point? Like, can we see them like thirty feet away? Just like my passive perception is fourteen. Like, I figure I could see them uh, with well, those three points of perception. Yes, you can. You don't know what they're saying because you are further than three, thirty feet away. Okay. Right. Well, so like 80. after I get a after I get a look at like, do they have wagons near them? Uh, no. But you okay. So the. <laughs> Quick perception check for me. Okay. I hop off my horse and begin to walk it towards a tree. Oh, what? What are these rules? What are these rules? It's supposed to be good. Yeah, because. What are you looking for? That's your ash. All right. That's. Shush. They they certainly seem to be preoccupied. Shit. Shit. Is he following them? Oh. Yep. That's why. That's why I'm tying my horse to this tree. And I start. And I, start I start. I start lashing my I, I pull to the back. Tree. I pull back, and I and I uh, tug on them to go back the way we came. I'm gonna. Yeah. I'll. I'll just be like, Colt, stay here. I'll go catch up with them. No, we, we we're walking back to you no. guys. Well, then we'll run into each other, won't we? Okay, we'll, we'll run go. into the middle there. <laughs> roll a stealth check for me, Joshua. I mean, I'm I'm going with them after my horse was done. Okay. Then you no, roll a stealth check too. I guess I am. All roll right. a stealth check. Right. Oh my gosh, you guys! Oh right, I roll a disadvantage. No. I yep. that's why I was saying I told you I was good. I was just like, go oh, maybe I'll be you right just back. let us walk back to you hey, guys. Hey, let's be honest here. Yeah. None of them noticed a total, absolute, brutal group failure. Damn, yeah, they rolled horribly. Okay, so me Not to me, but a four and a six. Oh my gosh! Wouldn't that be a passive perception detection thing? Uh, no, because they're preoccupied. So oh. and they'd have even then. It'd still be at disadvantage. And they'd oh still yeah, nuts. they'd have like a five passive perception or something. Yeah. All right. So. Oh wow. So I did so we just expected. yeah, you did we, really well. Meet. We meet in the middle. Yeah. You guys meet, and you guys are now about fifty feet away from the little edge of this cliff right here. That's a cliff. I mean, it's a hill that goes up into a small plateau. So we'd have it, the high it, ground there? It, it this flows. section is over so Anakin. Yeah. You could have the high ground, okay. should you. So we could just sneak around. Guys, I saw this no, movie once. So... It was called Star Wars. And like no. there was this one guy, he had no. the high ground. A movie. Stop. Stop. It's, called, it's like a dream, kind of. Uh, Don't try it, but I right. get... <laughs> All right. All right. So the... The wagons are not, or whatever they were using to drag everything, they don't seem to be there right now. Well, this obviously deeper. isn't the cave. Yeah, this is just right. I, I understand that. I'm just easy. saying. That's... Let's just go around them. Go this way. Well, that's yeah, the, oh, that's on the other side of the plateau. They seemed preoccupied with yeah. something, which <laughs> I don't know. We, I feel like we need to check. Check the, what? what they might be preoccupied with. Okay, then let me get a look. Okay, wait, before you do, let Bahamut go with you. And I bless him. Uh, God. And whoever else is going. That God's done I'm staying behind. I, I'm, I'm gonna try it one more time. 
Joshua has a soured experience with Bahamut, seeing as that's what got everybody messed up. <laughs> Alright. Oh, wait, no! Um, you were already I, gone so, by then. I was so, already down. So, anyway. anyway, so we're... So yeah, I've got the yeah. blessing, and then I'm, I'm going to... try with... to sneak up again and take a look. Reroll your cell checks. Note, bless does not help ability checks. Right. Yeah. It's just I attack, it's attack it rolls and saving throws. No. Attacks Can and I save. take that back then? Because I would have known that, right? Yes. Yeah. Meredith Gu- never reads. Guidance is what allows people to add to their yeah. okay. checks. That's why I went in earlier in the week to check everything. You guys sneak up where you wanting to sneak to. Just that itch. I, mean, yeah, I don't want to get like super close or anything like that. I'm... Right, and I guess I noticed that they were preoccupied with something. Can I focus again to see what they might be preoccupied with? Uh, uh, no. Besides the food, if it's if there's more than food, that they're go ahead with. and you can go ahead and roll another perception check. And Joshua, so can you, or you can give one or the other advantage. No. Oh, you are both wrong. Uh, you both would notice that they are very preoccupied and tantalizing and messing with the kobolds, and so occupied with this that you can see that their weapons are up against the boulders. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. They are not armed in the slightest. They're, right. They're not ready for anything. No. I I whisper over to Joshua. Maybe we go. We go around like this way. And this this way. How would you not do it? By- what? Would you not do it by yourself, though? I'm not. That's why I'm talking to Joshua about it. So this, like I said, this is elevated, right? And then... Yeah, that's it. All of that is elevated, and then... Goes up, and it's... Are these just just rocks, right? Like, this isn't a bunch of big rocks. Cave or anything like that, okay. Just a bunch of big rocks. Uh, This elevated plateau goes up about... 15 feet. I mean... Should we just try to go past him? What know. a great idea, guys! Because you're so smart. You don't I have think... a path. That's high no, I you. know. <laughs> that's, that's Meredith being sarcastic. Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, they really I don't are. Know. I feel like I feel like if we if we let them go, then there's a chance of them blocking us off when we try to leave the cave again. I know that's Wherever a lot that of though. Say that one more time for Ashley. She's deaf. That's, that's a lot of kobolds. But they are kobolds. I mean, yeah, but that's a lot they're... of them. <laughs> we it's a lot that we could kill. Or, you, you know, let them go to sleep. It's it's either it's either a lot of kobolds now, when we got the jump on them, or possibly... Uh, a lot of kobolds blocking us away from an escape. Okay. Uh, let's. I'm, I'm down. If we get the others on board, right. I'm ready to avoid. So I'm gonna head back to the other. The okay. Other. Yep. Oh. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I won't. What'd you guys I see? Won't go back. I won't go back just yet, I'll, but I won't forward. I'll just. Get my bow out and get ready. Looks like they're messing with the kobolds. Teasing them. They're not ready for a fight at all. Their weapons are 10 feet, 20 feet away from them right now. Uh, Arthur's thinking about going to gank Is she going to do something stupid? Oh, she wants to jump down and just smack them real hard. Just adjusting, because time would have to move. She she wants to she wants to take him out before we pass by. Kill him. Yeah, basically. Uh, I mean we can. There's a good spot for our less uh up close and personal people up on the cliff side here. Pretty hard to get up a 15 foot cliff. So if you guys want to stick up here, while this is happening, I'm going to cast but, false life on myself. But okay. they're not. That you said they're not armed. I mean, it's not fair. Everybody's got arms, and I just hold up my arms. <laughs> just, oh, that's all you need. 
Do you have tickets to the Gens show? Does anybody know where the does anybody know where the veterinarian is? Because these pythons are sick. Pythons are sick. Oh, uh, nice. It, I could just put him to sleep and. No, we're not doing that anymore. All right, that's right. I, I'm down for the sleep plan. I prefer a non-violent solution. Me too. Well, I mean, I'm leaving it up to a vote. I don't. I really don't. I'm down to walk past, but if we guys want to mess with them, Arthur's worried about if we don't kill him now, then on the way back, we're going to have to deal with I mean, if they just take a really nice nap, then they won't be in our way when we come back anyway. Okay, as JJ, uh, not Joshua, because Joshua obviously is an idiot, he doesn't know this, sleep only lasts for a minute. It's not like they fall asleep for eight hours. It's sleep only lasts. I've never stayed around long enough to find out. (laughs) <laughs> and so, there's no guarantee that the that, that the sleep any spell of them will hit all of them. Yeah. The last time you used it, you hit two of them. This I, is the enemy. If we do not kill them, they will kill others. That doesn't yeah, mean I, that we should just slaughter them when they're not ready for a fair fight. Then I will run in. I mean, give granted, them an extra moment to grab their weapons. In, no, in, but, in all, in all yeah. fairness, we absolutely did not have a fair fight the other last night either. <laughs> Listen, all right, my fights are fists. They don't need them. weapons if they're if they don't have weapons. That's their fault. All right, I don't need weapons. They shouldn't either. They should have. So some little guys are gonna poke you until you knock out again. All right, hey, my ding. Let me at least buy you some time, and no. you guys charge in as soon as I try to sleep. Oh, not doing this again. Stay back. Valkyria and Arthur are doing a tango. I would have, I would have stopped Valkyria. I mean, that's a stealth check, isn't it? Oh, that... the Valkyria, are you trying to be stealthy? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Great. Man, well, you know, I totally can, called can I it stop? that we are I, gonna go about an encounter I, I'm gonna wrong stop. at least I, once. I am tonight. going to like I I'm it's probably now, too I was late by then. Well no, because I we was got to this you. point before and they didn't notice. I mean Well But I would have looked back after like a couple minutes like what where's what's taking them so long? And I would have seen you. I mean you would have hurt her. Well yeah. Clink, clink, clink. So I, I would stop. I would stop Valkyria. What are you doing? Oh. No answer. None of us know how to plan, do we? I, Luca does, but I he doesn't want to take plan. initiative. I cast I Jigglypuff. To... All right. Brando, are you still there? Valkyria is focused. Oh, wait, what time is it? No, he's already left, and he's come back. Oh, he's back. Hello. There you go. Hi. Okay. You guys ready? So, I would have... No, wait. So, as... I'm coming up on these clips. Right, but we need to have a plan. We don't have a plan right now. Oh my gosh, we're going to take forever planning. Oh. This is the thing. We'll have the we'll have the ranged the ranged people curl around onto the to the uh, cliff up there. You're just Wait telling Valkyria until... this because you're not you <laughs> right. didn't walk back over. Right. Well, right. Because I assumed that Joshua would have told it, but yeah, I said everything. get the ranged people so, up on the cliff. Yeah. And the the like, Where ranged you people. Here? Ranged people will need to take some time to get up on over to that side of the cliff. Once we get in position, then you can charge. Okay, well then hurry. Right. All right. I'll let you guys quickly get into position. Ayana, you should do that protective thing really quick. The bless? No, the mage armor. Ah, uh, fine. I can't I mean, mage armor. It lasts for eight hours, so. I know. I'll just go like so, here. I How myself. tall is the cliff? Like right over. It was fifteen. Well, I mean that was far end. 
up here sits probably a just shy of ten. I figured they would probably notice you if you were right there, Arthur. Like that's well, pretty but pretty sus. The, we fail. We failed a. We okay, kind of well. failed our stealth check, but still managed. Well, to if you're going to like get into a spot and hide pretty close, go ahead and roll right. another one. Where is it? Okay. <laughs> I was. Uh, Iana's doing backflips. Don't worry, guys. I'm army crawling. <laughs> <laughs> I got this. Iana's like yeah, Iana's like splinter cell, just going down the cliff. <laughs> Everybody who hangs out or stops near the edge needs to make a stealth check. Iona vented. <laughs> Iona's an electrical. Now security. Now mid bay. Alright. Everybody where they want to be. More or less, I guess. Right. Luca, do you want to get any higher or right there? Okay. I get my bowl ready. Alright. Go ahead and quickly roll initiative. Me. Also, my bow out. Bo oh, I do a nice click. Oh, are you kidding me? Nope. I'm too busy army crawling. I'm like, is this good enough? No, a little bit are further. You serious? A little bit further. Are we at least gonna have like a surprise attack? Yes, you do. Because they absolutely are not expecting you. So you get a surprise round. Uh, does everybody have yeah, sure. I feel like I'm missing somebody. Arthur, missing you. No, Arthur's at the very bottom. Oh, she is. Who am I missing? Ayana. I'm at the very bottom. I rolled a nat one. And, and I, oh, why didn't it put me on? Did you and click? Yes, I clicked myself because I moved myself there. Here we go again. <laughs> my, and my dex is... My dex would... Most likely be higher than. Yeah, those. but Meredith, are are you the little bubbles above it your head right now? I have to stay with it on. You have to click so that the little bubbles are above you, and then. Yeah, I did there. that. Okay. Well, they have to be like actively above your head. Oh, okay. I clicked off after that. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, Colt, you get to go first. Literally, um, that's five, ten, fifteen, twenty, thirty. Um, I will I'll just blast this cobalt to the front left of me. Alright. Roll attack. Meh. Oh, jeez. That's <laughs> my... That's literally impossible for that thing. 17 damage, alright? I just... <laughs> it just becomes... Oh, no, on the ground. Yelp. Just dust. I cast Yelp. <laughs> yeah, he, he becomes just gore on the ground. <laughs> Wait. What? Right. Anything right. else? No, <laughs> that's nah. All right, Cobalt, they're surprised. Jasho. Uh, are you doing a range thing, Jasho? Because uh, why do you go on the cliff? No, I'm. Because he's a monk, he can like, sprint. I could just jump down here. And he can jump down to fifteen. That's no, that's, it's it's only fifteen, like up here. Yeah, it's, it's only fifteen like, to the top. It's like five or five. It's like five feet. to seven from red right, from where he jumped off. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'll punch this cobalt. All right, punch the cobalt. Punch. I'll nope. Punch, punch. Bonus action punch. Okay, that does hit. This guy's holding initiative. <laughs> <It's the exile. laughs> I did Just it. Put guys. an X on him or whatever, right? <laughs> I found the guy holding initiative. Everybody. <laughs> Did it. There you go. Now Austin knows my pain. <laughs> Normally I have somebody hidden, but then I learned that you guys can't see it. Alright, Cultus. Surprise. Fuck you. Uh, let's see here. I'm a little confused on how diagonal distances now, because I thought I had to, like, I don't know. Oh, where are you um, wanting to go? Well, I'm trying to. I mean, it's a, that's more than 30 feet. That's definitely figured, more than right? 30 feet, yeah. Yeah. For 30 so feet, you can go 5, 10, 15, 20. You can get 30. there. 30 is there. there. Yeah. Yeah. 
Right there. Oh. <sighs> or there, yeah. Or, but or where? I have two extra javelins, so. That's true. Yeah, I do have the javelins. <laughs> Yay. Yep. Doing some javelin action here. That this gold oh, ball. Oh, sorry. Um, yes, this one right here. Okay, that hits. Bah! Hit him to the ground. You just <laughs> impale him into the ground. Heck yeah. Metal. Anything else? That one. Uh, I don't think I can do anything else. So that's about it. All right. Archer. <laughs> Stop. Gosh. Okay. That's I'm it. going to be... <laughs> All right. Take your shot. <laughs> Not throwing your shots. Oh, gosh. Uh, actually, no, you're hidden. You get advantage. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, he had no idea where you were. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no! No! <laughs> <laughs> what is yeah, this? Oh my. Well, Almost at least you get the nat one. He turns and dodges it right, as you fire. He catches uh -oh. the arrow. He looks up at you and goes, And there went uh, my natural sneak attack! Cute. Get uh. riggedy riggedy wrecked, y'all! <laughs> oh my gosh. I just right. know that I can hear Ashley crying and staring. Wait, anything else real fast? Uh, no. Okay. Okay. Um, let's see. I don't really want to attack, but <coughs> I move up here. Okay. Prick my finger for the drop of blood and cast Bane on. Can I get these three? Uh, uh yeah. You can hit those three. Uh, it's charisma save. Yes. Uh,. DC 13. That top one saves with a natural 19. That middle one fails. And the bottom one fails. So they are banked. These two. Right here. Cool. Alrighty. Can I... Okay, because I... Can I hold my action until someone approaches Joshua? Uh... Yes, like what action I want to hold. Uh, I've got my crossbow out and I'm still like just laying in the grass. Sniper okay. action. <laughs> and as soon as one gets close or like within melee distance of him and attacks him, then I'll shoot. Next military okay. sniper over here. I mean, technically uh, one is already in melee distance, but that's true. Well, yeah, but I'm waiting for them to try to hurt you first because no one's. Mm. This is still messed up. <laughs> the, the two people that don't want to attack unarmed opponents are. Trying real hard. Yeah. Uh, is that it? Yeah, that's all I'm doing. Colf, back to you. Okay. I'm gonna go five. Uh, math, brain, 25. 30. There. Bonus action, Misty Step. 5, 15, 20, 30. Oop. And I'm just going to stand there. I'm not ready in action for anybody to get openly aggressive at me or going for the weapons. Okay. Yeah. Kobolds, they, these ones immediately run, go, f uh, wrong way, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, they would have dashed, 5, 10, Wait, are the 15. weapons in here, or are they on the other side of the rocks? No, they're, they're in this inner area of the rocks. Okay. Uh. They run this one. Basically, they all run. The only ones who can't quite make it are this one. Does, who end up. Does he get a, a 
attack of opportunity. Yeah, if they uh, if they them, inter- yes. get into a circle, yeah. or were they going around the rocks? Because uh, if they're going around the rocks, of, I don't. Two of them went around the rocks. Uh, one of them went right past you. Okay. The one that was closest to you went past you. So you'd get an attack of opportunity on him. Dean. That hits. He's dead. <laughs> Whap. Just Whap. cleave him in half as he runs by. The unholy you just half. like hold out your sword and let him yeah, run. Yeah, he, he just <laughs> runs through it. <laughs> uh, and this guy runs and gets behind this rock vaguely. Pardon uh, me. Jeff, you get an attack of opportunity as he goes. That hits. Bop. Never mind. <laughs> well, we're gonna bop, 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 bop to the top. All right. Gotta get uh, another High School Musical reference in here. Chesho, what do? <laughs> oh, I think you know what do. I have a good idea. I'm gonna punch him. <laughs> Start with this guy. Okay. That hits. Punch. Okay. He's still up. And again, punch. That hits. He did. Oh, he did. He did. Uh, and actually, sorry, can I do flurry of blows? So get one more attack, basically. I'll let you this time, but next time, call okay. it first. I'm going to attack the other guy next to me. Wow. No, you're not. <laughs> no, I'm not. Negative. Uh, negative. Uh, incorrect. Right. Pattern is full. All right. Uh, can I actually, can I use the rest of my movement real quick? Uh, yeah, I, you only I still like, like, I have like 20 feet left. I'm just going to go. monkey like 30, actually. I just have unlimited feet of movement. I just run. He has, he has unlimited, unlimited feet. feet. Yep. He's ready for feet pics on OnlyFans. That should be the name of this episode Unlimited Feet. Unlimited, unlimited feet. feet. Uh, cultists go. They immediately run to this rock and start picking up weapons. Dang, I knew they were going to scoot right outside my attack range like that. Well, that one runs to that rock. This one goes 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. That one probably will not move because of, never mind, I <laughs> rolled in that one. Oh, gosh. And we're you'll have to him dash down. to get right next to you, Cole, to pick up his so weapon. My ready to action goes off. Okay. Except he's not aggressive, but yes. Well, he, I said to get aggressive with me or to grab weapons. Okay. Go ahead and attack then. 25. That misses. 13. Okay. You kill him where he stands. Oh, he was the oh, one holding initiative. That was the one with the initiative. <laughs> oh, no. There it goes before Valkyria. Boom, boom. Uh, wow. And this one. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. And grabs his weapon. Dang. Right. Valkyria. I'm so upset right now. Did you roll a nat 1 on your <laughs> just like, attack of opportunity? I took sentinel feet so 20, I could punch people that could leave and never was just... Yeah. 30. I like tro- la, 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 la. And I... Th- Throw at this one. Okay. Yeah. Oh. It's unfortunate. Like fling it by and he just and just barely dodges as it slams into the boulder next to him. Alright. Uh, that's that's my uh, wonderful turn there. Arter. Arter. <laughs> We're going to be having words after this session. Okay. <laughs> the words will um, be, you asked for it. No. Shut up. Which one do you uh, want? Arter or short jokes? Or no last dogs. You'll be getting anyway, both. But... I'll be getting both. Oops, you prefer. Okay. So I'll move over here and I'll shout down to everyone. Don't let them escape. I mean, like three of them I'll already did. at that one. Okay. No, they're, they're, they haven't escaped. They're still yeah, they're here. They're on the other side of the rocks. We I just can't see hiding. them. Yeah. Okay. This is some pretty That's zen this. combat music. That misses? I don't know what, but I can't hear the music at all. What? Wait, I didn't put on battle music. That misses? No, that hits. 
Oh, that hits. Okay. Yeah, he. I am thinking he's wrong. I think he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. I just did a throw on battle music because I knew this fight wasn't going to last long. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> uh, Alright. Uh, anything else? I'll throw that one on. Uh, Almost uh, in F. No. Okay. Um, Luca, what do? What well, do you do? This guy has a weapon now, right? Yes. Okay. They both have picked up their weapons. I will move here. And launch a sacred flame at him. Nope, that's six. Four damage. Neat. Uh, anything else? Mm, nope. If they're armed, I don't feel bad about attacking. Okay. I am. Well, uh... Yeah, I'll move here and try... Getting this guy with a fire bolt. Okay, make an attack roll. Yes. That hits. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was a warning like... shot. <laughs> level three. Maybe I'm your weapon. Level three. And it will be, we'll be fine. Uh, that's not level three. That's just real okay. low rolls. Persuasion. Or intimidation, whichever one. Okay. Do you lay down his weapons? You don't know yet. It's cool. Oh. It's not gonna make it. If he had to roll a uh, like if he had to roll a like a wisdom save, doesn't he roll a d4 and subtract it? If he makes a save, yes. Oh, okay. I didn't know if he was saving against Ayana's persuasion thing. Hmm. Okay, um, I'm going to turn to the guy next to me and just, I'm going to make an attack, but I'm trying to disarm him. Okay. That hit. Right. I just want to, like, smack his hand with the flat of my sword and just try to get him to drop his weapon. Okay, then it's less damage and more make a... Sh For you, I'll let it be a charisma check. Just a straight charisma check, or like persuasion, or straight. intimidation. Nope, straight charisma. Eight. Yeah. Be, you smack his arm as with the flat of your blade, and he holds on to his weapon. All right. Well, I gave you a chance to lay down your weapon. That's it, buddy. Okay. Uh, oh, it's over. Wait, can I like bonus action shove him with my shield? That would have been your attack action. Dang, alright. And that was kind of the, your attack, is just attempting to disarm. Gotcha, okay. Alright, uh... Cobalt's turn. Bye! <laughs> uh, nope, it still thinks it has a ch chance. It runs over here. It says, I am gonna head out. Uses its sling on Arthur. Just... Meh! Does a 23 hit? Uh, yeah. Does a twenty-three hit? Does it, casually, does a twenty-three hit? You take six uh, points of bludgeoning damage. Dude, just, even with like a rocket, you real good. Even with, with ah. like three quarters cover. Yeah. Just smack. Uh, and other cobalt goes five, ten, fifteen, twenty. Sees Valkyria and does the same. Eats with a sling. Nope, that's a 10. Nope. Not nah, definitely okay. hits Valkyria and Splint Mail. Yeah. Alright. Chesho. Okie doke. Oh, Roy, oh. you already know what time it is. It's the punching time. time. Over. Give him a gun. Give him a gun. 40. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you took my spot. It'll be fine. So you're just punching? Uh, 
who got hurt the most so far that I've seen? Right. Right. No, right. not you. Oh. I don't care. Oh, okay. I don't care about you. Guy to your right. Yeah. Technically, guy to your right. I'm, I'm already at a point where I'm like, damage. it's over. Okay, I I punched man. man. This yes, that man. It's fourteen oh. hits. That hits. I'm doing non-lethal damage here, trying to. Okay. He is unconscious then. <laughs> Gunk. Bop. Do it again. Flurry of blows. Okay. Nope. Yeah. That just hits. Yeah. Whoa. Still non-lethal if this knocks him out. Punch. You like punch him and you can feel his nose break under it, but he just kind of stays there. Oh. He's like, Ugh. Oh. <laughs> Is he still uh, uh, up? He's still up. Uh, okay, uh, he must save on a dex throw or be knocked prone using my open hand technique. Does a 16 succeed? Yes. Damn. <laughs> What's the DC? Is it like 8 it's plus 12. your proficiency bonus plus your wisdom modifier or something? Yeah, it's 12. Your wisdom modifier is only 2? Currently, yeah. Oh, okay. It's a 15. Next level. Okay. The cultist goes before Valkyria, but accidentally cleared it. Uh, he's going to attempt to disengage uh, and run. Five, Little does he know. Yeah. Five, ten. Go ahead and make your attack of a. Come on! Uh, I'll get one, too. No, oh, I do he disengage. It, you know, it oh, disengage. no, because he's got the sentinel feet. So yeah. disengaging doesn't... Uh, I hate mm. not rolling <laughs> good. 15, 20, 20, Ash, what have you done to me? 30. I didn't do anything. But that's as far as he can get. So, Valkyria. What do? What, what do indeed? All I can see is this stupid... Uh, cobalt that attacked me, so 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. And dynamic lighting does a good job of being like, man, where are my teammates? <laughs> where are my teammates? Yeah, when it's set to be nighttime, yeah, I'm just gonna let you know. Um, and then I'm going to swing at a sword. Okay, that a sword. Is he, Jeez. You just kind of, in a bit of fury, just cleave him upwards and he just sticks for a second and then he falls off. Can I bonus action javelin? <laughs> oh. Okay. Uh, I know. Just, you do have just, throw your, attack. just throw your short sword. Just throw my short sword at the guy. <laughs> if you want to, it'd be an improvised weapon. It's uh, a. Uh, I mean, it's the right distance. If you want to try to throw your short sword, I'd let you do it. I will throw my dagger. Can I throw my dagger? Sure. That has the throne properties. I'll let you do it. All right. So how do I, what do I do? Do I Should do anything do different? Click, just click dagger. If you have it. That hits. Roll damage. You just kind of throw it, and it hits him in the back, and he falls to the ground. Oh my gosh, wow. Laughs in Darth Sidious. Do it. Do it. Shooting at that one. Okay. Next shot. Please. That hits. He's dead, even at the lowest damage. Yeah. Very dead. He just, he just gets, ha! And then you shoot him in the mouth and falls to the crowd. <laughs> uh, Alright. Fight's over. Good team. So, uh, first off thing for Valkyria is she goes and she collects her dagger and her two javelins. Okay. I'm gonna go over to the, the dude that's unconscious and like pat him down and try to find some flavor of like insignia or something or other what if uh, weird plot twist 
none of these people had anything to do with the cult. They were, they were just, just hanging campers. out with some kobolds, and they're just <laughs> hanging out. <laughs> we just no one matter. stopped to ask him now, did they? Hey, they left yeah. one alive, and Valkyries would be like, "Do you want me to take care of this one's interrogation?" Nope, 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 nope. I want to nah. do it. Nah. Oh. <sighs> Sit there, patting him down. It doesn't seem like he has any. Well, he has like a small badge, but that is the only semi mark that he has. Okay. Have, have I seen this before? Uh. You have not. Okay. Uh, but the person who searched uh, uh, Lang de Rosa, it is a vaguely oh. similar badge. Uh, not it quite looks similar the same. to his. Yeah, it, his is Lang de Rosa's was much more like ornate, ornate. and yeah. complex. Whereas yeah, he was a he was a light. higher up, so he's bound to have a, a cooler looking badge. Was Lang de Rosa yeah, the I, half dragon? Yeah. Yes. So I saw uh, it. Hey, Slaughter Moser, yes. thank for the follow, man. Oh, well, th and I also saw it because I yeah, took Arthur, it. basically anybody who would have searched him would have found it. I mean, I stripped him of um, his I armor. Also, I also go around getting... Uh, I had three arrows that I shot. I'm going to try to get my three arrows back. This is the guy that I, uh, Luca uh, cast Bane on, right? Uh, yes. Yeah. And that gives him disadvantage on... That gives him no. a negative D4 to any attack rolls or saving throws. It's basically right. blessed, but backwards. I want to, yeah. I I like, slap him awake. No, 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 no. Let's be gentler with this. Okay, fine, I'll pat him. I'm just going to pour a little Boy. bit of first, water on his head. First, before we wake him up, I look at his leg. You look at his leg. Is there uh, a wound on his knee? With your investigation check... That's not. Okay, cool. All right. Water. I'm going to pour a little bit of water on his head and wait for him to and kind of come to. Yeah, goes, uh, and then uh, I'm going to brush my hair out of my face and cast friends on him. Oh. Oh, dear. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. I just, I point at uh, Luca and I just like, hey, come by the fire. It's cold. Come hang out. Uh, an 11. Yeah, that fails. Let myself yeah. down. He's kind of... Yeah, kind of uh, sit. Hi, who are you? Uh, good job. <laughs> <laughs> Asking him the... Yeah. I'm cultist number never three. Ask names. Uh, Meredith, never ask names to a DM for, like, random right. enemy NPC. Sorry, just That's say the Bob. Worst. His name Bob. His, <laughs> name, his name is Dirth Culkin. <laughs> no, he, he, he says, My name Brasco. Let's go. Okay, and what are you doing out here? I was eating. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, what's, the, what's this symbol? And I face the symbol towards him, or the badge, whatever it is. What's this? Oh, you. That's just the mark of an initiate. As he just kind of looks at you confused. Well, at least what? we know that there were cultists. Is, is that my badge? No, this is uh, mine. So you're an initiate. Yes, I'm making rounds to these different patrols set about making sure that you guys are on your guard and know what you're talking about. Roll a deception check. Crap! Maybe we should talk faster, guys. How but long with is advantage? Lag? 14? Because oh, of a minute? Third. And then he attacks? Uh, oh, but he does still have that minus 4, though. Or the minus d4. Oh, it's not a save. Oh, it's not? Okay. No. He kind of looks at you and goes... I, why would they come check here? We. Hey man, rolling. I don't ask the questions. I was just told to come find the group, and I did. You know how the upper ups can be. They can be kind of. Ugh. They don't like. They don't like being cave? questioned. Why are you? I don't know what it is. Do you, it's do just you, got lost. Do you know and... your way back? I'm just making yeah. sure. You took you took a pretty hard bump on the head here. 
you fell off the cliff, so I'm just making sure you remember your way back, right? I think you need an escort at home and maybe draw me a map very quickly. I mean, I, I can. I, I could draw a quick map, but I'm. But if you were sent to look, why? We want to make sure you're not an imposter. You're acting pretty sus. <laughs> he starts like <laughs> patting down his pants, and he goes, "I just had my bat." Match. Okay, just describe it as quickly as you can. Uh, at this point, the snow <laughs> would have faded, but he is just so out of it from being punched in the head. <laughs> he took a solid bonk. So, Nipper still lives. Valkyria is like ready, though, for him to do anything messed up. I'm within range to just stab, steady stab. I mean, in the moment that he tries to attack. It's just like, I, it's, I don't have paper or quill. It's just, it's that way. And he just kind of points in the direction of the trail. Just, just right. that way. Just, I'm, do, again, doing, just checking, making sure you're okay. You remember who's in charge, right? Let me find the name. Who is the first president? What day is it? <laughs> Who is the first president of the United States? <laughs> it's the United States. <laughs> it's a country, I mean, a country I made up. Don't worry about it. I mean, it, it's kind of a toss-up of who runs the place, but it seems there's a black dragon lady who she, she seems to be the one in power. Do you have a name? Do you remember her name? I was never told it. Okay. Or was I? Was I? This is, they're just trying to think for a minute. Can Ayana cast oh, friends on dear. him again? She certainly could. Brush my hair out of my face again. I'm like, sorry, it's really windy out here. Um, and I cast friends. Yeah, that's another 11. Yeah, what was her name? Uh... Re Rez, Rez something. Rez Dan. Rez Dan. I don't think it's Rez Dan. Rez something. Rez Joss? No, not Rez Josh. How, how do you not know who you work for? There's a whole chain of command. You know this. Long day. We're yes, all we, friends we do. Here. We're just, we're making sure that you know. Yeah. You, you We're see, checking on your concussion, bud. Yeah, uh, you took a What solid... day of the week is it, and who's the current president? <laughs> well, I mean, you know. TMS. Is the election right now? <laughs> Did you see the I lady think... in purple robes? The purple robe lady. I mean, the dragon lady wears purple robes. But then there's also another lady who hangs out with her a lot in her tent. Oh. So, man. But then there's also their... He kind of looks around and goes, I mean, I don't... I don't mean to be rude. But he's kind of... Rah, bestial. This is, and they the, this is a purple pen. lady's friend. The... There's the dragon lady, Rez Josh. And then there's the... Human in purple. Uh, that's Mondath. 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 That's her name. And then there's their right hand man, who's basically just an animal at this point. Something. Something Pax, Prax, something, something. I don't know. It's hard to remember things right now. Everything's That's, a little fuzzy. I know, and yeah, you're, you're doing just... a really great job, so I just want to thank you for being so cooperative. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... Now I'm going to tell you something very confidential, okay? I need you to... Can you remember stuff? Sort of. Not Probably not, but I'm going to tell you anyways. So, you were at Greenest last night, yes? Yes. Alright. There's a man in Greenest. He's the governor. Governor Nighthill. He's our undercover spy in Greenest. I want you to go up to him and tell him that you're a cultist. And he'll get you on the inside. And you'll be very well rewarded. 
Got it? Why would I go back to green? Roll the deception jump for me. <sighs> Shoot. <laughs> Let's try a natural 20, baby! Oh, dude! <laughs> yeah, oh, man. There we go. <laughs> Go. I believe you. I'm like, wait a second. He's what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that makes sense. Why are you giving me this assignment? Because oh, you're part of the union. You're trying to help me get a raise. Yes. We're that is exactly what I'm here to do. <laughs> You've done so well. You did so well at this post here. Um, and so we we want to get you higher up on the chain. And the best way to do that is to head to Governor Nighthill, very discreetly tell him, I'm an initiate of the cult, and I've been sent by Kolf Durkin. Kolf Durkin. Can you remember that? Do I need to write it down for you? Yes. Okay. And I write, I, I write down Kolf Durkin. And I hand it He's to him. He's got terrible amounts of brain damage. <laughs> he takes it and he goes, and he stands up and immediately falls to the ground, unconscious. Oh, well, we tried. <laughs> well, that was worth a shot. I don't know if he'll be he'll, if he'll be actually going to the governor like you're hoping. Uh probably not when he wakes up. So we should probably kill him. No. No. Uh, I pull out the rope what I bought. You? And I, uh, I tie ah, him. Okay. I tie him to the this rock Josh over here. Josh is never gonna get his rope back. <laughs> oh no no no! That that's this is a that's waste not of my rope. rope. I know, but yeah, my rope was used. We never, I, I never took it back. But that's what you were asking him to get, so that you could have rope. I never asked him in character. I just messaged him. Yeah, it, I yeah. mean. So, <laughs> yeah, I wanna, I wanna just like thoroughly tie him to even like a tree. Uh. Or, 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 or something. <laughs> Small like, trees and shrubs nearby. Okay. If you want to I, I want I want to find a, a really sturdy one and 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 let's lash him to it. And How? When, when we come back this way, we'll grab him on our way back to Greenest. You know, if he's not starved to death or like Well, if he starves to death in what is hopefully only a day's not, journey. Not starves to death, then sorry. like, you know, it's not dead from whatever reason, yeah. Oh. So how securely are you wanting to do? Basically, how much rope are you wanting to use? Um, how much would be necessary to go twice around the tree? Uh, most of these trees are pretty small. You can get around it in like 15 feet pretty easy twice. Cool. I want to use 30 feet of rope. Okay. I want to go four times around and just nice and snug to the tree. Very okay. good. I will make you roll a check for that one. Yep. That is more than enough. All right. All right. Shall we go to the cave? Wait. Where's this weapon? It's 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 pretty late. We should be settling right now. I mean, we slept or, or until if, like or if two. Anything, this is the perfect time to go to the cave. We've been we've, awake. Yeah, we've been awake for like five hours. At this point in time, I messed up my sleep schedule. It's probably like six o'clock. Okay. So oh, yeah, okay. We, we've been awake for only like right. three, then, four, then, or five yeah, hours. Let's, so let's go get right. our horses. We're all adults here. We can go to bed whenever we want. It's more seven o'clock, but still, it's quote unquote so. adults. Well, let's go get I, let's I, go I, get I, the I, horses. <laughs> let's go get the horses and let's continue. Wait, but where's his weapon? Uh, I moved him away from his weapon. I know. Where is his well, weapon? We should take the weapon. It's still yeah. by that. <laughs> It's still, by the, it's, it? it's still by the rock. But what is it? Yeah, sorry. Uh, it is a scimitar. I mean, we should take all of the weapons so that he doesn't grab them. I mean, or he's... at least we should put them up on, on the cliff. Yeah, he's like, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, let's 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 put him on top of the cliff. Just leave him there. Uh, oh, I, like... I wanted to take is... his badge from him. You already took his badge. Okay, cool. Just making sure. Are there any like? small-ish rocks that I could, like, put on top of or use to cover up the, the pile of weapons that we just died. <laughs> uh, go ahead Should we put and... it in the campfire, Ash? The remnants of the oh, campfire? Oh, the campfire is still going. Yeah, but that's way too hot okay, to let's, touch. Let's just throw it in the campfire, then. 
No, because it'll go out. So then it's covered in ash and stuff. Do I have to do a it's perception check like or investigation? I, I mean, uh, if you're if wanting want... to like find if we want rocks, to... or if you just want to bury what? it, burying would be a survival. Ah. Uh, oh. Let me try burying. Let, <laughs> let's. Can I uh, assist her with digging a hole? Uh, unless you're burying it, and more like you're just you're searching around for brush to just cover it with. Okay. Uh, and with that one, it's not terribly difficult to find some big enough brush to cover the weapons with. Coolio. There we go. All right. Good is gone. Let's, Let's continue. Go. Uh, yeah. And right. anyway, that's how I got this weird while, bruise on my face. While they <laughs> while they're going back. I want to pull Ayana aside. Be like, okay, we're going into this cave, and if we get caught, I'm going to be trying to lie and tell them we're cultists. Are you going to be able to handle that? Yeah, is is There's... the governor really a cultist? No, no, he's not. He's fine. Oh, okay. But I just want to ask, because I know that you're all about Bahamut, and I might have to say some things about Tiamat and supposedly how awesome she is, which she's not. I just... One, just want to make sure that you're okay with that and you're not going to freak out in the cave. I mean, I've got a really good poker face. <laughs> I'm going to trust you, okay? <laughs> I'll keep it Roll cool. Roll deception. Don't worry. I'm All cool. Right. I'm cool. <laughs> Roll persuasion check. I'm trying to persuade myself. <laughs> <laughs> Ten. <laughs> So, you make your way, continuing on the path, correct? Yep. On the road again. Oh, uh, wait, we forgot Is our anything else we should do oh, with this camp? Uh, I want to hide the bodies. <laughs> I want to just, like, throw them in this group of stones, just out of the vision of the cultist guy. So when he wakes up, he doesn't see that everybody's just been slaughtered. All right, go ahead and make a stealth or survival, whichever one you want. Uh, uh, I'll assist him with it. I'm better so with he'll get advantage. And you're saying you've had that bruise for like a Actually, year? I will assist. Oh yeah, it just sticks around. I'll assist you, you Arter, because you're better at stealth than I am, or survival. Uh. <sighs> okay. How? Oh wait, you have to have proficiency to assist, don't you? Though. Like, look, poke it. I uh, I have pro I, I have proficiency wanna. in both stealth and survival. Right, but I don't have assist. proficiency, so I can't assist you. Yeah. Oh, well, do you want so, to so, do survival so, instead? Well, I don't have proficiency in survival, survival either. I'll assist you. Oh. So, like, what what I'm saying is, oh, like, wait, is wait, like wait, I Iana. can't... Oh, Ayana can assist you. Don't worry. I'll move the bodies. I got the muscles. Oh, I ate oh, all okay, my spinach wait, wait, wait. as a kid. Do, do you have proficiency in survival? Yes, I do. I'll assist you. Perfect. I'll, I'll let them no. do it. Meredith. I <laughs> do. I have proficiency okay. in survival. Okay. <laughs> So you have to okay. use survival if you want advantage. Okay. Hey, Dweedle Doddle, thanks scared? for the follow, Sam. Uh, with relative ease, you pull them behind the boulder and you even just kind of toss some brush on them as a just in case. Uh, light it on fire they're... a little bit. If, uh, do you want to light them on fire? No. <laughs> no. Okay. no. Nothing, nothing says hiding a body like the so, smell of dead uh... body. Hey, man. I feel like we should do some in terms of uh, sending him off. Okay, you do that. We're gonna go to the cave, and we'll just meet up later so, then. So we well, just oh, wait. we just brutally ambushed them and killed them while they had no weapons, and now we're talking about honor. Yeah, we didn't listen to what my god would want. So let's keep going. Uh, Equal it, opportunity well, here. While they're talking, I will go over to Luca and ask him: Is there anything you want to do for these people? That Love you. we just killed. You can turn off the TV and stuff. As you ask that, I believe Joshua has been trying to get me to touch his weird bruise on his face. That is not what I thought you were going to say. I was real concerned. No. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Luca, touch my dick. <laughs> no! no! We turn around and they're just sword fighting at the campfire. And we're like, <laughs> wow! That's my brother. Stop! <laughs> I run back to the horse. I cover Ayana's eyes. <laughs> <laughs> don't look, child. No, okay. Adult, but still. Don't no. look, young adult. <laughs> Once you get there, baby. 
He, look at that bruise. He's had that for like a year. Okay. And it just can hasn't I, changed. Can I touch it? Oh yeah, you can poke it. It's fine. It looks it looks real it looks a lot worse than it is. I poke it a little bit and I'm like, I'm gathering it's squishy. the horses. Ugh. <laughs> so I like wipe my finger off on my tunic. Like I'm just like, it's, go back it's not even that bad. Uh, right, you don't. You haven't come even. Come on, seen, peaches. You haven't even seen the thing I have on my back. Uh, oh dear. No. I don't want to know right Sparkles, now. Don't treat your brother like that. Come on. Don't and treat your brother like that, Luca. Is there anything you would like to do for these men? And while these are enemy combatants. I will say, or go on ahead. I will give them. A, I want to give them a quick sending, All just right. so that they can make peace with whoever they meet. We'll be, we'll be next. just thirty feet away. We'll still be here. Oh, girl! But flower, calm I'll, down. I'll give you your space, <laughs> um, and I will go. I'll go assist Ayana. In I turn around, like horses. trying to walk with six horses. <laughs> <laughs> this girl. <laughs> So they're like right here-ish. Yeah, they're they're yeah they're yeah. just grouped up in the stones. Um, I I'll do what I can to help him out, and I'll I'll just say I'll just ask him. Is there really something wrong with killing them so they don't kill us and expect it? I. Let's send it. I'd rather we had not fought, but I don't know. It. I did my best to not raise a ha actual attack or hand against them until they pick up their arms. They're missing their arms. And if it's not, you know what I mean. I'm sorry. <laughs> and while the group might not be acting or fighting in a way that I would have preferred. I'm here to make sure that no one <laughs> gets grievy or dies or gets injured. So Right, but they would they wouldn't give the same consideration to us if it was reversed. They would have killed us if we didn't have our weapons. Yeah, and I'm not them. I'm going to stick to what I believe in and what I do, regardless. Now, let's hope that they get, receive mercy upon the other side of the gate, because I'm not sure we did our best to do so here. As you send them off. Uh, you feel a bit of wind warm from the fire that turns eerily cold that continues to blow in the direction of your trail. In the direction of the what? In the direction of the tracks. Okay. Brief, but definitely there. So is, is Valkyria still here with us, or did she go back with the others? Uh, Valkyria would have gone with um, uh, uh -huh. the horses with Ayana. Okay. Sorry. No, it's all right. I I just wanted to know for some certain things. Um, okay. So as they're walking back. Uh. Oh, are you still doing something? Sorry. Well, just a, uh, I um, Luca, don't get mad. Uh, I kind of got hurt a bit. Do you? I don't. I don't want to put you too out of it, out of energy, before we're going into something probably worse. But uh, just a little bit. Could I get a little bit of healing? Please. I need healing. <laughs> Ashley is Genji. Every time. <laughs> Please be more careful, Artie. And I offer with my quarter Artie. staff. And... You, you know, you know, I don't like that name. 
I Meanwhile, like my... 50 feet away, uh, Ayana's like, something cute was just said. <laughs> <laughs> There's a disturbance in the cute. <laughs> disturbance in the cute. Bopper with the staff. Cast cure wounds. As as they're walking back. So, okay. anyways, then she don't tell the others, but you're my favorite. I'm with you till the end of the line. Wow. <laughs> Let's. Are you? Don't make Ashley cry right now, okay? <laughs> don't do that to me right now. Don't do that to me. <laughs> <laughs> so so, anyways, then she started running and she shook the flower and she went on this crazy <laughs> drug trip. <laughs> What? And Luca and I, I had to come out of the bushes dry? because we were like, oh man, what's she gonna do now? And then she drew her weapon on me and I was like, whoa, whoa what the weapon what? away, yo? You're saying, I you're did saying not expect Ar that to happen. You're saying Arthur's a druggie? Oh, absolutely, 100%. Oh my god. I heard you know that someone you, then, yeah, when you know someone. I swear. No, you didn't. You think you, you know someone. You don't somebody. hear us. No. We're well, like 50 we're feet way. away at least. Well, I'm finishing up the story while you guys are on the way. I'm not like yelling it, I'm just telling it to them. So, anyways. Uh, and then, <laughs> and then we found this so ogre, easy. and he had like this lightning burn on him. Uh -huh. It was really weird because, like, I don't know of really anything in the forest that's just like bzz, lightning, especially not this far Maybe south. Because the Horcrux. A what? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's just it was a word I came up with, like when you're just kind of a klutz and you fall, and then you get a scar that oh, looks kind of weird. A Horcrux. <laughs> Oh, I thought you were. I thought you were saying a whore clucks like the sound. Of, anyways, <laughs> uh, <laughs> because that's the. Oh shoot! She's coming. Act natural. Oh. I just like lean up against my horse and start like casually <laughs> trying to whistle like. <laughs> yeah, nope. All right. <laughs> I I like I like. Start. I like lay on the ground. Like paint me like one of your French girls. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> alrighty, okay. let's go. Start whistling okay. Steamboat Willie. M Mr. Coles, you're giving me. Your... is just ashamed to be around this. <laughs> yeah, well, Kiri's Mr. just standing there, so, like. Mm. <laughs> so, so as Arthur sees that, like Coles just sort of lays out like that. She's like, Mr. Coles, you're giving me very conflicting signals here. How you doing? Oh, Ugh, oh nope. <laughs> I regret saying that. Do you really want to go through and, with and, that? And, and, then I, and then I stand up and I go over to my horse. <laughs> <laughs> now, did did Ayana actually say nope, no drugs here? As as we were pulling, as we were coming no, out. No, we're not doing drugs because no. there's no drugs here. These are not the drugs you're looking for. Said, Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I I ride up next to uh, just go. I whisper in her ear like, "Wait, do we really not have any drugs?" I mean, way to no. go! Now we lost Jasho. Darn. <laughs> <laughs> Jasho's already on drugs. We're the second session in. I want to be. Let's he's, do it. He's already a crack I've addict. I got some rations. That's that's literally the closest thing I have to drugs. <laughs> <sighs> What? All right, let's no, let's Joshua. let's continue on the road. Yeah. Just, let's say no, yeah. Just say no, Just say no. Just yeah. say no, Joe. Cool kids don't do drugs. Yeah. I need you all to make a perception check. For oh me. no. All of us. All of you. Or if you choose just to ride along, you don't have to. Wow! Oh, no. no. Straight up <laughs> zero. <laughs> oh, okay. Sorry, I forgot to turn off the person. Man, the cla advantage, but classic Valkyria. Yeah. I'm pretty sure yes. on all skill checks We're so far, chatting. Valkyria has basically rolled a natural one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's real fun. So, so yeah, the 20 is the first one that I had rolled. Yeah. Uh, I have a 20 as you guys so. ride along, uh, you would. Uh, come across these two mountainous well not really mountainous two larger hills that are plateaued at the top uh, that as you pass through I need you all to make a dexterity saving throw oh Crap. gosh right. are you about to get rock slided so oh, only, no. those that, only those that succeeded the, the 
the perception check. Roll that right. save. No, everybody. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I'm Technically, still okay. none of you guys succeeded. Yeah, what? Wait, wait. Not with a 22? Have... You were supposed to be at disadvantage because it's dark. Even with night vision, <sighs> it's still dim light. Okay. That freaking wait. sucks. Oh, wait, for the perception checks? Yes. I mean... Unless you mean... lit a torch. Oh, no. Oh, wait, we were at disadvantage well, for perception. What about yeah. dark vision? Oh. It, even well, then, it's but still then it would dark. just be a yeah. it would just be a straight with, perception check. Dark vision, which, well, which was my which, one, which we got that ones, yeah. yeah. With dark vision, it's, it's no. still dim light, which is still disadvantage. Still disadvantage. Oh, okay. So. But the deck save isn't at disadvantage. No. Okay. Uh, good news. Uh, everybody except for Luca and Jasho succeeded. That's uh, not good. The bad news is. The horses died. Luke and Joshua didn't succeed. <laughs> yeah. So, oh, wrong ones. Bad. Good thing I've still got those uh, false life temporary. Luke and Joshua, you take twelve points of rock damage as a boulder oh. falls on you. Oh. 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 I have a question. Huh. Can deflect missiles help me here? <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you very much. Have a nice day. All right. And I need you all to roll initiative for me. It's a trap! Uh, 12 rock damage? Oh, I forgot yeah. to click on myself. Sorry. Yeesh. My no, rock damage. Right. Good job. Never mind. As yeah, rock damage. They all just spring oh. out and push these boulders onto you. Uh, okay. Do you want us to rearrange ourselves how we would be going through just this? Go ahead and rearrange, but no further than... I think I was totally just talking to oh. Valkyria, and that's why neither of us paid any attention. To anything? Yeah, so but mm-hmm. at least you saved. At least you guys made the the, the save. Because we're right in the middle, and so yeah, we didn't get rocks dropped on us. Yeah. Uh, just a second. I think Sawyer. I think Sawyer died. Sawyer rolled uh, I'm missing Ayana. I know. I forgot to click on myself. It's twelve. Okay. It's 12. Oh. One day. Well, okay. this time I did it before oh, yeah. the map was okay. up, and then, yeah, just didn't wait. Yeah, initiative roll, done. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. Uh, so, Jasho, you get to go first as their surprise round was pushing boulders onto you. How high Ouch. up are they? Uh, it is a ten foot climb. Okay. Uh. Okay. Uh, can I can I get up here, like on top of the thing, with my movement? Um, one second. Kind of ignore what I'm doing here. I'm just testing something. Uh, go ahead and make an athletics check for me, real fast. No. You kind of get about halfway up and you slide down. Can it be acrobatics? No. Because you're climbing, not parkouring. Okay. But you could try again if you want. Just lose 10 feet of movement. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, you get up there. This time you only lose another 10 feet of movement climbing up. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I'll just like move one over. And I'm gonna punch this guy. Actually, did I do I know which one dropped a rock on me? Uh presumably one of those two. Alright, well I'll punch this guy first then. Okay. Punch. Nope. Punch. That one hits. Okay. Okay. That's, that's it. Uh Valkyria. What do how, how tall did you say the Clips were about ten. 
about 10 to 12 feet up, and depending on what you, where you go at. Let's see. One second yourself. 5, 10, 15, 20. Just Skyrim physics it and just walk up the wall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Horses just go vertical, right? Yeah. If oh, Skyrim yeah. has taught me anything. Which, which I presumed you did. Okay, so I guess 5, 10, 15, 20. So this puts me at the head of it, right? So it'd be like 10 more feet to get up here. Yeah, have to make an athletic check though. And I'd have to, yeah, yeah. If I was just confirming. Yeah. Yeah, you get up there, no problem. Okay. And you know what? I'm going to roll my, my real dice. Okay. So, long sword 19. That hits. Okay. And then. Be a D8. D8 plus four. Uh, nine. Okay. Nine. You just kill him. Oh, he's done? Yeah. Okay. And then I th throw my dagger at, um, I don't know, this ugly dude right here. Okay. Feel free to throw a dagger. Uh, throwing the dagger. So, not a huge fan of that guy. Oh, I don't even know what he's wearing. Nineteen. That just hit. Wait, no, that just, that just hit. Okay, I was like, that just it, hits. Oh, it just hits. No, it hits. Uh, okay. I got numbers mixed up. And six. Uh, for a D four. It's D four plus. Yeah, D four plus four. your. No. Yeah. Strength or dex. dex. Yeah. It's dex, I think. It'd be he could use strength if he so chose. Oh, yeah. Really? He's just mm -hmm. eating a knife. Okay. Uh, I thought but... if it was ranged, he could choose. I mean, he could choose, but his strength is better. My strength right, modifier is before. Sorry, I thought I meant if it was thrown, you couldn't choose. No, no. most of, most of the time, a thrown weapon will allow you to choose. Okay. I'll let him choose. It's it's uh, bows and crossbows that you have to use your decks. Got it. All right. So my I, uh, dagger's in that dude. It's, it's, yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah, and I'm not happy that that my friend's in danger, so I'm also going to cast Firebolt at him and right. say, how dare you hurt my friends? Okay. There it go. There it goes. Just like that. <laughs> yeah, and it goes. <laughs> Just blast into the rock in front of him. A warning shot! A warning you! <laughs> warning you! Alright. That's it. Anything else? Okay. Nope. Uh, right. Actually, I'm going to pull out my crossbow, but not obviously not okay. use it. How tall are these ledges? Ten feet. Okay. Depending on where you go. Okay, but how tall are they? 5, 10, 15, 12 feet. 20. <laughs> every, they just keep getting taller every time we ask. So I'm going to Misty Stab. <laughs> And uh, I'm going to pull out the badge and be like, whoa, 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 hold up, hold up, and see if it does anything. <laughs> we're, we're, we're here to join the cult. We were led here. We were given this. Okay. Is that a deception check of some kind, I'm assuming? Let me open things. My <laughs> roll 20 decided to go. No, no, you don't get to open that. No, I don't think I will. Yeah. Uh... Yeah, go ahead and roll a deception check for me. Cool. Brick. Okay. He doesn't look like he believes it, does he? Right now, no. Okay. Well, I've at least got my shield out. Because huh. I'm assuming that's my action to do that. Yeah, it'd 
be your action to find the badge, pull it out, and show it off. Go, hey, 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 hey. Okay. Yeah. Arthur. What do? Um, um, it's Arthur. With, with the this elevation, <laughs> um, is there any type of cover going on? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Do I have a better chance of shooting this way? Yes. Or... You would, okay. because of the angles. Right. All right. Then I will take a shot at that cultist. Okay. Nope. nope. Just and breaks the arrow. Uh, <laughs> Anything else? Flip him off. Right. Oh, that's aggressive. Be aggressive. Be be, be aggressive. aggressive. We're the cheerleaders yeah. now. Valkyrie and I are cheerleaders. <laughs> <laughs> that's kind of scary. <laughs> the guy you ran up to, Colth, uh, looks at you and looks at you puzzling. He doesn't speak calm, does he? Frick. Well, he does. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and he just goes, Not any new recruits yet, and swings at you twice. Uh, of course he does. A 12 doesn't hit, though. A 24 does. Yeah. Take 9 points of slashing damage. That's a mistake. Uh, Alright. All of the cultists. Uh, these two by Jasho. Actually, these three by Jasho are going to Start a sw- scimitar. Uh, first one, that's a five. Second one, a 19. Yeah. Take two <laughs> points of slashing damage. Okay. Just that disappointed. Yeah, I got 15. It. That's my armor class. And then you take an extra four. Okay. Ah. Uh... This guy, he's going to stand on this edge and just keep watching. And this guy up here is going to uh, he is going to cast some spell. What? On some those spell? Three. Some. Oh. Spell. Yeah, they cast sun. Uh, it just creates a sun on the planet and kills everything. But with you being really the only one who can see it, uh, you have no idea what it is. But I will say, Me? people in your party have cast a similar spell. Me. Oh. Yeah, yeah sure. Uh, these two guys, uh, one of them runs up to you and is going to scimitar you. Okay. 16. Okay. Uh, and this guy over here is going to Sacred Flame you. Me? Yep. The deck save? Yep. 17. Yeah, you save. You're okay. fine. Who did it? The one right next to me? Yeah, that guy. Right uh, there. Okay, the weird mask dude. Okay. What's going on with uh, that? He's face? going to step back a couple steps. Oh, I see what it is now. Okay. Like, there's a weird mask. He's looking to the left. Got it. Luca. Yeah, I had to zoom in, like, super close to finally yeah. see. I had to go to, like, 120 in order to see him. I'm a sick <laughs> Which guy? The guy right in front of me. The guy who attacked me. Okay. Uh, oh. Nope, that's a fail. Five damage, yeah. That's it. Right. Nice. Jasho. Okay. Got three dudes looking to stab. I punch this man. Okay, punch, punch away. That hits. 
dead. Okay, flurry of blows. Flurry, of, flurry of bros. Huh. Heck yeah, man. Flurry that bros. Hits. Um, he has to succeed on a strength save. DC 12. That's an 8. Okay, he is pushed 15 feet away from me. Uh, can I push him down the cliff? Okay, he would have to fall there. Nice! Uh, so he takes a d6, right? Yep. Dies from it. He does. Wow! <laughs> he just falls and just breaks his neck on the fall. Right, Oof. And then last attack. Roblox the... death sound. Oh! Uh, that Ooh. hits. And then he has to make a deck save or be knocked prone. Nope, that's a seven. He's prone. There you go. I just go and stay down. I know he won't, but she should. Be right. good for his mental health. <laughs> and his physical health. And his physical health, yeah. Valkyria. Um... All right. So. Oh wait, they would have had a. No, what? It's, it's too late. I forgot. That's my bad. Kyria runs over here. Okay. And then so at uh the big the big dude first. Okay. Going for eighteen. That hits. Okay, and then. Eight plus four, uh, ten. Okay. Okay, and then I'm gonna go with the short sword. Twenty-six. Oh, so natural twenty. Oh, and yeah, two d six plus four. Two d six plus four. Yep. Nice. Uh, ten. Anything else? Man, he's still alive. Still alive. Boy, he's still alive. And she just turns to um uh turns to Colt says, Thank you for the assist. Yep, I tried. Plan B I tried. <laughs> yep, I tried. <laughs> All right. Ayana. I said get back and I'm trying to get that same big guy. Okay. Nope. Uh. Or don't! Your decision! It's another warning shot! <laughs> or don't! Third time's the charm! Uh, he just hits his armor and he just pff, moves slightly, but doesn't seem to react. Feeling a little toasty in there? Anything else? Nope. Quispy. Quispy. Oh. Actually, I'll move. Sorry. I'll move like that. Alright. This guy's gonna freaking get it now. I'm gonna bonus action Hexblades curse him. Okay. <gasps> and then I'm gonna attack him. Okay. Yeah. That hits. Okay. So that's 12 with the proficiency bonus addition. Yep. Dead? No. No? Holy crap. All right. Well, well apparently he knows about the uh, the recruiting schedule. Apparently, so apparently he's, he's, bigger, he's, he's up and up enough. Higher, higher up. What you you know, guard knows he's coming up. I hit yeah, him with we've... I hit him with twelve more damage because of my hexblade's oh curse. Yeah, we, so we've put like, All right. like at least forty into him. Yeah, at least minutes. forty points of damage, and <laughs> I'm still not dead. All right, I'm going to be firing it at that one. All right. So Kiri and I at this point are actually concerned because I'm like, how is this dude? We're like, how is this dude still alive? <laughs> <laughs> that definitely hits. Toads McGo. I All right, and then uh, wait. This, oh, who this did guy. She oh, the guy up there, right? Yeah. yeah, over there. Oh, over on. He the was other also side. the one holding initiative. Yeah, it's fine. He goes right after the bad guy. Yeah. I'm surprised you don't recognize the icon. No, I got. I know it's a, It's the like the Raya icon, the icon okay. we used for Raya. All right. Big Bad's turn. Um, 
Nah. He'll strike out yeah. at Valkyria because. No, he'll attack one each. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, jeez. Two handed. The first one against Valkyria, 23. Oh, just misses. No. Oh, <laughs> damage. How much? Nine. Nine! Nine! Second one on Colt, a 22. Yeah. You take 12 points of slashing damage. <gasps> Oh, dude. I got two hit points, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright. Now, you have to go over the Twitch chat just to see you lose 14 points of health. Yeah. Oops. Uh, this guy's got a 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Oh, he's about to shit me in the uh, kidney. No, he's going to touch his ally. Oh, yeah. Cast. Cure wounds. Not, not, not the time or place, homie. <laughs> Counter spell. I'm just kidding. Uh, cool. It's something. He gets one hit point back. <laughs> no, he gets more than that. Just not a whole lot more. Uh, and this cultist next to him. Kind of step. Or slash at Valkyria. Mm. That's a 16. Does not hit. Woo! Hooray for Splint Mail, baby! Yeah! Uh, <laughs> this cultist over here stands up. And he's got a slice hat. Jasho. A 19. Yeah. Takes another two points of slashing tape. Oh no. Hey, Deboro, dude. Thanks for the follow, man. Uh, this acolyte over here. Oh, revealed what they are. Oh well. Uh, it's a walk over. And. He's going to cure wounds this guy. Oh, wow. <laughs> That means he got a lot of cure wounds there. He's back to full. <laughs> what? No! Oh! Ah! Oh! Have fun over there, guys. Wait, who just got cure wounded? This guy, not this guy. Oh, okay. Wait. This guy cannot get back to full with just one use. Oh, good. I was about to be like, what the heck? How yeah, little cult- damage are we doing? The cultist just got healed, right? Yeah, that cultist over here next to Jasho. Oh, okay. Yeah, Jasho's okay, got that's it. What okay. <laughs> Valkyrie okay. and I had a panic attack for a second. Sorcery! Yep. Well, well first, I'm magic? gonna toll the dead the thing that they've been fighting. Okay. What is the plan? That's a save. Natural toning, buddy. Sorry. Fuck. Well, after that, I'm going to cast Healing Word on Cult as a bonus action. Okay. I love you. At second level. Alright. Oh yeah, I'll take it. Heck yeah. Anything else? Uh, That's what I can do right now. I'm going to stay where I'm at. Cash chill. Oh boy, I'm gonna punch some things. Punch real good. You. Yeah. Uh, I'm actually gonna Talent. move, like, kind of sidestep around this guy to get over here. All right. I'm gonna punch this dude. Oh, dude. I love what JJ's doing over there. That hits. Okay. Still up. Yeah. All right, flurry of blows. How many flurry of blows do you have? Uh. I we short sure, well. It, I'm assuming the body thing that we were doing. Yeah, you took you could have short minutes. rested. Yeah. Okay. It yeah. takes thirty minutes to restore my key points, so I'm assuming I rested for thirty minutes while they were doing hiding the bodies and stuff. Okay. If that's if that's not allowed. Okay. 
I'll give it to you since you did not actively participate in that. So yeah, I was just kind of hanging out by the fire and okay. chilling. Um, yeah. So for your bells, I'll punch this guy again. Pop. Nope. Uh, and then I'm actually gonna try to punch this guy over here. Okay. Come on. That hits. Okay. Push him off. All right. Strength save. DC twelve. Oh, he's real good at those. <laughs> That's a twelve. Exactly. Oh. Oh. Boo. Oh. Boo. <laughs> plus zero to the modifier. I can't do anything. <laughs> Boo. Boo. Give him minus one just for me. <laughs> All right, cool. Simp for me just once. Valkyria. So, give me just a second with my thoughts here. I'm trying to remember what my daily smite is that I have. You can use spell slots. No, 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 no. I have a daily. Um, I think it's uh, branding smite. Oh, 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 searing. Oh, searing, that's it. Searing smite. Okay. So yeah, bonus action just pop it on yourself if you so choose. Okay, That's I'm actually right. gonna wait. Um, I'm actually going to go for okay. Well, one, I'm gonna roll. Okay, let's see. Going for a long sword against big ugly dude. Okay. Um, and so it's twenty one. That hits. And then um, I'm going to go for um divine smite. So three d eight plus four. Uh, I believe it's only 2d8 at first well, it's level. Well, a d8 for his weapon. Oh, yeah. right, okay. Um, 18. Nice. Okay. Still not dead, isn't he? Nope. <laughs> and, okay. And then, so, I'm going for my short sword. Okay. Oh. <laughs> it does not hit. That one, it was not a natural one. I told you that, but it was okay. bad. It was like a what total of eleven. Yeah, that does not hit. Yeah. <laughs> right. So, um, that um ends my fun. All right, I take a deep breath. I'm like, okay, okay. I said we should have gone to El Trail, and I start running towards this. <laughs> but nobody listened to me. And athletics to climb the thing. You said, yep. And you would have burned. Oh. Feet of oh, crap. She's coming in for the fight. Right. You keep, just make it up there with the last of your mm-hmm. movement. <laughs> and then, uh, but that was just my movement, not an action, right? Yeah. Okay, and then um, I crap. I look at Colth and say, Come on, dude, you got this. And then I'm going to cast Cure Wounds on him as yeah, well. Talks. Hey. Please, you got to have this. Medic. I didn't mean to get so close. Wait. Oh, hey. wow. That was some I think, womp and healing. I think you healed him more than he even needed. Yeah. Well, I didn't expect to roll that well. It's fine. I'll take it. I mean, it was 16, it was 16 health, and I needed 13 left, so... It's not too bad. Uh, right. that, that's the yeah. one that we only lost three. Right. Right. Okay. Is that all you cool. cool. I'm gonna attack him again. Yeah. Dude, this guy. 18 that hits. 13 damage. Dead. Dead. How do you want to do this? Yes! <laughs> yeah! well! All right. Um burp, I, burp, 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 I wanna burp. I want to sort of like, like slash him across the chest to sort of like set him off balance, and then I want to just try to like Spartan kick him off the cliff. Just slash across, and he falls back and is stumbling across the edge and perches himself on a rock, and you kick him and falls to the ground, landing just flat on his back and dead. Get wrecked. Oh yeah, I really messed up. Turn orders now. Yeah, you you did it. Good job. Yep. 
Now, you, now you're in super danger. Yeah. I didn't realize you guys were this close to the edge. It looks a little bit different when I'm down there. Yep. And uh, I'll try to sort of... I don't know if I can really do this with a bonus action, but I just kind of want to, like, draw the attention of the dude next to me to try and not have him focus on Ayana. I sit there and kind of wave at him. and Yeah, pursue. like like juking him out, like in basketball. Just, ooh, 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 ooh. what you gonna do? All right. All right. Uh, with where I'm at, uh, are they no longer at cover? Uh, this guy, these guys over here would still have three quarters. Well, this guy would have half, but this guy definitely has three quarters, mostly because he's also behind. Now. All right. Does that mean that theirs changed as well? Uh, with where you're at, this guy has half. This guy has three quarters because you've kind of moved oh, your way down, move to one side or the other, and things right, can definitely so... switch. Okay, so. All right, from here, is this guy's cover gone down at all? Uh, I would say it's probably moved to about half. Right. I'll... Again, because Ayana is on the way. Yeah, no, I understand. Take my chances. Right. Story of my life, my friends. That oh. is. Yeah. There we go. And you get sneak attack. Yeah, you do. Oh, <gasps> I do. Which I believe is 2d6 at third level. Oh. oh. Ooh. I'm oh. sorry, what? <laughs> Man, just absolutely smeared that. Like, I was juking him out. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? And then an arrow just, like, impales him in the head and he goes flying. And I'm like, that's one thing to do. <laughs> <laughs> I keep forgetting how amazing Sneak is. Sneak attack's really, gra Whoa, really rad. And then you actually got six on both of them. <laughs> yeah, both of them. It that was max. Better. Just wait until you're rolling amazing. like 8d6. You're rolling yeah, fireball yeah. damage every time you get sneak attack. Back to the cultists. Uh, they're still doing their thing, at least over here. Scimitar and Jasho. 19. <laughs> Uh, so much damage. How much? Two. Two. <laughs> <laughs> What's with these cultists? Uh, I'm glad this is the only reason I'm uh -oh. still alive. Uh -oh. Yeah. No. Stinky. You're here. No. Uh oh. Excuse it's... me. Acolyte is going to sacred flame you. Uh, Please. So. Go ahead and pull. your own medicine. Deck save. Deck save? Yeah. All right. Yeah, you save. Nothing happens then. Oh, wait, that's an Earth or not. Okay. All right. Uh, this cultist. Ayana came up. And now his boss is dead. He's going to run over and shove Ayana. What? I killed the dude, though. Yeah, but Ayana's the one who healed you. He has he knows he has zero chance of being able to kill you. Strength She's check? A, yeah, it's a strength check. Which you're gonna win. Oops, come on, push the button. Is it check is it an athletics check? No, it's just, no, it's just, it's just a strength, strength check. check. Okay. To be able to withstand it. Yeah, he runs over and just puts his arms into your shoulder and you just don't move. <laughs> <laughs> Pushing's <laughs> not nice. <laughs> it kind of looks up oh my God. I, so, I sort of, I sort of look at Valkyria and I just like put my hands up like nope. <laughs> I honestly <laughs> about to like stomp that fool into oblivion. Alright, Luca, what do? Consent please. Consent please. <laughs> what happened Henry to Henry the crab brass thing? Consent. <laughs> I missed that. Who killed the sorcerer okay. that was next to us? Uh, Arthur. Arthur? Mm -hmm. Arthur hit him with that attack? crazy sneak attack damage. Arthur just said headshot. <laughs> headshot. Boom, okay, so, headshot. So right, Luca's going, doing what? Yeah, yeah. yeah like, that's my turn. I didn't realize I Arthur was against the others. He's dead. He just... 
flash of radiance, and he is singed as he That's falls. That's really nice sacred flame damage. Pretty good. Dude, Anything else? Raining out here. It's supposed to rain down here in the valley too. That was it. Oh, Jesho. We're supposed to get We're snow in the by rain the morning. Shadow, so. It's time to punch. Punch real good. Falcon punch. 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 That hits. He's very dead. Woo! <laughs> yeah! He's gonna punch him in the nose and he stumbles back and falls off. Victory Is there any scratch! way to get down the cliff without taking fall damage? You could try to slide down. What's the check? Acrobatics. Okay, I will do that. Okay. He's like, that's, I'm fine with no. <laughs> what? Oh no! <laughs> he tries to do that cool parkour slide, and like his boot catches the edge. You take like, one <laughs> point of damage as you twist your ankle as you land. Oh, one ow, point. Ow! Ow! So ow, ow! 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 Oh, Dude, oh, that, like it hurt. That's what. That's why twisted ah. ankles as a commoner feels so bad because it's a whole freaking point of damage. As commoners, freaking kills you. <laughs> commoners, you have like two points of health. Yeah. <laughs> ah. Yeah. I just need to walk it off. It'll be fine. Ow. You sure. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm good. I'm Snaps good. it back into okay. place. <laughs> All right. Well, it's not broken. It's just twisted. Yeah, it's Valkyria. fine. Valkyria. All right, Valkyria. Chop yeah. Why did you do this? Just a big cramp in my leg yeah. now or something. <laughs> All right. Long sword. Nope. She says, no, I want the kill. 23. <laughs> that hits. Oh, was I supposed to try to leave this person alive? No, no, no. Wrong okay. person. Murder him. I much. was just a little miffed that he tried to push me off a cliff. And, hey, that rhymed. Uh, <laughs> Dunder Mifflin? I honest spitting fat rhymes over here. Uh, ten. Uh, he's Ted. Cool. I told you it's not nice to push, and I kick his foot. <laughs> okay. uh, I'm just going to push him back right into Valkyria's blow. I sort of hop down. To the big bad right. dude. Um, um and I, <laughs> I know uh, that I roll in acrobatics. Oh uh, well, okay. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm bigger than he is. Cool. I totally oh, face plant. I just eat down. grass. Yeah, you take four <laughs> points of damage. <sighs> That's oh, sorry, the head. <laughs> Fall down the All right. I have to acrobatic it too to go down. Or you can choose to just slowly climb. Oh well, I would have oh. slow. I would have slowly climbed. Well, you just yeah. said jump. Well, no, I'm slowly climbing down. I'm I'm slowly I would have slowly down climbed. The dude. Okay, then you don't take six point of damage. Okay. <laughs> and and I, I am taking my dagger. I know that they have badges at this point. I know that most of them carry signets. So I'm just like patting this dude down, nooks and crannies, trying to find his badge. Right, roll an investigation. While he's doing that, I'm gonna, I'm going to try to salvage the Dude. the two arrows that I had left. Even if I'm being like super thorough, I have to roll a check. Yeah, because this guy doesn't seem to have a badge. Can I check him for money? You certainly can. Investigation for me. Oh my hey, gosh, Braden, you guys! Thanks for the follow, All right, bud. Um, Seems to be a very yeah. poor man. Hey, Braden K, thanks for the follow, man. What kind of um armor is what he are... wearing? Uh, this guy is wearing splint as well. No bracers? Mm, nope. No bracers. Okay. Oh, no what is uh what's what, what kind of swords all, right? what kind of swords does he have? So he a he sword. has a long sword. Oh, long sword, okay. That's it. This looks pretty uh, standard. I mean, it's a little fancier cuz has some dragon motifs on it, but that's about it. Ooh. Oh, so, but then they'd be Tiamat dragon motifs, right? Yeah. Uh, Col Coltha, what are you looking for? His badge, but I can't find his badge. All right, so let me let me try. Okay. Go ahead and roll investigation. Yeah, still doesn't have a badge. Wow, okay. Oh. No, he just doesn't have one. All right, well then... I, I want to climb up the cliff again. Is that another athletics check? Even if I'm being careful? If you're careful, then let's just spend your action doing it. Okay. Well, then, I'll, well, I'm assuming we're out of initiative I... at this point. Yeah. Okay. You are. Can but... I do 
can if, I do just like a an overarching investigation check to search all the bodies that are here at the bottom for yes. emblems? Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna do the same to the little acolyte dude and the spellcaster dude that were up here. Oh, for f fun. Okay. I'm Bro, looking too. What is yeah. this? What? Uh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Curious first natural twenty. You guys are sitting there like patting down, searching for the better part of like ten minutes, and Valkyria goes, "It's right there." It's right freaking there, it. idiots! On uh, the acolyte yeah. dude. No, up here? she made a promise yeah. that she wouldn't say okay. she wouldn't call you an idiot before. That's fair. Right, just, no right does it does it look any different than the one we yanked off the dude of the camp? Uh, this acolytes one, yes. yes. Okay, looks a little more like ornate, like it has a couple extra pieces to it, but still yeah. not as big as Langdorosa's. Is he wearing robes and a mask like his token was? Uh, yes. Okay, he is wearing a mask that looks vaguely draconic. Okay, I take them off. <laughs> Take their stuff. We might it might be useful later. And search them for signets real good. Nooks and crannies. Nooks and crannies. Well, I already did my overarching uh, investigation, so it's I mean you can find these badges. It just oh, takes you It takes a longer time than minutes. usual. Okay. That's okay. that's fine. So let's let's grab the signets. How many signets do we get in total? Uh, you would get in total five. Five? Perfect. That's one for each of us. Minus. Oh, well, there's, there's the, the one from the camp. That's six. Yeah. Uh, so, love you. Uh, I'm, I'm going to take one of the higher up ones. <laughs> <laughs> I love you too, Night, sister, I love you. <laughs> I, I'm going to take, take one of the higher up ones, but I'm assuming we have a second one from the other Acolyte dude. Yes, the other acolyte would have one as well. Okay. As well as a mask and robes. I'll take it. Oh, you okay. didn't tell you didn't tell good my sister talking. that I loved her. How dare well, you? Well, she was already at the stairs, so I texted it to her. Okay, good. Okay, so I'm also going to throw the robes on over my armor and stuff. See if it still fits, sort of. I mean, throwing robes on over armor, it's it doesn't quite look right. Then okay. it feels a little weird, but it seems. Is he still work. doing this up on the cliff? Uh, no, I would I would do this down by you guys once All we right, once we got everything off of them. Oh, in I... this span of time, can we if short rest? Can we short rest? Uh, yeah, let's take time. Time. We, we need to. Like yeah, we. So I, I, I feel like we do need a short rest here because I'm completely I'm completely burned out of stuff. So I but take the robes and I put them I on, but they're like I can a roll a hit dice for them. them. They're like three quarter sleeves, and I'm like, it's like a baseball tee. You look great. It's like a baseball tee. That was nice. You should also put on the mask. Oh yeah, here. Do I look scary. Rah! Ah! Very, very wow. Scary. Okay, voice crack. Real great. <laughs> That's how scary I was. Uh, I will also put on the mask from the other acolyte, dude. But putting on these masks, it's kind of is it like snug, comfortable. Yeah, I mean it. It fits, and it's kind of hard to breathe in. Yeah, it smells like Cheetos in here. <laughs> <laughs> it smells like Mountain Dew. Did you drink my Mountain Dew? Let me smell your breath. <laughs> Let me smell your breath. But guys, look Wait, at me. Are we taking look a, at me. Are we taking Hail a short Hydra. rest? Yeah, yes. short rest We're taking a short rest. You guys are free to take short rest. Cool, I get my spells back, thank goodness, because I used the last one of them in that fight. I don't... You get so, your I'll spells keep back as the paladin, on short rest? Yeah, Warlocks got, our, Warlocks got their spells back on a short rest. That's yeah, because they only get two spells. Yeah, because I've got two spell slots. Like, guys, he gets no spells. Let him have a oh, short rest. That's spells. right, I used a spell slot. Thanks, guys, you don't, for reminding me. Yeah, and you don't get it back, either. I know, I just oh, really reminded really me that I... Short rest. I, I got to roll my hit dice. However, hey. sorcerers can regain spell slots via sorcery points, and wizards can regain some spell slots on a short rest. Yeah, via arcane recovery once a day. I am keeping watch while everyone's kind of relaxing. Go ahead and roll a perception check for With me. With my amazing sure. perception. 
Your sister loves you, JJ. Woo! Everything's good, guys. Technically, you have a nice nap. Dark. What? Technically, a disadvantage because it's dark. Cool. Even better. Rolls a natural twenty on the other one. Oh, okay. Yeah, you made it even worse. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. It's really safe to take a nap right now. You guys are gonna be fine. I mean, it's not really. Like, it's not really a nap, is it? It's more just like taking a breather. Yeah, yeah. it's just kind of sitting down, breathing, just a rest. Kind of up your wounds. Light activity. Uh, yeah, you guys. Short rest, seemingly with little issue. So. I'm not sure how I feel about messing with my sleep schedule like this. <laughs> well, welcome to adventure. I figured I you'd be a night owl with your sneaky sneaky. Oh I no, put the I made sure. What? I made sure that like if I had any uh kill contracts that I did it early in the morning. Wait, pardon me, what? Nothing. At the, this point in time, it's wait. Did she just did she just drop the explicit words "kill contracts"? Yeah. <laughs> wait, what time just, is it? I just it's look over. Five. I I like scoot okay. closer to Ayata, like in between you two, just like. Um, slowly. I. I mean, I wasn't when, much of. When she drops the words assassin. "kill contracts," my hand goes to my sword, like very slowly. I'm just like. Mm. I only had like maybe two. So it's not much, you know. I'm not paying any attention because I'm like staring into Look the, the darkness stars. and like I'm gonna keep my team safe. Yeah, so I'm not even hearing any of this. You're staring at you like that's something. That's a bad guy. Watch it. <laughs> Throw a rock at it. It's just another rock. <laughs> it's just another rock. Never mind. We're good. It's fine, guys. Don't worry about it. Uh, short rest happens. Little issue. The bell, like I said, it's about nine o'clock now. So, carry okay. on. Oh, carry let's go. On. Go team, go. Okay. Are our horses still here? How yeah. are our horses doing after getting hit with a boulder? Uh, they are hurt. Oh. They aren't crippled, but they but are. But they're hurt. Injured. Yeah. Just the ones that they were riding? All of them. All of them. Everyone yeah, we damage. passed our saves, though. Would they have gotten hit by the boulders? We still took half yeah. damage, so we still we still actually got hit by the boulder. Oh, I did not take half damage on that. Oh, yeah. I did. So you should have taken six. Okay. Six. Oh. Luca's horse. Oh, I'm rolling one more hit, too, then, apparently. Is beaten and bloody and is on the brink of death. So it's. You should this is. Touch them. I have a feeling that this is a putting it down kind of a thing. I they're, hope you're they're healing, alive. Right? Yeah, we they're can just, just heal I'm them. I'm gonna just, just be healer. tending to the horses because it felt like the right. I thing mean, how much do. health can they really have? But yeah, like that's that's not the that's not the issue I'm having is that it's it's just like spell slots. <laughs> Cl right. Clerics and sorcerers right. only get theirs back from a long Spell rest. I mean, technically, uh, it, wait, Valkyria can just there... touch the horse. That's true. Valkyria's got the lay on hands thing. Valkyria's got like fifteen points got of lay 15 on hands. Fifteen points now. And we've got six what horses. Are points you're talking about? That was out I of like this, and I point, I, I point at uh, Arthur. I'm like, she has points, and then it heals. She's got fifteen of them. Fifteen points. Fifteen points. <laughs> every time, every time Valkyria uses a, a, a lay on hands, it has to poke it. Basically, it that's, to be that's how you guns. repeatedly point at something is just poking it over One and point over. at a time. Poke. Yeah. Poke. 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 poke, 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 poke. poke. <laughs> Imagine when Valkyria's got like fifty points of lay on hands and just like. Flurry of blows, but healing. Yeah, like, just Sonic the Hedgehog <laughs> poking you. <laughs> All right. Machine gun poke. So how how many health, how many hit points does a horse have? Thirteen. All of them. Oh, that's a lot of hit points. Oh, dude, my it... horse took twelve. Yeah. yeah. Lucas, <laughs> Lucas did too. horses are on the brink of death. I I'm not even riding it. I just like stand next to it. I'm like, you don't look so good, bud. 
Wouldn't right. Mr. Stark, it, stands it. Healing... it doesn't want to, though. <laughs> which healing cantrip is it? There which, isn't which a healing cantrip. Spare the dying just was... stabilizes no, someone. No, there's no healing cantrip, yeah. Healing word is still a first level spell. Yeah, all healing spells are at least, least first level. It would be absolutely broken if you could healing cantrip. Yeah. Even if it was just a D4, no modifier. Like, like I sort of have classic. a healing cantrip, but it's temporary hit points, and I can only cast it on myself. Speaking yeah. of which, I'm going to do that real quick. Can we give healing potions to Versus? I mean, we can, but those are healing potions. <laughs> healing those are potions, 50 though. gold each. Well, and I walk up between the two horses, put one hand on each of them, no. and twin the spells. Oh, that's right, she can twin! Yeah, but they'll still two? use two, a sorcery point and a spell slot. Well, if she just twins first level cure wounds, then they'll at least be able to walk okay. Yeah, one. It, it oh, wait, walks, so. it's just, like I said, it's up. It doesn't want to be, though. And they both heal... One hit point. Five. Okay. okay. Well, that's better than nothing. That's not bad. Yeah, it's about on with the rest of the horses. Like they're, they're a little being, a little rough around the edges. Well, better than nothing, I guess. On, let's go. All right. Well, let's uh, on the road again. My dad always says that. He says, I just can't wait to get on the road again. Oh, dear. <sighs> you will right. arrive. I quit, Meredith. <laughs> She's dead. The, squinting, right the squinting at Mare intensifies. <laughs> As you... Ion is dead. I'm going to punch her to death. <laughs> All right. Time for, time for Josh O'Colth 1v1. 1v1 me on Rust, bro. Oh, anyway... As we are traveling. Uh, you ride following the trail. Uh, and you can, as you go, you can start to see faint lights in the distance of torchlight. And you keep riding following this trail. And you notice that there's a big horseshoe shape that surrounds these lights. Of a fairly tall plateau that very quickly steepens and rises upwards. Wait, uh, so the platform with the lights is raised? No. the There's a platform that goes up and then the lights are in this horseshoe shape. Oh, okay. Uh, this isn't ominous at all. How far away are we when we start seeing this? Uh, when you can identify that there's a plateau there probably... Probably at least a few hundred yards away. Okay, we should. I think we should leave the horses. Yeah, let's leave the horses. Like behind. at least fifty feet back, kind of out of sight. Yeah. Oh, and we and we uh, because we've got the disguises stuff. now. Is there a so, bush? Or like there are a, lots of bushes. Like a big, like a do you big need, bush. Do you need to get dumped that bad? Dude, you know it. <laughs> there are very dense bushes scattered around the landscape. Let's just hide our our horses. Behind the bushes. Yeah. Tie them up somewhere. Just kind of keep them a little bit hidden. So I'll sort of like sort of like address the group. Alright. So Ayana and I have the disguises. You guys have badges. But try and let Ayana and I do the talking. Alright. Um. Cool. No objections? Let's go. Yeah. Well, kind of. But... But I don't 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 hold your peace. If you got a beef, say it. No offense, Ayana, but you you're you're the type of person that prefers telling the truth instead of. I have already had this conversation with Ayana. I'm good. We're good. I'm cool. Good. Yeah, not super convinced on that one, but so I mean, calls well. is. Colt is a smooth talker, relatively speaking. All right. So I'll. So let's... I tr if if he trusts Ayana, I trust Ayana. I put my hand on Colt's shoulder and go, "Thanks for trusting me." You're not about to cast friends on me, are you? No. Okay, good. You're already friends. <laughs> you don't need to cast it. 
right. our friendship lasts longer than a minute. Oh. Oh, oh wait. If we had short rested, I would have done one hit die. Sorry. Before don't, we don't make on. me cry. Our like friendship. That. I forgot that I took damage. Saving throw. Okay. All right. As we begin walking, I'm I'm gonna pull Ayana towards the front of the group and be like, "All right, let me do the talking, but get ready to with your your friendly mojo." Uh, in a group. I can't push my hair out of my face when I'm wearing this costume, though. I mean, disguise. Well, uh, you'll figure something out. You're smart. Okay. Okay. I got this. This is gonna go so bad. Okay. And uh, so I'm assuming that the marching, ready? the marching order is like Ayana's next to me, and then everybody's yeah. just sort of Oops, like sorry. behind-ish. I would assume awesome. that Val I would assume that Valkyria is also sort of towards the front because there was a dude in this party that had beefy armor, and so if we were like a scouting party or like a rot, like a just sort of a camper party, well, that they may are be true. But if we were going to do it that way, then Valkyria would be the one talking. Well, not necessarily. They, she could just be the bruiser of the group. She's the personal guard. My idea is that Valkyria is always at the very front or the very back, or like within one person at the front or the back, right? So um, if we're based in order around here and the direction okay. we're going, I feel like I guess it's that. It would be it would be best to have the bruiser at the back just in case someone tries to surround. Valkyria, go ahead and go ahead and stand right behind me, but stay stay close behind me. <laughs> this one's you, right? Yes. Right. I like give Valkyria a thumbs up. Don't worry, we got this. You will walk up and we'll, towards the camp. Yeah, we'll walk oh, into the horseshoe. <clears throat> uh, How's this sound for my evil voice? Fantastic. I love it. I sound totally sure. different. I'm not sure it's very Okay. I'll go ahead and just show you the camp. It does, it sounds Ooh. like you're forcing it. <laughs> uh, it's the void. You guys are entering. Holy cow, this is a big map. It's a very big map. Big uh, map. You enter, and there's a few people it's, standing in front as you guys pass. It's, uh, just, just, kind of, it's just the black. It's just black. Oh, because we don't have your tokens here. That's why. That's kind of important. Yeah. Hey, you remember that one time that Sawyer had to do this like all the time? Hey, listen, <laughs> listen here, you little crackhead. No, I'm not. I'm He's saying being like, nice to you. I'm saying this is this is rough. Like, quiet before I come over there and kiss you. Ew, gross! Get out of here. <laughs> there you go. No, I'll fight you, bud. You probably one v one me on Rust, bro. Oh my gosh! Yeah, it's huge. Let's okay. Wow, that's what Let's she said. Let's rotate ourselves. <clears throat> As you see fit. Uh, so, oh wow, this rotating... is a huge Amongus map. So like, I'm there. And hey, I there's a like fungus there. among us. We're there. You... As you enter, there are a few men and women standing in front. And they kind of see you, and they're eyeing you up. And then one of them kind of says... Where are you back from? We are back from the pass. There were some adventurers that seemed to be trying to get past here. They assaulted a Ford camp as well, the one with the cultists and the kobolds. The initiates and the kobolds. They sacked them, we followed them, and got to the pass just before they did. We were able to surprise them. And we killed them. I'll sort of under, so, under my breath. Are... Good job. Sorry. Kind of gesture to the to everybody behind you too and go is this them? Sorry, he gestured to what behind us? He gestured yeah. to, to those behind us. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. This here is Kira. She was our pers she's our personal guard. The three behind us are new initiates that we had found in Greenest. They, ex they produced interest in joining the cult after our example in Greenest. Okay. I need everybody to make a charisma check. Everybody? Charisma check or deception? Yeah, everybody. Charisma check. Oh. And I need Koth and Ayana to do so at disadvantage. Fuck. Oh, and now we rolled a five? Cool. Oh. 
Yeah, it. see, this was what I was worried about. Shut up, you didn't say a better plan. You wouldn't have done any better. You, I mean, you guys kind of all walk in and just look at you and go, Huh. I don't remember anybody in the Rio Guard supposed to be coming back. Interesting. Well, here we are. I'm sorry, we have orders from Mondath. We were, we were sent as a scouting party. Throwing names. Sent as a scouting party, but you're wearing full uniform. Well, we weren't told to be discreet. Well, you can go ahead and disrobe here. Nobody's going to make fun of your faces. All right. I take off my mask. Okay. Joshua just blushes. <laughs> <laughs> you wish for me to derobe as well? I mean, hot. No, no, no. You need not derobe. Right. Unless, of course, you want to. I mean, I would prefer to keep my clothes on, but. Wait, we can be naked here? Sweet. Just... <laughs> <laughs> Nudist pony! Mondath might, but I don't. Off you go. I'm just kind of waves his hand away. Like the way he came? Like, no, he's waving uh, into the camp. Oh, oh in, into the camp. Cool. All right. I uh, nod my head at him, say thank you. Uh, I walk forward and continue into the camp. Let me take my mask off. Yep, you can Everybody. take the mask off. No. Luca, as you pass, he points, puts out his hand and stops you and looks at you and goes, Greenest, eh? Hmm? Yes. Hmm. And just kind of lets go and lets you walk. And T kind of it soon starts talking to the people around them for a bit. As as we're walking by, can I like try and pass a perception, hear anything? Um. Or could since I was towards the back, could I pass a perception? I or or just perception here. check? Yeah. Because if we're I, if, I guess I if listen? we're trying to listen in, that's a perception check. Yeah, you can you can make an active perception check. Can I make an active perception oh, check? Plus. Yeah. Mer I'm just so excited that, like, so far in our, my mind, like, this plan is working perfectly. And everything's good. And I'm just talking to myself in my head and not listening to anything that's happening. How, uh, how does he feel? Nervous. Nervous? Okay. Nervous. Uh -huh. Not you... Cole said Valkyria don't even really like. Like, you hear him start, but you don't hear any more after that. Okay. Uh, Jasho, you kind of hear faint mutterings of words, but you can't make them out at all. And Arthur, you can barely make out the word uh, Mondath. That's all you can make out. As we're as we're walking, I'll sort of look to Valkyria and be like, "I'm gonna call you Kira from here on out, at least while we're here." Is that okay? You cool with that? I guess. Okay. You working your deceptive skills, huh? Trying my best. I'll call you idiot from here on out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, we shall call you idiot. All right. <laughs> so I keep keep walking. Are all these blacked out circles just like rocks and stuff? They're tents. Oh, they're oh, tents. tents. Okay. Oh, you guys can't see the guys that I head out. Uh, nope. No, are they on the GM overlay layer? Is that why? Yeah, that's exactly why. Uh, I, I was like, we are talking to the open air. <laughs> nice. Yeah. The air is talking to me, voice? and I am unnerved. <laughs> Classic. Uh, I need to throw these guys around, because you guys, as you guys walk in, you are stopped one more time. Okay. Uh, one guy 
walking just like right up to uh that would be Ayana. Uh wait. One second. Oh, no. I'm next to Ayana. I'm not behind Ayana. Not to walk on up to both of you. Okay, cool. Uh let me because I can't just select all of them or else I move parts of the map. Mm, yeah, don't do that. So I gotta do this one at a time. These guys look like jerks. You can't control select them? Uh no. Yeah, roll twenty oh. roll twenty doesn't work like that. Like I said, I'd I'd be selecting parts of the map. Um East option just kinda goes uh third your selecting party. Did I hear that correctly? Yes. We just came from the pass. Came from the pass. Now, if I may ask, uh, why are you here? Or more specifically, why are all of you here? We are returning from our trek. We were instructed to scout for the day and then return. But you're from the pass. Yes, we we caught the adventures that were there. We stopped them, and now we are returning. Go ahead and make a deception check for me. Gosh, this is so nerve wracking. Does is he a... get a advantage because I'm with him? Because I'm in garb. Yeah, we got all the sig sigils and everything we need. No, as you're like walking in, nobody's wearing any kind of uniform. Oh, this is the chillax zone. Yeah. Well, we just got back. We have an excuse. And I apparently, got to make it to my tent out here. Then I can <laughs> like, take off the pants, just you know? Hanging out in their in their nakedness, just walking <laughs> around. I mean, most people are in like very basic, like common commoner clothes, clothes. Or simple armor. <laughs> Not being naked when you can be naked. There we go. Twenty-five. <laughs> This kind of goes, all right, all right. Sorry to bother you. No worries. Just, I just gotta keep would like to get on with my day. No worries. I, under, I understand, but may I continue? Yeah, very well. Why am I grabbing things I'm not supposed to be? Oh, I thought he said that, and I was like, "What is he doing? Is he getting handsy with me?" Like, <laughs> uh, uh, like, like I he said, this was the chillax zone, but he's bit, like, like groping me right here in the chillax zone. Why am I grabbing yeah, I'm him? Just kind of step out of the way. Oh yeah, note: this is totally not for scale. Okay. Like each square is like, yeah, three square, four squares is sixty feet. So. Oh wow! So each square is wow. fifteen. Okay. All right, that's a big oh, wow. dude. Just kidding. Right. And oh, looking can... around, also, you would yeah. notice that there are a lot of people here. Okay. Um. Can I eighteen point six feet? Why is it so weird? Is, is there like a? Can I make out any kind of what looks like a prisoner tent or something like that? Um. Make. An investigation check for me. And this will be you guys kind of wandering around looking. You are doing okay. Wait, Don't jinx it! We... Knock on wood. <laughs> Knock on all the wood. Can I... <laughs> Can I do a separate check to just get a, get a rough number of how many people I've seen here? Uh, go ahead and roll perception for that one. Okay. Because that's just glancing about. Oh no! I'm having a hard time keeping it, keeping them straight. Yeah, I mean, some of them look pretty well the same. After a while, the faces kind of all blend together. You can't tell most wow. of the kobolds apart. Racist. Ash is so, a freaking mm -hmm. racist. So, looking <laughs> all, about, all you kobolds look the same. I guess there's. <laughs> at least 10 kobolds, but you can't tell. They are either really fast or there's way more. Uh, can I count, try to like take a, take a toll, like, account of how many yeah, people we see? Can you count? 
<laughs> I can count. I'm just not very smart. Uh, you would know, just glancing about counting to yourself, uh, easily at least 60 to 70 kobolds. Listen, I may be dumb, but I'm not an idiot. Like 60 <laughs> so to 70? Rough yeah, rough guess. Not really like counting one, two, three. Just yeah, just yeah. Easily 60 to 70, somewhere around two. Uh, humanoids, uh, quick glance about, easily 50 minimum. 50 humanoids and 60 to 70 kobolds? Yep. So around like what, 120 ish? Yeah, it was about 120. So people. Yeah. 50 peeps, 60 to 70 kobolds, or the other way around? Yeah. yeah. 50 peeps, 60 to 70 kobolds. Uh, you would eventually discover a prison like area over here to where there are four guards and about nine prisoners, all like tied up to various poles. Okay. Um, are they, are, are people like following us around, or are we, are we able to just kind of like walk around now, or? Uh, make an insight check for me. Ooh, yeah, that's fancy. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no. Some of them look like they're following you for a bit, but then they turn, and then you're not sure anymore. Some of them, you think like, oh, they're just hanging out, and then they, you see them a lot. You, it's hard to tell. Can Can I make my own check because I'm starting to get paranoid about how they stopped? I always feel like Go somebody's ahead. watching me. It. What? Sorry. <laughs> That's what it sounds like to me. The few people you can keep track of, they they don't look like they're like following you, but they are certainly keeping a an eye on you. All right. So, where is the prisoner tent? Sorry. Uh, way down here. Oh, way down, way Wait, down I south. I got way zoom out. Oh, okay, I see. Okay. Um, way down here. Where there's about four guards and about nine rough-looking prisoners. Okay, do any of them fit the description of a half-elf? The, the dude yeah. that we were told to try and get. I mean, there's, there's at least a couple half-elves there. A lot of them are humans, but there's a couple half-elves and a gnome. Yeah. Um, have I ever met him in person? Oh, yeah. Uh, no. Oh, okay, dang it. You uh, know of him, you don't know him. Do I recognize any of these prisoners as people of Greenest that I maybe have known? Or... The blacksmith's wife here. <laughs> uh, go ahead. I swear, if you say make an intelligence check again, I'm going to lose my shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, go ahead and make a perception check. Yes. <laughs> Why you bully me with these intelligence <laughs> checks? <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, one of the half elves looks vaguely familiar. Uh, a couple of the humans do, and the gnome does. The gnome does. Oh, is the gnome the blacksmith's no. wife? Wait, it was the blacksmith? Does, does the gnome the introduce black himself as a member? No, the blacksmith was a blacksmith halfling. Was a halfling. A halfling. Hmm. Okay, so. Is there like a bonfire area where like people just sort of like congregate and hang out? I mean, there's a bunch of little like bonfire Small campfires. Fires. Right? Is there yeah. is there one where nobody's at? There's not one where nobody's at. There's pretty well somebody by most of them, whether okay. it be a person or a kobold. Okay. Uh, but... Maybe we. C well, I'd like to. Candidate. I'd like to. Um sort of like look to the party and gesture to head over to a campfire where like there's the like at, even if there's just like one person I just want the most isolated campfire we can get right. uh, go ahead and roll a d6 for me Just to see if there is one see how many people there are maybe there are six campfires five uh, you managed to find one doesn't have only one, has two, but the two kobolds just kind of sit there, like picking at stuff stuck to them, just being hellions to each other, just yelling at each other. And then when they see you approach, they kind of quiet down and start whispering to each other while staring at you. 
I'll sort of uh, stand in front of them. Be like, may I have some time alone with my associates? Yes. And then just kind of wander off. I want to motion the party to circle up. Circle up, team. Whew! I take off the mask. I can breathe under this thing. All right. I got a good news and bad news. Good news, we're in the camp. Yay. Bad news, we probably can't leave until tomorrow. Not without looking suspicious. How well, are we going to be getting I'll the... find us a place to stay. Well, that's the other thing I'm worried about is I don't know which tents we're supposed to be staying. How are we going to be getting the prisoners out? I don't think we can. We have, oh, to, yeah. go, we have also, to go back to Greenest and tell them that we know they're here. We know they're alive, but there are close to 120 people here. That's Greenest has no chance of getting them out of here. Not, but neither do, neither do we. I have a question, DM. Huh. Uh, how tall are these cliffs? Uh, about 150 feet. Jeez. Okay, cool. This it goes very very steep very very quickly. But Prison, these can you can you ping where the prisoners are supposed to be again? They're down, They're down here. here. Okay. But these plateau walls are dotted with caves. Some of them can hardly see. Some of them you can very plainly see, but they're just way up there. Speedrun tactics. Well, on the plus um, on the plus side, you did introduce us as new new people, which means yeah. that we can at least find out why they're doing this and what's the ne what the next plan is. The issue is, is I introduced you guys as new people. Yes, Ayana and I are I'm wearing saying. badges of higher ranking. I know that's what I'm saying. <laughs> We we're new. Can we go. Can, we can oh, say, okay. "Hey, I, I don't saying. know what we're doing. Where do we sleep? What do we do?" Let me do it. Well, no, 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 no. no you no. are higher rank. No. We're you higher rank. Say... We can't. We can't say we don't know what's going on because we're a higher rank. I know. So let's let them do it because they're the ones we've introduced as new people. They're the ones that are more likely to get off without scorn about not knowing where they're sleeping. Or we could go to them and say we need beds for the new people because we just picked them up. Or we could do that. And but I could the, use my other charm thing. and uh, get them a place to stay because we're not a threat to them. Well, I, I, was, I, I was down I'm for charm. I'm not using friends. I'm using my natural background <laughs> abilities. Natural charm. Um, well, as can't. long as we're not a threat to them, I can find you a place to stay. Can somebody very quickly roll just a d20 for me? Uh, got it. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Six. All right. That's not a good sign. All right. Carry on. But the, the, but the information of what the next steps are and why they're doing this, you're not going to be able to find that out without raising suspicion. Well, and you can do that, but I can find us a place to stay. Yeah, how... we're stuck here for the night. Do you want to just wander around oh, and? Well, yeah, that, let's. No, let's I was do gonna that. be going I... around asking. Ayana and I will go find beds. You guys ask around, but be discreet about it. Buddy Wait, up. Ask around about. I know. What plan. We to... I know how to be discreet. The well, plan. Time to start learning. <laughs> I I said I know how to be discreet. Oh, I thought you said you oh, don't know. How. I I definitely uh. Let's let's just say discreet is not discreet and subtle are not words that have been used to describe me in the past. How would you rate your ability to be charismatic on a scale of three to twenty? Uh, twelve. Oh, that could be worse. Y yeah, but like you know, I punch things. I'd be rating mine at a seventeen. That's about it. Okay. Well. Valkyrie, you're at least. Never mind. Um, it's my charisma to intimidate. Yeah, that's not what we need right now. I uh, I can go and do it. There's no problem for me to do it. Joshua, Valkyria, are you two just kind of chill with coming with me and Ayana or staying here? Because I'm sure that Arth I Arthur's rather, not going to want I... to leave Luca alone. That's that's practically <sighs> off the table. So, 
I would yeah. rather go trying to figure did. out a way to get the prisoners out of here, but... Not sure we can do that. If we free the prisoners, we're not getting out of here alive. Or we find some way to make it look like we are meant to take them out. I'm, some sort of I, execution, maybe. I, I have thought of that, however, still mulling it around in my head, trying to figure out how I would phrase that. Because, oh, right. we're supposed to go execute these prisoners. On whose authority? We can't just keep using the whatever her name is. Mondath. Uh, Tiamat's authority, we of course. We can't remember her name. We can't, we can't just keep throwing the name Mondath around. We're going to draw her attention at some point and die. And the Rez Josh guy is spotty because the dude couldn't really remember his name. And something Prax is not a whole lot to go off of. You know, we only have to use it twice. We don't use it anymore until we get them out. And then we're out and we're free I guess the at that point. The other issue is the guys at the gate, we just introduced you as newcomers. Newcomers right. going on an execution trip on Mondath's orders? Initiation. You gotta be yeah. willing to, what, what to if, kill for us. What if that's not the initiation, though? Yeah, that's that would be a very awkward situation. If, we, if, we say it's if, like, if they say the it's initiation initi ceremony is just to like you know swear an oath or something, that, you want to go but what if something. that is the particular initiation that Mondath chose for us? Ayana's getting like visibly upset. Listen, no one's gonna die. That's this is obviously a falsehood, Ayana. You, if you're not able to con <laughs> control yourself, you can't go. No, not around. that kind of upset. Like she's getting angry. Why are you getting free? Uh, uh, Ayana, are you all right? I don't think you guys realize how bad this situation is. Do you see how many people are around us? And do you know how messed up Tiamat is? And I like start walking towards, you know, I start walking towards Arthur I, I, and I tower like a foot over her and I'm going to roll an intimidation. You need to get yourself in line and work together as a team. I am working my working together as a team. What do you think that I'm I doing? I like this. It's a good side of you. I think that's technically an insight, isn't it? To fight off intimidation. Out of wisdom uh, save. Yeah. Insight? insight? It's basically just oh, how Oh geez. my gosh! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I actually glare up at you. Like, what do you think that I'm doing? We're working together to try to figure this out. No, you're doing everything. You're just going off and trying to take on 120 people all on your own. I'm not trying to take anyone on. I'm trying to figure easy, out easy, a way that we easy, don't have to easy, take easy. anyone shush, on. Shush, shush, shush. We don't have the time to start bickering with each other. Yeah, can we keep it down, guys? Like, we're in, but we're in the freaking middle of the lion's den. Let's chill. Sit down. Jeez. Let's use this anchor. My, re the my reasoning, the reasoning that I've been given is the kind of reasoning that will keep us from getting in a fight. Somebody else quickly roll a d20 real fast. Oh no. <laughs> I'll let someone else do it. Oh, Joshua got okay. two before. Hey, Joshua. Okay. Wait. <laughs> All right. We've got, we've got to figure something out fast because we're just sort of standing here and we're probably drawing a little bit of attention. So. So right now, I guess... Think about what we've been saying. A possible execution where we are trying to be the initiate, we're trying to initiate ourselves in, and we have to go do it outside of the camp. Okay. That's you, what's on the table. You go try and we just wait until everybody goes right to bed now, and we sneak the few people out. We can take I don't there's, think, there's probably no, shifts. There's going to be a constant rotation of. of uh, there's probably of watch guards. shifts. Well, yeah, there's watch shifts, but it's easier than when everybody else is freaking awake. What, what time of night is it? Uh, at this point, after we were all... all the bickering that's been going on and getting in, probably around 10.30, 11. Does it look like people are beginning to bed down for the evening? Some are, yes. Uh, there's still a decent amount of activity. Right. Mostly cutting okay. kobolds because they can finally see. So here's what we're well, going to do. Arthur, well, Luca, that's... you guys try to, you try to be subtle and ask what the plan is. Arthur, er, right, of course. I Ayana, Joshua, Valkyria, and I will go over to the prisoners, ask them if they've been behaving, um, and um, or, well, no, don't ask what they're behaving. 
because then that's suspicious. Um, Don't go near the prisoners. I, I will. I we we will discreetly will watch. We will discreetly watch the prison pen for a little bit. Once you get back, then we'll take it from there. All right. I mean, I can I can kind of try to sneak off and. No. If, if you get caught, that's well, bad. Right now, right yeah, now we but if I get caught, I'll just sneaking. say I'm going pee and try and find a private place to go pee. Like, I don't know. Do you think you'll be able to keep something like that up? What? That I have to pee? He'll pee his pants. He'll do it. <laughs> I'll straight up wet myself. <laughs> Intim <laughs> intimidation check. Peeing your pants. Don't uh, you know what? <laughs> the... All right. Well, I mean, I'm cool with going along with you guys. I'm just, I can't try to check some stuff out. Ten, ten minutes. We'll come back here. Comes to it, Joshua. Get ready to pee yourself. And you're also finding pee. that was not. <laughs> That's not I hand you my water skin. Here, prepare. Start chugging. No, no. <clears throat> oh my gosh, you guys. And you'll be finding some place for us to rest, so that oh. we're not suspicious. Ugh. Right. <sighs> Um, yes, we will ask around for lodging. All right. <sighs> All right, meet, meet back here in 10. Don't be late. Who's... Who's... <sighs> okay. You and Luca are going. All right. Valkyria, would you like to come with us or go with them? I go with you. Okay. Okay. So I, I'm... We'll just for, like, theater of their mind, I'm... Like thinking that we're over here. Yeah, you guys are like, like over here and in, in okay. between these areas. Uh, okay, we will start with Arthur and Luca. Because that one could be more so, fun. All right, so Why go. did you come with us? There you go. I'll okay. be right back. Okay. Well, I was I was figuring that the campfire was over here. Yep. Oh, I see. Sorry. Okay. So, uh, what exactly are you doing? All right, I'm going up to them and saying, "So, we are newcomers, and we were impressed by what happened in Greenest, but we're just a little bit fuzzy on uh, the the big plan. Like, what's the what's the goal for us as members of this cult?" Man. I'm uh, just roll real fast. Just roll a d6. Okay. This determines his personality. Yeah. <laughs> personality traits. So he goes, uh, I honestly don't know. I was hired. Oh, all right. Uh, Do you know my... who I'd be talking to to find something like that out? I mean,. You talk to the big boss, they'll have the most info. But if you want to get trickle down of what <laughs> Sure, like have. that would yeah, but you know about the big the big people. They don't really like talking to us little people. Man. Resume well. But that's mostly just to make sure we're doing what she tells us. Right. Oh, if she doesn't have time uh, for us, who else would we be going to to find stuff like that out? Like, a I mean, little lower on the on the totem pole, like, so to speak. Pick a person. You have good odds that they're a member of your little club. But there are a few, okay. like me, who are just hired. Do you... Can you... Pick out the ones that were just hired. So I a can lot at least... of us. I mean, there's uh, names, and there's Brelan, Phelan, Bram, Esmond, Eve, Cyril, Anne, Davis. There's there's a fair amount of hires. Right. Well. Yeah. All right then. But there are lots of initiates like you, so careful. Some might try to lie to you. 
make them think oh. they're much bigger and badder than they are. R remind me again. I'm not. I'm not very good with names. I'm sorry. The the big one you named with the R. Resmir. Resmir. Yeah. She's the dragon lady. Dragon lady. Like she's she's actually full dragon. Man. Minus the wings, but the rest of it's there. Like, some of them dragonborn folks, but not quite. But scarier? A little bit. But I suppose that I should be thanking you. I mean, <sighs> any other questions I might be able to help you with while you've got my attention? Well, I guess... Do you know what the next steps are? Like, what what will they be drawing us in in terms of action? Are we staying here for a long time or moving someplace else? And last I heard, we're probably going to be picking up camp within the next month, maybe. Oh, a month. Man, we've Any more... Plenty of we can't just be staying here, though. Are the, the they have must have like other raids planned, right? I mean, yeah. Next, we'll. I need that city again. One second. Let me refine that city because I have forgotten. Ah, uh, I mean, we'll be heading south to Nashville next. Is what I was told, but things change. Greenness Why didn't go Nashville as smoothly. As... It's such a dingy little town. I mean, might not have a whole lot of anything, but what it does have is it has commerce, and commerce means treasure, and treasure means I get paid. Hard to argue with that. But, man, Rosemere divvies up what we take. Some of us get paid it. Some of us just get paid in standard gold. For me, I find coins most useful. So, not just any initiate can walk up to Rosemere and start asking questions like this. Probably not. <laughs> I mean, Resmir does a lot of everyday operations here. And um, as long as she isn't in the cave, and he just kind of gestures towards the back of the camp, you could pretty well find her. To be guarded, of course, but... Right. You can prove you have business there. I mean that's not that's not such a big deal. I'm not going there to kill her or anything. That would be insane. No, but the Just... guards could be a little hateful. Oh, that's fair. They're doing their job and they're doing it well. Yeah. Of course, certainly. Well, um I don't want to be, like, getting you any trouble. If I have other questions, though, would I be able to come back to you and, and ask them? He kind of looks around. As long as there's nobody else around me, no initiates or full-fledged members. And I have no reason to hide any secrets I know. Well, that's good to hear. Especially not Thank to you. somebody who's joining. You're going to learn most of them anyways. I think. I would assume. What do you mean? I would assume you'd learn most of these secrets. And if not, keep them to yourself. Oh. That's, that's fair. Because you never know if someone's going to be sneaking in trying to find out the, the secrets for themselves. I can't just... imagine what what that would do to this group. Well, I'm sure we don't have to worry about it too much. We've got 
half dragons or something, some such on our side. And there was a dragon, but there was a full dragon. Really? Yeah. Yeah. He attacked Greenus. Did you not see it? I mean, it was really you know, dark. Shooting lightning really... down at the buildings. Oh. Oh, that was what that was. I I honestly have no idea what I thought it was. You know, it just, you know, in the midst of the, the adrenaline rush, you just sort of concoct crazy things in your head about what's going on. Hey, he was here. He didn't seem to like being here. Didn't hang out too often. No idea where he went. Not my business, so he'll be back if he's needed. That's good to hear. Well then, thank you very much. And as you walk away, he holds up his hands with his fingers as far outstretched as he can. And then just goes back uh, to his I... Hold your hand. Okay. Sort of mirror it with a like a a sort of awkward smile of someone who's just learning the the new stuff about the group that they're that they're now a part of. And move on. I come uh, back over. I go. Fuck! This is gonna be so. You kind of start wandering back to camp and where you were said you guys were going to meet. And there you see a woman standing there. And we'll get back to that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The other door. Okay. What doing? All right. So. Ooh, wait, I wipe the bead the sweat off my forehead. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Once... Do I still look cool? Like you look great. Okay. Of course, right. is it hot in these robes? They are kind of stuffy. Joshua Valkyria, if you want to try and scope out prisoners while you walk to, I don't know, someone who looks like they know what they're doing. So keep your eyes out, peeled, see if guard rotation, any of the prisoners resisting anything. Just try and keep tabs on it while we walk around. So we'll start walking around, and oh, I want hello, hello. I want to look sorry. for another hello. Hello, we can hello. hear you. Hello, yes. Um, okay, sorry. I want to. Look... I have to step. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Nope. So, I have to step out for a second. Right. Um, DM, should I roll anything in regards to what he just told, like Valkyria, to do? And then you could work that out while I. No, nah, we'll for... we'll hit Colson, Ayana first, and see where that goes. Okay. If you don't hear from me, I'm hopefully it'll be quick, but it's a... Do you want me to be your designated roller if you don't come back in time? Come on, you don't trust me? <laughs> Are you... you almost got him killed so I many times. I did not almost get him killed. Campaign. I just made him roll really poorly on lightning bolts. I'll, I'll leave it to Meredith. I got you. All right. Yeah. Not that one, though. That one's in dice jail still. You guys wander, and... I, I want to look for an acolyte or... or no, because nobody's wearing robes or masks here. We took That's off our masks. We, yeah, we took off our masks. We still got our robes on. Um, Should we try it, to like fit in and is, just is like a is the, like are people flaunting their badge? Like they have their badge exposed, or is it not revealed? Make a perception check. Can I want to make this too? <laughs> yeah, you can take a look. <laughs> Looking around, I mean, dirty nat one. <laughs> I see there's, people. There's I see a lot of movement, a lot of people, and then even as like the movement dies down again, most of them being kobolds, they don't have a badge at all. Right. So it, it's hard to tell. Okay. Well, then I'll go up to. Is there anyone that looks like sort of confident or like they they they're full of themselves? I mean, there's a fair few people. Cool. I will go to the closest one. Uh, wait, no. Before nope. we do, I'm going to take off the robe and just be in my common clothes. Okay. Um, well, I guess I'll, I will also take off my robe, but... Are you going to do these sneakily, or are you just going to drop the robes where you stand? I mean, I'll, I'll keep them on Sneaky. me. Okay. 
Go ahead I'm, and roll I'm, a quick stealth check. I'm I'm still I'm still wearing my armor underneath. So I mean, it's not that you're getting naked. It's just uh, disrobing in the middle of a camp. I mean, I would like step to the side and. Yeah, try that's it. Why it's can, I, can, can I like be the? Can I be the the shower curtain for Ayana? Just like standing in front of her You're while she takes off the robe. <laughs> what do you mean I'm not big enough? I'm Arthur. the same height as her. No, I'm an inch taller than you. Close and even enough. then, she's still stockier than you. You know what? Get off my back, I'm a big Dad. girl. Uh, anyway, I take it but, off and I'm like, "Whew, that's better." Yeah, I mean, I take them off. It's relatively easy to just kind of duck behind a tent real fast to change. More of just a formality. Uh, but you guys step back out, and yeah, there's several people who just kind of look cocky and arrogant. Great. I want to go up to the closest one. Okay. You walk up to him and just kind of sitting there drinking and just like some throwing things at a kobold. Uh, I, don't know if this- I see you're enjoying yourself. Okay, we're going to do it anyway. Ah, very much so. Fair enough. I have some new initiates with me, and I need betting for them. Do you have any idea where I can contact someone or who to talk to in regards to finding a tent for the new ones? He just kind of takes a big drink and goes, Any of them look good? I mean, I've seen worse. There's this little one that's, that she's, uh, cute and crazy, just like our, and it, like, I hesitate for half a second, our dragon queen. He laughs, he goes, like that. She can bunk with me. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I wish you luck. She's, uh, it's kind of a pain, but. If you are willing to sh- shoulder the burden, all right. She does have a a lackey she normally keeps with her, so he want... doesn't get to come. No, he well, stay outside. She is quite insistent on staying with him, and unfortunately, I can't even get her to fall in line. So, I mean, if you've got something, all right, but I can't do it. I haven't been able to mm, see break her in, if you know what I mean. You gotta have some more force in your orders, or these initiates are gonna just knock you around. You know what? You're right. I should practice being more bold. But. As for the rest of them, there's. I am so uncomfy right now. (laughs) I'm I'm gonna try something. So, I'm gonna go and sit down next to him and just like genuinely strike up conversation and act like super interested and totally feed into his ego and like really empathize with him and get him to trust me and then go, no, but really, where's there's got to be one empty tent where we can toss all these newbies in. Okay. And I'm using my rustic hospitality for that. See if it works. Okay, make a quick charisma check as well. Okay. Oh my gosh, I am proficient in these things. Why yeah. am I now, this is it's just not kind persuasion? of persuasion. I mean, she's bluffing interest All and right. also trying to like go back and forth between this persuasion and perception. Um, uh, perception, perception. deception. All right. And either way, it would if even if you had proficiency, it's still only a ten. Yeah. Uh, and he just kind of laughs to himself and goes. There's an initiate's tent. But she's still invited to mine. I will pass that along to her and I nudge him. And like kind of finger guns. He he laughs and then throws another rock at a kobold. Ha 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 ha! The the (laughs) stupid kobolds! And I get up and walk away. Did you point us in the direction of the initiate's tent? You passed him. And just kind of points towards the front of the camp. Right. Sorry, I just... I came from up north, so I don't really know the layout of this camp. He just kind of stares at you for a while. Okay. And just kind of goes back to drinking. Fuck. 
Right, and I turn around and... <sighs> so I guess start walking that way. Right. Like back right. towards camp or back towards the initiate tents. All right. Uh, Brando, are you back yet? All right. Nope. Yes, I am Valkyria. <laughs> <laughs> Accurate. <laughs> um, evil stairs. Evil stairs. Uh huh. Oh. So. We lost JJ. No, no. I'm also Joshua. <laughs> no, JJ's here. Yeah, well, like he left. He left the game and then came back. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay, here we go. Okay. Anyways. Anyway, Valkyrie here. Yes. Uh, I need JJ here. I need to know if JJ's here. Well, he's not. He back. He's yet. just muted. He's in the game. Well, right, but he stepped away. From I've been muted this whole time. <laughs> 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 Aren't you glad I said something? <laughs> Have you been commenting on how creepy that dude was the entire yes, time? Yes, it's hard Re-intensifies. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, guys. I think I think I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna quit. I'm, done. <laughs> I'm, done. I'm, done. Oh, I, I'm gonna head out. <laughs> Fine. I'm here. I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, the best comment really boiled down to just went that went well, and I just <laughs> walked like rolled my eyes and turned around. <laughs> a century. All right, you, Joshua and Valkyria, uh, wandering towards the kind of prison of sorts, uh, which really isn't a prison. It's more, more just like just... an outdoor. They are shackled. Yeah, it's just yeah. a bunch of posts with a bunch of people. Sh- to them. Uh, and like I said, there's four guards just kind of sitting around at the moment, just kind of BSing and talking to each other. There's four of them? Yes. Um, are, are they humans? Just uh, the guards? Yes. Yeah. Or. How- Humanoid, how, pretty much. How big are they? they? They range. There's five and a half, six foot, like a little over five and a half, and another one that's a little over five and a half. They're all like moderately sized. Okay. Um, and they aren't even like standing or patrolling, they're just like sitting in chairs. Right. I was wondering, uh, I, I wander over to them, uh, to the guards. Just kind of look up at you and go, can I help you? Listen, I'm new here, and, uh, between you and me, this place is pretty freaking boring, right? Uh, I was wondering, you guys do any, like, exhibition matches, you know, like, Fights. I mean, there are small sparrings during the day when there's more participants and bigger bets. But unfortunately, typically asleep during the day, don't get to see it. Well, I mean, I'd be willing to fight somebody if we get something together. Yes, and I love watching fights. You don't have to. And gambling. You don't have to do this. <laughs> you really don't. It's too yeah, late. Uh... Meredith, your Ayana is showing. <laughs> <laughs> and gambling. I gotta look at each other and laugh. I go, Nish, you want to try to face one of, us? one of us? I mean, if you're down... <laughs> yeah. gonna laugh. Let's stand up and go. Eh, why not? Let's see. We need a good. We need a good open space. Is there a better? Is there anywhere away 
from where it's like right next to the prisoners they are like i want to see if there's like any way where i can kind of drag them away a little bit from where the prisoners are uh two of the guards don't move only two okay. of them stand up okay got it and they just kind of go and they point about 30 feet over to a clearing right over there yeah that sounds good should we uh should we get some more people to, to watch take some bets make it interesting uh, i'm feeling about this i think i just started laughing and one of them grabs a prisoner and goes, I bet this one. You bet that one, huh? Ah. You win. You get to kill him. I win. I do. Oh, oh that oh. sounds fun. Uh, all right. Yeah, sure. Why not? Uh, uh, do I recognize the, the person? Uh, roll a I detail. Swear. I was gonna say, freaking say intelligence too. Hey man, you're the one who decided to dump your intelligence. Uh, this person, you don't. Okay. No. Uh, dual stretch. Do we see this? Do I on and I see this? Uh, no, you were. No, alone. and we're talking still, okay. probably. Yeah, you're in a different part of the camp entirely. Uh, it just kind of stretches and goes, I presume you want to use weapons? Uh, I mean, I'm more of a hand-to-hand -hand guy, but I got the stick. You can do sticks. I got do sticks. Stick. Picks up uh, a little post from the ground. Get yeah, biggie stick. <laughs> Biggie smash. Biggie, smash. <laughs> Biggie. All right. Real fast. Real quick match. Oh, let's have some fun. Uh, let me do something real fast. Okay. Uh, I didn't expect this route. <laughs> I mean, it worked know, well last session. But you know, it's not entirely surprising. I do one thing. Punch, punch things. Punch real good. And not That's know it. things. I don't Cause, know cause, things. Because lol punch. intelligence minus two. All right. Um... I'll say you guys start 10 feet apart. And we'll throw you over here real fast. Oh. 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 Dark. oh, yeah, you guys can't see. It's okay, don't let us see. You don't uh -huh. need to. I mean, it's just, it's it's going to be real boring. <laughs> yeah. Be <laughs> the token, yeah, the token is not going to be. Let's get some be... battle music playing. Yeah, we'll get some quick battle music. I haven't played really any. Yeah, there hasn't been music playing this whole time. Oh, he turned off. Dang it. Battle music. <gasps> oh, there's drums. Oh, no. Oh, the, but Josh Owen gets a chance to... Oh, I need to add your initiative. Uh, add turn. I didn't. I didn't roll yet. Oh, you... Didn't. That was the D10, my bad. Oh, oh it is. It's the same thing. Okay. Uh, he goes first. Uh, and he runs up to you. And he's gonna pop, pop with his stick. Pop, pop! First one's a 17. Yep, that is. You take one point of bludgeoning damage. Perfect. Second attack. Pop. That's a natural one. All right, that's it. His turn. <laughs> I just like a hit and I go, oh, that was cute. That definitely hits. Uh, okay. 
flurry of blows. Give him a good weapon. Okay. That hits. Uh, deck save to stay on your feet. Oh. DC 12. 14. Hits. Uh, strength save or be pushed 15 feet. Alright. Strength. That's a 4. 5, 10, 15. Yeah. Man, just watching this black void is like, oh! The fight's basically over. <laughs> I just go, I just like crack my neck and I go, Ugh! He just oh, kind of rolls his shoulders and go, ah, and runs straight up to you uh, once more. And it's going to attack number one. That's an 18. Yep. Two points. And he's going to use his fanatical advantage. Oh, no. Uh, his what? <laughs> fanatical advantage. You take 16. Uh, no, not 16. It's a 16 to hit. Oh, dude, I was like, bro, what? <laughs> Yeah, I was like, you take 16? Bro, <laughs> no. Bro! The damage isn't far off. What? Okay. You take 12 points of bludgeoning damage. Oh, nice. Because he just smacks you in the head real good. Bonk. It's Nipper reincarnated. He just. The bonkening has returned. Bonk. Your turn. Did you? He rolled. He did? The 21 5 is? No. Oh. That's. That hits. Did you? We can't hear you, bud. He's dead. Unless you went non lethal. No, I would go non lethal. I'm not gonna, <laughs> I'm not gonna straight murder this guy. Yeah, he that, is. Would, that would be a bad look, I feel. Yeah, probably. <laughs> ah, you. you... Knock him out, and he falls to the ground. And his buddy's laughing. All right, all right. <laughs> you sure showed him. <laughs> oh, man, that last hit was good. Woo! <laughs> As he's bleeding from his scalp. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my, my face is just like... <laughs> Uh, he goes, all right, I'll bring him to his quarters. You can kill the prisoner and just drags him off. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, can, I, can I cash that in tomorrow? I'm not. I want to really enjoy it. I'm a little tired. No, uh, he's going to go, all right. Works for me. Neat. And they just uh. kind of kick him back. To his, onto his butt instead of standing. At this point, I'm just gonna motion to Valkyria to like head back to the, to the thing, to the group, I guess, back to where. Uh, okay. All right. Uh, back to Arthur and Luca. You arrive okay. to see a woman. Uh, just kind of standing there looking at you. Uh, she is wearing God, these dark purple robes. No! And looks at you too and goes, Well, I know one of you. And points to Luca and goes, You were in greenest, yes? Uh, yeah, yes. She nods and goes, You're not going to lie to me, are you? Why would I do that? She kind of leans in and kind of half whispers, Because I know you're not with me. As three other guards kind of walk up behind her, she goes, No, you're free to surrender. Or we'll make you surrender. Sh 
shit. And she t turns to you, I think, and goes, Now, you look an awful lot like him. Do you know him? Uh, he's my brother. Hmm. Good to know. Capture her, too. Do you, either of you, resist? Resist. Hmm. Debating doing something stupid. That's the quote of the night. <laughs> Should I <laughs> do this go. dumb thing? The, there, there's the episode title, Debating Something Stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Unlimited feet or debating something stupid. Arthur's not going to do anything if it means that her brother's so So you surrender? Yeah, I surrender. Yeah. One of the guards immediately starts stripping you of your weapons and binding your hands. Oh dude, I thought you were about to say immediately starts stripping her and I was like, Bro, what? <laughs> this is getting really inappropriate. No, no. You walked into the wrong the cult. Like you. <laughs> he said, only one creepy guy. This isn't the cult of the dragon. The cult of the sex dungeon. The, the, Those uh, are the same thing. Yes. Yeah, what? Thing. The cult, cult of the bad dragon. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Anyways. You got there. Anyways. Hate that. Uh, so yeah, they start binding you and removing your weapons from you. Uh, Luca. I'm just gonna drop my staff and say, "Do as you will." They bind you as well. And they start dragging you. Uh, oh, I, I would just follow willingly. Okay. Well, they're just kind of pushing and pulling you along uh, to uh, where the prisoners are held. <laughs> which, Jasho, you would, and Valkyria would pass them as they are walking towards there. I glance over at Joshua and I just give a slight shake of my head. I just look over as like I'm bleeding from my face, just like uh <laughs> I start I start walk like speed walking towards where the rest of like the last place I saw the rest of them. Okay. Uh, eventually everybody meets up. Back at the campfire. Oh, she's not gonna. Her. She's not gonna talk at us anymore. It's just I mean, to get us arrested, get, and that's it. Once you get to the prisoner, she just kind of looks you over and goes, "All right," and turns to the two guards, confused that two of them are now missing, and goes, "Keep them here. They'll be executed in the morning," and walks away. Do I get back to where the rest of them are? By the, yeah, you guys all arrive back to the little campfire that you guys were like, this is our home base. And everybody's there except for Kolf, not Kolf, uh, Arthur and Luca. I just look at it. Where'd they go? Oh, hey, have, you seen, uh, have you seen Luca and Arthur? Yep. Where? Yeah, where? Are uh, they okay? With the prisoners. Oh, they are like prisoners. they didn't go talk they, to the other people? They are prisoners. Oh, they, they are prisoners. They are prisoners now. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's real fun. Also, I, uh, I want to fight. That's great. Uh, I won the right to execute a prisoner tomorrow. Okay, so do we pick... Arthur or no, Luca? No, unfortunately, <laughs> we already. Unfortunately, I already picked the prisoner. Well, I didn't really pick the prisoner; they picked for me. So I don't. But it's not looking good. Did I hear them say like they are going to be executed on the way over, or did I did that? Not you happen? wouldn't have been there. She mentioned it when they were when like, they were at the place, right? 
Yeah, so it's not looking great. So they're prisoners, and now we have to kind of move our timetable up. The good news is, there are only two guards now. Okay. Uh, so, we are gonna have to do something tonight. How many people were at the front of the camp? Uh... There were about five guards who stopped you both times. So five in the first one, five in the second one. That are acting as like sentry in some way, shape, or form. Wait, you said five guards? Th there's five guards in the middle guards. and five guards at the front? Yeah. Oh. So. so a total of ten. A yeah. total of ten that are acting as sentry. So active we sentry. need to figure out a way to get them out of here, obviously. Yeah. Excuse me. Uh, what's the DM? I don't have dark vision. Humans uh, don't have dark vision. Most of the camp is relatively well lit up. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Usually. What are the what are the walls looking like? How visible are the cliff faces? I mean, most of them are pretty cast in shadow. Uh, so I mean. You stare at it long enough, you can probably start to see things in it. In yeah. terms of visibility. Um, I was thinking maybe we could, like, climb the wall somewhere. Tie, like, tie up a bunch, bunch of rope, but I don't think we have 150 feet worth of rope. And then try to get him out, like, up the wall, but that's probably not going to work. Yeah, that's too much rope. Okay. Here's the plan. We wait for Mondath. I'm assuming that this is Mondath. Who's Mondath? No, that was that was the, the Res purple... That was Resmir, wasn't it? That was Re thought Res Mondath was the purple. No. Road person. The Red Res Res whatever was the black dragon lady with purple robes. Oh. Um. In either way, you what? have no idea who it is. Yeah. We weren't there, but whoever took them. Well, it's it's late at night. It might not look suspicious if all the guards just fell asleep. Yeah, just just a little a little sus. My original idea was that we could use sleep at the front guards to just sort of get out, but. There are guards between the, the them and the front, between us and the front. So. Oh damn! Did I see where they took my weapons? Uh, they just had them on them, and when they walked away. So you. And they just they just full up walked away. They're not guards at the. Nope. Well, there's still two. Me. The guards right, that but took... I am weaponless. Yes, you are in fact weaponless. The weapon does not did not stay. They wandered off somewhere. Alright. Okay, but there's still there's just two guards in front of the prisoners. Yeah, there are two guards for the prisoners right now, because the other two left. Well <sighs> ready to try a prison break? I'm we're gonna always die. ready if to we, try a prison, if prison break, break and die. I spit out some blood. Just... But before we do that, here, and I hand you one of the healing potions. Oh no, that's fine. I'm, is it? I'm not going to be able to heal you and All and right. Luca is gone. I heal ten. Or, sorry, eight. Yeah. Well, it's 2d4 plus two, by the way. Yeah, eight, sorry. Yeah. Right. So, as you guys are coming up with a plan of how to save your newly captured compatriots, we're gonna end it there. No! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No. I'm. I'm so tired. Man, oh. It's getting late. Okay. All right. Uh, that's appropriate. Wait. Yeah, right as you get back. Hey, find it back. <laughs> you didn't miss anything, though. 
I well, I heard everything. I was yeah. listening. I just couldn't. Oh see yeah, but you didn't miss the action. Yeah. Okay. Well. Well. All right. Well, thanks for um, watching. All right. Yeah, thank yeah, you for watching. Yeah. Thank you to those of you that are still here. Steve, you're a real G. Been here the whole time, and that's super hype. Yeah, um, boy. So thank you all for showing out tonight. We're gonna. We will definitely be streaming again next week, same time, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Um, pick up at session three. We're contemplating playing some games in the middle of the week next week. If, you know, if we do decide that, it'll be on our Twitter. Um, so be sure to give that a follow. And uh, if worse comes Magic to worse, oh, and TV. remind us. I already yeah. I put the I Magic put the Twitter mystery. in the the chat in is. It has the Twitter in it. I, I oh, you put it. the chat, or you put the Twitter, which is Magic Mischief put, TV, TV, in the chat. Yeah. yeah, the Twitter has been posted. I'll I'll post it. Through, uh, like it, it appears that it's dotted out. What? It appears that it is dotted okay. out. It's linked in our oh, profile. So it's linked in our profile. Don't put the at sign. It's linked don't in our. Don't put it, the at sign when you put it in. It's linked just in our profile. Technical difficulty. You can just go to the Magic profile. Magic Mischief and, <laughs> TV. Yes, Magic Mischief TV. Do the thing. <laughs> So oh, are you not allowed to post links in this chat? Probably not. I'll have to work on that. Mod me, fool. All right. Yeah, so I, I think you... in the meantime, we will see the rest of you next week. Bye. Good, good night. Thanks. Bye. Or good morning.